There's gonna be a lot of that. So just okay. be aware. I will directly say Priscilla if I need to ask you anything. There's you. That's your face. Just gotta flip this cord. What is up, Ryan? Hello. Hello, Ryan. We have a couple... A couple extra people here today. I have Pikachu. And we have Priscilla. But she is... Not... It's, it's fine. How are you today, Ryan? How are you doing? Right? Were we here? He says, "Oh hi." Oh hi, oh hi, Ryan. That's that's her. There she is. She's real. She exists. I they promise. Oh, was Ryan there when I? They they met you, but they only heard your voice. Oh, okay. They didn't see your face. So I couldn't be like, "Look at that thing." You destroyed the Kibo. Oh, what have you done? And we have a little Pikachu here too. It's my son. And this is the worst girl. Fun fact, worst girl. I will stop distracting. I'm not watching. Okay. Just ahead. Okay. 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 I'm ready to go though, Ryan. Okay. I know it's really long, right? It's okay. I'm just kind of skipping through. There's a lot of there's a because. lot of things. Fun to culprit among the people in our groups during the class trials. That's why we couldn't work together even if we wanted to. This time it's different. <gasps> We're together without any doubts, I still don't trust you, Samugi. Ah. The, uh, the video I saw, I saw one video that was like five and a half hours. So, we will see. We will see. But I'm just gonna skip through a lot of stuff. Um. Plus Kibo, who's coming later. Sorry. Oh gosh. I'm just gonna skip through, just do the trial. We're gonna do it, it's gonna be fun. Everyone! Thanks for waiting. That was fast, Kibo! His weapons have been removed. Gosh darn it. What? Well. It's not that. Everyone! What are you sorry for, Kibo? Bowed at the waist <sighs> to us. Yes. Everyone! Very, very sorry. What? Um uh, not to give up okay. hope. I... Realize that you were right. My inner voice! <gasps> oh he's fixed! His little thing's back. He's fixed! Let's freaking go! Makoto, speak to him! What is his inner voice exactly? What does he hear? He hears... He hears... The boy, he hears Makoto! I'm gonna try to destroy everything just to avoid losing despair! Even if I'd fall through, there would've been no hope or future left after I could beat you. You're not gonna sit down. You're gonna sit down. Actions would have merely resulted in a different despair altogether. Oh, don't cry, Kibo. Don't, don't cry. Yes. I'm. <laughs> Happy Maki is good Maki. Yes. Oh gosh. Let's click. What? Mm, that's fine. Hmm. 
Why does she suck? She sucks, and I hate her. Hey everyone. Maki, I've been meaning to ask you, but... What is that vacuum cleaner? Oh yeah, she still has the bug thing. Yeah, we are, Ryan. It's fine. It's fine. I see. She's only gonna be here for a couple of, a couple hours too, so it's good. We all go. Okay. Clue something. Don't catch bugs. There aren't any bugs. <sighs> so let's just go to his imagination. It might be too soon to determine that. Wait until I've examined it with my eyes. With your eyes. Does he have like a new function that we don't know about? Um, what do you mean, Kibo? Yeah. Zoom function? Zoom function. Yes. This is the jetpack and the rocket launcher. Huh? Hudfoam! But... <clears throat> Whoa. Kibo's done it. He is the best boy. I also. My talent is possible that I can save you all. Leave Take it the to me. Back. Maximum zoom. Zoom. Stared at it intensely. Do I get to look? Oh. I see it. I'll print out this memory. Oh, shut up. I hate that. <laughs> Ryan, no. <laughs> Printed a picture. Huh? This is Monokuma. They're cameras. Yes. They're cameras. They're cameras. Hey. They're cameras. Well then. Huh? Why don't we ask them Leave to talk to, to this augmented hearing function? What was that? Oh my goodness. Start talking now, or I'll squish you one by one. Whatever function you serve, you'll be unable to carry it out. Do you accept these terms? Kiwa asked in a way that made it clear it was not up for negotiation. <clears throat> they call themselves Nanokumas. Apparently they're members of the Monokas. What? This little thing? Then there were actually six Monokas? Not quite. These don't exist as individuals. Oh no. Neither as a hive mind. Oh no. They travel through the air in a swarm, covering every square inch of this campus. I do not like this. It's not just what, it's a whole swarm of mono cubs. If they're that small, they could have been in my nose or mouth, and I'd never know. Yes, thank you for the I don't like the thought of that. And their function is to record footage of the events that are unfolding here and transmit it to Monokuma. Interesting. What? Using their tiny cameras, they record footage and transmit it wirelessly. Mother Kuma receives the footage and parses it before sending it off to Monokuma. Who invented the tiny cameras? I don't know. Who knows at this point, man? You mean, like a security camera? Also, then, that doesn't make sense. How would Monokuma not know the Chapter 5 outcome if he has these things watching everything? That doesn't make sense. So small, they can't be seen with the naked eye. They must be the security cameras. The sixth mono cup. <laughs> Why are we calling it that? That's not what it is. There's security cameras that can record the footage. Correct to use the electro bot. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, that makes sense. They couldn't send any footage back. You're right. Doubt Monokuma knew the real culprit. Yeah, kind of same. No matter how many times he reincarnates. Thank you. Thank you, Himiko. He's toying with us, he's not confident. Wait, 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 he's not just confident. He's sure he's gonna win. I know that he must what he's thinking. Oh yeah. We know an important detail, and I'm glad you told us thank before you. the class trial. Yes, thank you, Kibo. Everyone thank you, Kibo. We should get going now. Let's do it. That's fine. Okay. Let's go. It's time for the trial. Oh, the music. Kicked in right away. He doesn't have arms anymore. How's he supposed to do the thing if he doesn't have- Oh! Well, that'd be how, isn't it? Time for the trail, Ryan. Yes, the trail. Oh! Oh, goodness. We're in for a long, long time here, aren't we? Long, long, 
long time. Hope you didn't need to be anywhere tomorrow morning, Ryan, because uh, it's going to be late for you. Alright, let's go. There's no point in worrying right now. We only need to think about getting out of here alive. But the destroy ultimate cavity behind us. Head to the final trial ground. You don't have work tomorrow? Dope. Last such fires, the elevator brought us down. We could be waiting for the five of us. I'm sure this is the end of despair. The beginning of hope. Everything ends here. Everything. Killing Gabe of Hope's Peak Academy. The Killing Gabe of Jabberwock Island. Killing Gabe of this ultimate academy. How much more until they're satisfied. This is the end of it. I'm tired of this. We're going to end it. We're going to end this cruel game. Oh, what the? It's Final Trial Grounds. Oh yeah, I forget I could do this. Is it not up to you or me to decide whether or not this is the end? What do you mean? Well, or the Future Foundation? Yeah, right, the killing game of the Future Foundation. More importantly, since you guys requested that we hold this class trial, I'm sure you won't mind allowing me to participate too, right? right? It'll be easier to argue if I do. That's true. True, I was gonna have you participate this time, but I didn't think you'd volunteer. What is it? You seem confident. <laughs> With my magic. You're confident now, but I'm gonna turn your body into an omnibus. Himiko never ceases to amaze Actually, me. Oh my gosh, shut up. Everyone shut up, I just wanna get to the thing. I don't wanna get to the thing! I'm sorry, I'm skipping everything, I just wanna get to the thing. <laughs> They're participating too. Interesting. What kind of dad would I be if I hopped the spotlight? What use are any of you? With this button, I. Mm hmm. What's that button for? Oh, interesting. You just explode them. Your kids are cute, but a bomb. You stupid. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm just skipping. I just. Ah! Oh, absurd. You really are the worst. You're getting it. I'm the best at being the worst, don't you think so? <laughs> Tell ya, people can't get enough of my crude antics. Let's do it. Let's get it started. Free and ready. Free and ready, Brian. Free and ready, go. Yeah, sure. I just did that, but sure. I like that even the game is like, no, dude, you're gonna wanna save. You can, you can be here a while. You, you gonna wanna do this. <laughs> hey, skills. I think I have more. Nope, I just have one. Alright. I think this is all good, though. I don't, I don't have anything else I can do. Am I ready? I don't know. I wanna just scroll through what all these are really quick. I'm not gonna read them all, but... Screw through them all. History of Oaks Peak. That they said they were. They, they said they um, applied to come to the school, and the thing said that no one applied. The only way to admit this by being scouted. Kokichi's dum dum. We already know this. Killing game is a thing. Very similar to what Junko had. Mysterious messages. Rantaro's video. Go project. Bugback has the thing. Mother of Kuma, freak shop a ball with the pink fiber that clearly didn't kill Rentaro. Someone else killed Rentaro. It's a little sketchy. Survivor's perk of Anapa with the clue to end the killings. Morning Kuma needs a spare girl, the mastermind of the library's hidden room. First thing I remember was the ultimate hunt. Hidden door in the library. Clues of the mastermind. Flashback light reverts. I don't. That one seems weird, but we'll go. We'll get there. Uh, four category types. Survivors had weird stuff. Yeah, the survivors had weird stuff. It's fine. She won't be here for the full thing, Ryan. And also, I don't think she'll care. <laughs> uh, the six mono cub. The six mono cub. All right, let's freaking go. Let's do it. Intermission. What? Or did it say in session? 
Oh, it said in session. Yeah, okay. Everyone, cool. Cool. I'd like to okay. begin by asking Shuichi a question. Since this class trial was his idea, what exactly is the point of this class trial? Kinda same, though. I know we have to do it, but... Yeah! Why are we having a class trial if no one dies? Whoa! My voice was way louder than I expected. I might be on a roll today. Hey, I don't know I'm no slouch of being a loud mouth either! Me too! You know that was quiet. Monica's voice is super soft, though. Everyone cool with him getting blown up? No. You said that the killing game would end if you exposed the truth at the class trial. <laughs> so, you bastards, what is the purpose of this class trial? Oh, that's a good question. Right? If someone somehow dies in the middle of the trial, well, if someone dies in the middle of the trial, it'd be the same rules as if they died after another death, right? Like, it would just be Monokuma essentially said they don't matter. But, like with Tenko's death, if, if there had been a different killer for Angie, Tenko's killer wouldn't have mattered. But, um... This one's different, so I don't know. But his Couldn't voice tell you. Quiet. I think you can connect your phone to that too, if you want. Does Lord's Warrior not matter at all? Yeah. Prips' class shot. Alright. I'll give you an answer. The reason I called for this trial is... Curse's class trial is to... Retry a past case. That's it? Yeah. Rantaros. Yeah. I wish oh, to gosh. retry a past case. Oh gosh. A retrial? For which case? The first one. The murder of Rantaro Amami. I've found new evidence relevant to the case. In light of that evidence, I demand a retrial. What's the point of a retrial? The result of the first class trial has already been settled. Yeah, yeah. Sonia commented on your dog tier list. Sonia as in like the voice actress or Sonia as in like the person on Reddit who's pretending to be Sonia. Far <clears throat> vote was wrong. Yeah. Wrong. Monokuma said the blackened for that incident was Kaede. Are you saying he was wrong? Oh yeah, Kaede. That's funny. What did she say? Whoa, 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 whoa. Monokuma, your reactions are too extreme. It's making the rest of us look bad. Oh, oh shit! He's already got the detonator. You, I don't think you can connect it. I think you have to take it out. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's, it's weird. I don't like how they do that, but... She said she always has a light weight. That's nice. To test the validity of our vote. Are we really gonna do this, Shuichi? The entire case. A whole thing? If Monokuma was wrong, the validity of these trials would be in question. The entire killing game wouldn't make sense anymore. I see. You think you can destroy the game by calling out my failure? About a detonator. What's up, there, girl? What you doing? The one about the detonator. Hold on. Oh, oh shit! He's already got the detonator. <laughs> that is pretty good. Why is someone lurking in the shadows? It's Priscilla. It's my girlfriend. Hi. He's here to just kind of be here. I'm here. We were hanging out. You shouldn't have a problem with this. If you have nothing to hide, Monokuma. We went to the mall today. So we and stuff. we got the first case has become the a friend. Yet again. He says hi. Ryan so also says hi. What an Thanks for the cookies. Twist. What, what okay. are you saying about cookies? Let's do this. I didn't give you any cookies. So what is this new truth? There are several. But before we go any further, I want before to we go any further. Talent. Who else says that? Does Makoto say that? I think Makoto said that in Did the first game. Did you learn what his talent was? Oh, yeah, the one she brought when you were sick. He says, thanks for the cookies. Wait, what? Oh! The other Snickers. Yeah, the other ones. He says it was very nice of her. Child's ultimate talent it was a mystery, but now I know. He's the ultimate survivor! That's it! He's the ultimate quiz master. He 
was the ultimate survivor. Ultimate survivor? Yeah, you know, like the show. He said so in his video. Flashbacks. Survivor perk. Rantaro became the ultimate survivor after surviving a past killing game. After his memory Which is why I think he's involved he participated in this in a killing one. game once again. So this wasn't Rantaro's first killing That's game? That's literally what I just said. Why did he participate in a second killing game? Well, I don't think it was his choice. I'm not sure yet. Or was it? But after I learned Actually it was, because he was learned he survivor, did the perk. He knew I that was a thing. His objective. Rantaro's objective? The reason he went to the library before he was killed. And why he knew about the hidden door. He does. I mean, that makes sense if he was already in a killing game, but it's alluded to in his FDs. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we'll, we'll learn about it. Didn't he just happen to randomly notice the hidden door? No, he knew it was that's there. That's what I thought at the time. But it appears that assumption was false. There was an actual reason Rantaro knew about the door. The Survivor's Park. Coincidence. Thank you, Shuichi. That's it. That's it. Rantaro was given this monopad as a kind of survivor perk. <laughs> it has a map of the entire academy, including areas that have not yet been unlocked. Mm. Look at everything. It's all there. Of course, that includes the hidden room. To think Rantaro was given that as a survival perk. He found out about the hidden room with this map? The monopad also contained a video Rantaro recorded for himself. This is all we already knew all this, so I'm just kind of reviewing, but meh. Yeah, yeah I, I know. If the mastermind <laughs> ever needed a spare Monokuma, they would head to the hidden room. The message was what inspired him to go to the library to investigate the hidden room. <laughs> Time limit. Yeah. Oh, from the Monokuma making machine. I forgot about that. So in order to figure out who the mastermind was, Rantaro went to the hidden room at the back of the library just before time ran out. That's right. Rantaro must have come to the same conclusion that Kaede and I did. Sure is ironic that the ultimate survivor but he did because of Kaede's trap. He didn't. But if Rantaro had a clue like that, mm -hmm. why didn't he come to us with it? I assume because he didn't trust us. The killing game had just started, after all. I was still wearing that shady hat. What he said in his video message certainly didn't help, either. He told himself to only share this information with people he could trust. That's fair. He didn't have any recollection of filming this message, right? That means he must have had trouble. I don't like that they're showing well. me the, the the like written message every time they say video message. It was probably because that's not a video. That's too. a written message. That's why he didn't consult us. Well, uh, face. <clears throat> Blah blah blah. My memory part of it. If it is, then can I even trust myself? He didn't know if he could trust that video, or trust us, or even trust himself. He must have been so lost. But with the time limit approaching, he decided to take a chance. Man, this game. And you didn't. You didn't. You died. It was blah blah blah. Chapter one. Blah blah blah. 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 So we went to the library alone without telling anyone. Those are my favorite flashbacks with Shuichi flashbacks. Kaede's point of view. Those are great. And then he got killed by Kaede's trap. The only people who knew about the hidden door at that time were Rantaro and I. I had Kaede with me, and I thought I could trust her, so I told her about the hidden room. 
That was the difference between me and Rantaro, I suppose. I had Kaede. But now you don't trust her. And Kaede's the one who killed him! Which I think is garbage. What a snake! Look, he said it, not me. That's the only time in game anyone's ever called someone a snake. I'm just saying. I, I'm just saying, he said it, not me. Call my girl a snake. Hey, so what I'm are just you saying. talking about? Is this something I forgot? I don't know anything about what they're saying. Is this something that transpired <clears throat> before? No, no, before? hush, Ryan. No, no. So what's your point? <clears throat> you know who Rantaro was and why he did what he did. But it's pointless now, isn't it? No, it's not pointless. Now that we know this new information, if we look back at Rantaro's case, we can find a new truth that we missed at the time. Yes. Let's do it. A new truth? I don't really get it, but we just need to look at Rantaro's case again, right? Then let's do it. Let's do it. Yes, let's do this together. Oh, hush, Dirtswood. You guys are rats. Magical powers. I'll turn Monokuma into an omnibus. <laughs> Circle, thank you, Ryan. Technically, it's an infinite number of points. But I guess we're gonna if you really want to get nerdy Monokuma. with it, but, uh. Not too sure either, but the real battle's just beginning. Prove the result was wrong. Corner the mastermind again. I'm ready for this. Rantaro went to the library. Be quiet the and listen. Time limit expired. Like that. Using the information provided by the survivor perk. What was that? Way to the hidden door. To expose the identity of the mastermind. Nope, that wasn't it. Never mind. Sorry, sorry. My mouse is acting a little bit dumb today. I, it's kind of bogging me. Rantaro went to the library. Just before Monokuma's time limit expired. Using the information provided by the survivor bird, he made his way to the hidden door. To expose the identity of the mastermind. But before he could achieve that goal, he got hit in the head with a shot put ball. Oh, God. That's true. I think that's true. Because of Kaede's fully automatic killing <clears throat> machine. They're fully automatic? There was no culprit at the scene. The only one in the library at the time of the murder was Rantaro himself. Is it that one? Oh, it is that one. Okay, interesting. Oh, Ryan, same, same. Sour candy's my jam. No, Rantaro was not the only one in the library at the time the murder occurred. Let's freaking go. This survivor perk monopad is proof of that. Why would that monopad be evident? Because it wasn't near his body. The monopad was given exclusively Ugh. to Rantaro as his survivor perk, correct? But when we searched Rantaro's <laughs> body, he didn't have it on his person. He only had his student handbook monopad. Which means that someone took this monopod. They're gonna be like, oh, you don't know that. You could have faked it. They can't. Oh, gosh. I have a sword fight with them. Can I up the voices? Yeah, I could do that. Hold on. I'll just down the music, because the music's a little loud. Oh, it's not what I wanted. I can't up the voices, but I can down the music. Do you want me to up the whole game, or just that should be good? What? Been saying. what? Uh, keep quiet, will you? I don't have time for your nonsense right Go, now. go, Shuichi. Really? I have no clue what anyone is talking about. If we don't chime in soon, Pops is gonna push the detonator. <laughs> the detonator. So we better not let these fucking chumps run their mouths anymore. Oh, hush. There was a reason you died in chapter 4. Useless! Hidden door in the library, done. You should wash it right away! No, Rantaro's. Final picture of Rantaro. 
Someone stole the survivor perk monopad? Where's the proof? No way there's a bloody thief! Okay, let's go. But remember, up the game a little? Okay, I'll do that after this. Perk monopad to the library. If it's missing now, that must mean someone stole it. It feels like it's going really slow. I think there's maybe no way that's possible. All he had on him was the student handbook mono pack. He didn't bring the suit. Got it. I'll cut through your words. Okay, hold on for a sec. Let me up the game a little bit. Boop, 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 boop. Flip. No, is that better? There is no doubt Rantaro brought the survivor perk monopad <clears throat> to the library. That might be a little too loud, you know. The picture taken just before he died clearly shows him holding it. It does. Give me his student handbook monopad, bro. You fucking know. What's up, Adam? You missed not much. No, it was just started. The same monopad. You see the way the blood is dried here? You don't think someone would have washed it off? Of like, matches how he was if you're trying to hide picture. yourself, that seems like a weird... I don't know. I guess they weren't prepared for Kibo to blow oh, up the right. school, but... Shortly after this photo was taken, Rantaro was struck in the head by the shot put ball. Also, I'm gonna take the Chapter 5 method, where I just save after every major mini game that's gonna take a lot of time to repeat if I... if it crashes. Just in case, because I don't want the game to crash. Probably won't. But it might. Do you think that's when this bloody outline on the monopad was formed? Yeah, I the, do. The virtual world. That's why the monopad <laughs> Rantaro was holding in this picture. Has to be the same monopad we have now. What? What? Look like we're not paying attention. Scream all you want! Monoske is the one that's gonna get blown up! Oh, thank goodness. Bless up. Ah, thank goodness. Get that thing out of here. <laughs> I was so upset my cute cubs lost that my finger slipped. Good. But those were some pretty fireworks. Even in death, my kid's a real cutie. I hear lions push their cubs into um, bottomless ravines to kill them. I don't think they do that. I, I don't they think they do. Kill them. So there was a thief, huh? I can't believe someone would do something so evil. So who took the monopad? Do you know anything else? Oh, the car time? It's car time, all right. Lions don't do that. Even sad or the second. Oh, let's give me a break. Mono Kid's the worst. He's the worst of all of the Mono Cups. What is this image? Is it? Is it? Is it Kibo? I mean, it has to be Kibo blowing something up, right? How many monopads did Rantaro have in the library? Can't two! No one was crying over Kaide, it was all of the pit of all the monopods. Kid. Right, totally. Totally. Can't dos. Alright. Get in! We're going. To the mall. Next question. I, what? You can't do that. You can't do that, game. That you can't. No, no, no. You can't do that. That's not how these work. Can I jump? Which monopad is taken away? Four monopads. 
He had his, he had the, the secret one, he had Kaede's twin sisters, and he had Monokuma's four. Survivor perk. Direct. Look at Suichi go. Where was that monopad taken to? He also had Leon's monopad. Oh, shut up. <laughs> if you look, it'll say Leon. Threw it in the sauna. Broke it first. The hidden room. Duh. Duh. Phase four. Here we go. I'm ready to go. Oh my, you can't. This is cheating. You can't do this game. Mm, T -u. Oh my gosh, game, you gotta chill. Game, you gotta chill. Who can enter the hidden room? The mastermind. Hello. H hello. Was that? I was gonna say that should be enough. All right, let's just go. Hard. Going in. <clears throat> the mastermind. Couple ammo, that was pointless. That was pointless. That, there was no... There was no reason to ask me those questions in that format, but sure, why not? Why not, game? It connects! <laughs> Kaide went into the girl's bathroom and used the hidden room to frame Kaide. Well, here's the thing, the game wants me to think it's Kaede, but I don't believe that. One who took that monopath is the mastermind. I'm sure I just don't it. believe that. I think I think he's the one that's the I think Rantaro's more The Survivor Kaide. Perk monopad was found in the library's hidden room. And only the mastermind would have been able to enter that room, correct? Between the time Rantaro died and when we found him, they put that monopad in the hidden room? Nope! That's impossible! Something something, cameras, something something. Impossible? Why? You wish Mew was still alive? I'm sorry, Adam. Huh? You don't know? <coughs> Why, even my cute little cubs have already figured it out! Ooh! Huh? We have? Yeah, so... I'll let Monotaro explain. Huh? Mm. I've already forgotten what we're even talking about. Oh crap, he's gonna push it! It's gonna be Monokin all over again! Uh, yes and no, um, I feel yes, she was the an interesting character. is not in any of the photos taken in the library. Why but also... Huh? Eh. Oh, that's true! I don't know. I like Mew, I think she's a funny character, but... In order to get to the hidden room, you need to move the bookcase, right? Sometimes she was a bit much. Kaede set up those <coughs> hidden cameras, so if the mastermind was using that door, they would have been caught on camera. But none of the pictures showed yeah. anyone no, like it's, that. Yeah, it's funny. Then that reasoning is wrong. Amazing, Monotone. It'll, it'll just be annoying. Uh, oh, hold on. The hidden cameras in the library. It'll just be annoying, timers. you know, three hours from now when it's still a bit like. <laughs> there she is. There's your girl, Adam. That was real fun. I had a blast with that. That, that, that was really, really funny. I see. So the mastermind hid in the hidden room, waited for the right timing. 
grab the monopad from the library, and then return to the <laughs> hidden room. Yep. Hold on. There's a flaw in your logic. <clears throat> Something, what? something, shutting what? the door, something, huh? something. Don't ask me. The mono cubs are gonna explain it. I'll go with my full thoughts of characters and stuff at the end, but. Reject your logic without explaining why. That's the Monokuma debate style. Take it from here, mono cubs. And you better. Am I gonna get to do a scrub debate with the mono cubs? I'm definitely gonna get to do that at some point, right? That's really funny. I just realized that, and I love it. Okay, why is that still wrong? <laughs> what are we arguing about again? The, the hidden camera! Hidden room passageway. Isn't it weird that the mastermind's not in any photos? Unless they use the interval between shots. The camera has a 30 second interval between shots. That's enough time to take the monopad from the body. Then where was the mastermind hiding? <laughs> in the hidden room, of course. If they were still inside the hidden room. Nope. Okay. Damn it. What Hold are we on. arguing about again? <laughs> I love how his text. I love how his text does the thing. Then where was the mastermind hiding? I love that. They were still inside the hidden room. Her argument. I know what was happening in the. Yeah, that works. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's not Shuichi. He just asked a question. The That's not right or wrong. He wants your in the library. They had surveillance cameras. Surveillance cameras. What? Where would something like that? Be? Is the audio level better, Ryan? You don't know, even though they're mono cubs just like you. <gasps> mono cubs? I mean these. <gasps> so cute and tiny. Aren't they? They're your siblings too. That's a big reveal to drop so casually. These little and guys are called Nanokumas. Their job is to monitor the campus. How do you know that? Oh, Father told me. He said to make sure I told everyone. I had completely forgotten about it. Good thing I just remembered. <laughs> Dumbass. Dang it. You remembered too late. Don't get rid of Monosuke. I like him. There are countless Nanokumas buzzing all over the campus. All the footage they record is wirelessly transmitted through Mother Kuma and then sent to Monokuma. Yes, via Mother Kuma. That's an important point. Mother Kuma. If Mother Kuma she is the hive the mind, right? Fix, the mastermind could ask it anything. They would know about the situation in the library and the hidden room. I see. Mother Kuma can tell them the interval timers for the cameras. Then the mastermind was in the hidden room after they what? stole the monopad from Rantaro. Yeah. <laughs> Why? With two Why E's? Why not? The B and then with the E with the asterisk. Not B-E, Beyonce? No, it's B-E. Like B-E. Beyonce. Oh, okay, good, good, yes. good, good, good. That's very clever, I like that. If your watchers <laughs> don't appreciate that. I like that. Did you know the average human being swallows two million nanokumas in their sleep? <laughs> so how about them? But why would they steal the monopad? The mastermind was probably terrified by the idea of us picking up Rantaro's perk. No, that's wrong! Oh my monokuma. What I wasn't necessarily afraid. The survivor perk was for Rantaro's eyes only. Sure, he could have shared the info with you, but that's not the same as getting the info directly from the monopad. Cause then you can't say it was a survivor perk for Rantaro's eyes only, right? Interesting. Are you saying that Rantaro showed it to someone? So when he died, I took it back. That's all. 
Interesting. I don't know about that. Hmm. How do you figure? You look calm now, but at the time, you must have been pretty Well, he's a robot, Shuiji. He can look calm whenever he wants to. The monopad clearly stated that there was a mastermind in the academy. If we knew then that a mastermind was behind everything, we would have worked together. Fair. But you couldn't let that happen. You needed us to go after each other. Either way, you admit the mastermind stole the monopad, right? Well, yes, but only reluctantly. Then the mastermind messed up. If they wanted to retrieve the monopad, they should have used Monokuma to do it. Nope, that's impossible. Oh. The rules state I can't participate in a murder, which includes tampering with the crime scene. So the mastermind isn't any of the 16 then. Could it have been? Well, it could have been. It could have just come later, I guess. If but... you're so strict about following the rules, does that mean that someone is watching? If that's the case... Still, what a waste of a survivor perk! If only he lived a little longer, then this info would have made things interesting! I, I don't understand. Yeah, stop changing <sighs> the subject! I don't understand what the- I just want to know what the motivation is for everything. Still not the full picture, but it seems it would be watched. In that case, this plan should go well. If I ruin this killing game by proving that it doesn't follow its own rules, it should be able to end the whole thing. But the point of this class is to discuss Rantaro's case, right? I feel is like, the uh, mastermind stealing his survivor perk <clears throat> shouldn't affect it whatsoever. In the end, Kaede killed him. There's no shaking off that truth. That's wrong! Yeah, yeah! One truth prevails! No, that's not the truth. I'm certain of that. It's a lie that you made up. Me. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry, I'm yawning so much. <laughs> that's right. Kaede wasn't the one who killed Rantaro. The true culprit is... Am I picking right now? Monica, the mastermind, right? Right? That's it! Yeah. I call Jojo Juju. Interesting. The mastermind controlling Monokuma. Juju's They're the one who adventure. killed Rantaro. The mastermind is the culprit? Jeez. And you call yourself the ultimate detective? Trying to overturn the results of the first class trial. Okay. The Mono Cubs won't be silent about this. What? Us again? Shut up. This but is we said we don't already. know. And we're like not even probably a quarter of the way through. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. The shot put ball with the pink fight. Taro's killer is the mastermind. That means Kaede was the mastermind. Can you prove the mastermind is the culprit? Uh, Mono, did, Mono yeah. is really quiet. Any evidence? I don't know why. He's really quiet. You though. want evidence Kaede is the culprit? The shot put ball at the murder scene. She used the camera flash to lure Rent. Oh, yeah. That's true. She did that. And then cracked his skull with a shot put ball. But that's the lie. Yep, yep, Kaede is the culprit. No, that's not it. What the freak? Damn it! Kaede did set up the whole thing. Okay, fine, 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 Whatever. Tomatoes, tomatoes. You found the youngster Joey? Oh, that's... That's not even true. Are they comfy and easy to wear? They're comfy and easy to wear! Yes! <laughs> Oof! Oof! The most okay. important fact we discovered during the investigation is this. The shot put ball with the pink fiber! The shot put ball that Rantaro was killed with. There you go, Adam. That's my stupid chewy 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 I found a shot put ball in the trash can in the hidden room. You think they would have gotten rid of it by now, but... But it was not the murder weapon. 
That shot put ball didn't have any blood on it. Hopefully it's easy to digest. What? <laughs> what are you saying, right? <laughs> Rather, there was a pink fiber stuck to that shot. Pink fiber? So what? Do you remember how Kaede was carrying the shot put ball? With her pink fiber! Eat the pant, says Ryan. And then Adam goes, <laughs> Backpack. Carry a backpack. Wrapped in his spare vest. Blah, 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 blah. I see. She had it in her backpack. Is that why he was going to do the... Oh, interesting. So that's why he was going to do the first blood perk. Because the mastermind was going to kill the first person. But then something, something. Kaide didn't speak up or something. I don't know. It was wrapped in her spare vest. Her pink vest. I mean, that's kind of a purplish, but that's fine. I see. The shot put ball you found in the it's hidden zone had a pink fiber on it. Yes, it's a fiber from her vest. That can only mean that the ball I found was the one that was in Kaede's backpack. Or, you know... No, sorry, my computer was at a weird angle. That is pink. You're right, you're right. What'd you say? Really, I got no idea what you're it's talking about. It's been a minute about. since I've actually seen her, so... That shot put ball did not have blood on it, so it could not have been the murder weapon. In short, the shot that Kaede used didn't hit Rantaro. And then maybe they just washed off the blood. If so, the fiber on the shot put ball would have been washed off as well. It seems like a weird... Pattern. It's clear to me that the real murder weapon is different than the shot Kaede had. It seems like a weird choice. Yes. The fiber. Kaede set up the bookcase and rolled the shot into the vent. But that shot didn't hit Rantaro. Her plan failed. Failed? I don't even know what that means. If you found that shot put ball in the hidden room, then that means... Because... Mastermind took it. That's it. This seems too easy. The mastermind took it from the library. Only they could get in that room, after all. The mastermind took it? So they recovered the shot that missed Rantaro, and he was killed by a different one. Oof. Rantaro was killed by the mastermind, who made it look like Kaede was the culprit. That required a bit of trickery like, on the mastermind's okay. part. I'm fine with this. There better be some kind of resolution for Kaede, because that's not fair to her. They prepared their own shot to kill Rantaro and switched it with Kaede's shot. They took Kaede's shot put ball and stowed it in the hidden room. To put it simply, Kaede didn't kill Rantaro. It was the mastermind. I hope she comes back out. Monokum was like, just kidding, I didn't kill her. I didn't make the rules. Ta-da, Kaede. Is going to yell. No! Why would they do this to me? My my Why favorite one. one them? Why? Whoops! I got too worked up and accidentally Gosh darn it! Gosh darn it, Mana did take it from us too soon twice. <laughs> it was blue. The mastermind killed Rantaro. I believe the reason had something to do with Ooh, the time. Chipotle is not sitting well with me. Yeah. My stomach is like. <laughs> Two days from now, every student forced to participate in the killing game will die. Kaede was keeping us all together, and we refused to kill each other. To break up the stalemate, the mastermind introduced that motive. However, this was a gamble. They didn't want to cause total chaos, after all. Because that would just end everything. They wanted an exciting killing game. That motive put pressure on the mastermind, as well as us. Yes, Kaede had a plan to kill the mastermind, but Rantaro was caught in the trap. <clears throat> However, her plan ultimately failed. The shot put ball that she rolled didn't hit Rantaro. 
Because it missed, we would have been annihilated due to the time limit. But the Mastermind wanted to avoid that situation, so they took action. Thanks to the Nanokumas, the Mastermind would have known Kaede's intended murder weapon. That's so fair. when her plan failed, they would already have another shot put ball prepared. Then, the Mastermind manipulated the scene to make it look like Kaede succeeded. All they had to do was hide Kaede's shot in the hidden room. I did that think that that shot put ball was a little far away. I don't remember exactly what I said, but I feel like I thought it was a little far away from his body. So, Kaede was executed on false charges? Yes. Yes, she was. <sighs> she didn't actually kill anyone. Justice for Kaede. But she was executed nonetheless, because the mastermind framed her for Rantaro's murder. And Monokuma played along. He let us believe the mastermind's lie. Okay. We were all fooled, including okay. Kaede. Stomach's doing things. We thought she was the culprit until the very end. I don't either. And you want to tell us this game is fair? That there are rules? That's all bullshit. Whoa, Suichi. This game makes no sense at all. If Monokuma twisted the truth for this case, Rude Adam. I'm not that entirely. Twisted entire it for the other cases thing. as well, making this killing game unfair. Then it's not even that. a killing game anymore. It's just killing. I won't forgive them. Ooh. I'll never forgive them for breaking the rules and killing Kaede. So cool. I'll never forget at the end of the series. And I, I, I will avenge Kaede. I swear on her kindness and her love and her grave that I will avenge her. Okay, Shuichi. All right. Yeah! How dare the mastermind create the detonator that blew up you? Right? I agree with you, Monokuma. How dare you? You're the one that blew him up. Don't pass the buck. It is. It's called Goodbye, Dungarumpa. Anyway, we know the mastermind is also Rantaro's killer. Let's figure out who that is. That is, if Monokuma still wants to continue this class trial. Of course we're gonna keep going. Like I said, this killing game will never end. No, Monokuma. I will end this. Yeah. Shuiji kind of sounds... He's kind of got the Hajime... Or not the Hajime. He's kind of got the... Uh... I will reveal the identity he's of the mastermind the and syndrome, end the killing game. It just sounds a little derpy. And so when they try to make him sound cool, he just sounds derpy. Um, may I interject? You keep accusing this so-called mastermind, but... No, why did my page stop working? There we go. Are you sure there's even a mastermind at all? Are you sure you bastards aren't imagining it? If the mastermind is real, show him to us. That's the problem. You guys trying to figure that out. Them. It's possible the mastermind is still in this academy. The survivor perk said so. If they were involved in Rantaro's murder, there's no doubt. Then they must have snuck in during the Gopher Project and stayed hidden in the account. Do you want to finish that? It's a movie here. You just odd. What was that all about? <laughs> it's me though. I just realized something. Say it, or I'll cast my all the guys you date will be single fathers, Chris. <laughs> it's Kaede's younger twin sister. No, it's not. You're the f shut up. I don't like you. But younger twin sister? It was on this Gopher Project participant list. She has a twin sister. It seems sort of weird to me. Junko and Oshima had a twin too, right? Mm. Are you saying those same circumstances apply Evil here twin. as well? This killing game was influenced a lot by the past one, right? Yep, so let's clarify which one. Real identity was Don't too. bully Moogie, she's the worst, Adam. She's a garbage character, I hate her. Have you seen me threaten her? I threaten her. It's fun. I still have the knife in my room. It's unrelated. Mastermind is studying this academy. Man, it's a sick game. It's Kaede's twin sister. No, that's wrong. Maybe. I guess that's a possibility. This is true. I have done this many times. 
Either way, there's no doubt that the Echo mastermind is hiding somewhere in this school. How unfortunate that you couldn't find him during your final investigation. You're not allowed to leave while the trial's in session, so you can't search for them. Rude. You guys are rude. You bullied you my girl. You can't leave during a trial unless you gotta pee. That's actually a good uh, place for me to say that I'm gonna try to go to the bathroom too, real quick. Um, I'll be right back. That's what I gotta do. So we're gonna we're gonna save the game and then um, uh, um I'll be right back. Close your ears, this might be loud.
Well, I'm back. Uh, I'm just gonna change my pants into um, uh, into sweatpants. Thank you for the bits, Adam. And no, I'm not doing more than that. I just really did not like the Chipotle. I'll be right back. Adam, my girlfriend is in the room. You be- you behave. I'm gonna change back now. Be prepared, it could be loud. What did I miss? No, shut up, you guys, no! Oh my gosh. You guys are gross. They're being gross. He says, so Matt needed to quote, 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 go to the bathroom, woo woo. And I was like, behave yourself. And then Adam went to Wendy's and came back and I was still in the bathroom. Oh my god. <laughs> and then I, and then I came, I came back, I said, I have to change my pants and now he's being crap about that wow. as well. It's fine. It's fine. We're back, and we're all gonna behave ourselves like the adults that we all are, except for Adam. Because he's a child. Because he's 17. Back. Oh, I gotta pee. <laughs> wow. Welcome to this series. Well, that's what the guy said. He said, we're, we, you can't leave during the trial unless you gotta pee. So I was like, oh, well, my stomach's exploding. Let me leave. There you go. That was the joke. But then I actually had my my stomach exploding. No, it's not really that simple. Look, Adam. Just because you have a dirty mind does not mean that I dug my own grave. It's your problem. Can you guys figure out the identity? You can disrespect me, but respect the lady Besides here. The 16 of us at this school. There was a 17th person too. That 17th person is the mastermind. I don't think so. It could be Kaede's younger twin sister. Just like the previous killing game, the mastermind might have a twin for this game too. If it really is the same as the previous killing game, then Kaede would still be alive. And I want to see what clues to the mastermind are. I'm not 100% sure what they are. Does flashback later or surgery in state? Who cares? You're still no closer to the answer! No leaving while the trial's in session! Am I gonna have to agree with? Can you guys think. <laughs> Mastermind. No, it's not this one. I was wrong. Okay, she reached you. Can you guys figure out the I'm confused what I'm supposed to be arguing here. Gosh darn it, freaking oh my a uh, ground. Only ground. Wow. You didn't plan ahead. 
Well, isn't the third gym leader an electric one? Oh, gotcha, gotcha. I care about the V. What? V, V, agreed. It's, it's out of context. Don't ignore that. Um. <laughs> oh, no! We saw the list, but we're missing something. What are we missing? Did you guys figure out the identity of the mastermind? Is it this one? It's that one. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. Got it. I did Shut up! Everyone stop bullying me! You think just because my girlfriend's no, here you can bully me? Can't be a 17th person. That contradicts what Mother Kuma said. They always bully me, it's fine. Contradicts what Mother Kuma said. <laughs> That's right, they still come It implies the that the mastermind wasn't in the hidden room the whole time. Yes. They must have been coming and going between the room and the academy, right? Would someone who has to stay completely hidden really risk that? No, they wouldn't. Right. If they were trying to hide, they would have just stayed So it's one of us, which means it's Samugi. That's some impressive logic. She's too boring, like I said. Don't agree with him. And during the investigation, I found a classroom that makes She's too boring. Lights. She wouldn't survive this long unless she was important to the plot, and she's never been important to the plot. A classroom that Which makes me think that she will lights? be important to the plot in the long run. Uh, I'll explain the details later. But there was something interesting. Monodum. No, he's died twice. Can't be Monodum. Classroom door burst open, and the thing shut off, right? When the door is opened, the classroom reverts to its original state. Clearly, the room is hiding something. The room? You're tearing me apart. Isn't it obvious? The mastermind didn't want anyone to see them making flashback lights. But why create such a classroom at all? If the mastermind were a 17th person, they could have their own completely separate room to make flashback lights. Yeah. Yeah. Indeed, that would be much safer. Knowing this, we can make a yeah. few assumptions about the mastermind's identity. However, the implications aren't good. It means it's one of us. What an ominous way to say it. But there's nothing to worry about. We got this far because we're friends. You know In this to together, no I'm matter not. what, I'm there's nothing to fear. Okay. Did you text her? Okay. Yeah, she's right. Fair. You could also probably text Adam if you wanted to as well. Like Adam Howard. Yeah. Yeah, like the one with the car. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. That's I, it. He was close enough. I think. Sorry, I'm trying to play a mystery game while like also talking to you. One of the participants of this killing game. I listen, I just thought, <laughs> oh my goodness. Call him out. Shush. Hush yourself. One of the 16 people who were forced to play this game. Now we all know one it wasn't Kokichi because he's dumb and I hate him. So it's the other person what? that's dumb and I hate. The classroom that makes flashback lights and the hidden room being visited often. It all suggests that the mastermind is someone we'd see every day at the academy. Someone we'd see every day? Like one of the 16 students? That, that's crazy! There's no way one of us is the mastermind! Because we're all friends! We swore to fight together! <laughs> then it just means that all your friendship talk was a lie, right? I do appreciate that Monokuma's voice is back to normal, though. Shut up! It was Possible. too weird at the beginning of the game. I'm glad that for the finale it's You're normal. Upset and irrational. At times like this, a voice of reason is necessary. Absolutely necessary. <laughs> Got it. We're up. All right. We're gonna put on a reasonable yet outstanding show and earn our right to live. Eh? Our right to live? Is Bruce, someone about to Bruce die? Kaboom, is please. that what's going on? Whatever, I don't believe you. His voice There's is weird no in chapter one? Really? Here. I don't remember that. Wait. 
Even if it's one of the 16 students, it doesn't mean it's one of us, does it? Well, yeah, it does, because... Huh? What do you mean? No, she means one of the five left. Because it could be one of the other 11, but... It's possible that the if the mastermind was dead, really none of this would be happening there. anymore. So he's like, been alive this whole time. I don't remember that. Now that we know I didn't really care about Kaito chapter one, so I didn't pay much attention. Possibility should be. What's that supposed to mean? Hurry up and answer! If you don't hurry up, I'm gonna blow up the rest of the Mono Cubs. Okay, everyone, stop talking. Just let him do it. It's fine. Just let him do it. Uh, hurry up and answer! Mastermind is a ghost. That's true. Alibis. That's it. Oh, interesting. Who has an alibi? Hmm. We need to go over everyone's alibi for Rantaro's murder. Oh, interesting. Someone went to the bathroom, didn't they? I remember this. Smoogie went to the bathroom during the trial. She totally did. Right when he was killed, she totally went to the bathroom. Oh my gosh. Was I right? Was I actually right the whole time? What good would it do? Now that we oh no, Kibo doesn't have an alibi. Either, though. It might lead somewhere. So we're all gonna assume it's Kibo, but she went. We might find a hole in someone's alibi that we didn't see at the time. So we just have to give our alibis again. Maki was at the planning Fine. meeting. Fine, then let's do it. So was Himiko. Shuichi so was with Kaede. Sure that the mastermind's not one Kibo of doesn't have an alibi, and Samugi went to the bathroom where the secret entrance uh -huh. is. I wonder where this discussion will lead. Will it lead to a mastermind in this very room? Kabutops or the Helix fossil? I'll praise the Helix. <laughs> Just, you can't. Either really. way, we're gonna make sure this trial yeah. stays exciting. Adam, what the freak are you doing, man? Oh wait, no, you're 18 now, aren't you, Adam? You lewd man. I forgot that you're you're of age now too. What? What? Why I are... was in the game room in the basement. I don't know about that. It's gonna be the hidden passage. Hidden room passage. Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Even if I was in the same basement, it's impossible for me to have killed Rantaro. I agree with that. I agree with that. I was in my room by myself. He doesn't have an alibi, but. And so were Ryoma and Kokichi, too. They exploded earlier. I know that is a poor alibi. <laughs> Mono but... Mono kid. I did not kill Rantaro. I believe you. I was in the dining hall. Yeah, but. Kyo, Mew, and Kirumi were with me. Yes, but. So I did leave briefly to use the bathroom. <laughs> I couldn't have killed him. <laughs> Why would you point that out? Why would you point that out? You ding dong dumb bell. It's time, gentlemen. Wait a minute, Sumug. It's been a long time coming. It's time to murder Samoog. Huh? You said you went to the bathroom. Also true, Ryan, true. Closes to the dining hall. The girls' bathroom near the mm. bathroom, right? What did you say? That bathroom? Hmm. Huh? What? What about it? Hmm. Shuichi, didn't you investigate the girl's bathroom? Did you find anything? I found a snake. The utility closet in that bathroom has a hidden passageway. I am a pleased man, gentlemen. I was correct. She's garbage and we can kill her now, yes? Do we agree on this? One that's connected Normally to the I'd be room. like, wait, but it's too early to determine something based off of that. But no, it's not, because they always reveal the mastermind early in the second trial, in the last trial. Which means it's possible to get into the hidden room from that bathroom. Freaking go, I'm ready. What? Around the time Rantaro was killed, Tsumugi went to that exact bathroom. Shut up, Ryan. Shuichi sniffs toilet seats confirmed. Wow. Thank you, Adam, for that. Thank you. Real, real appreciate that one. Thanks, bud. 
I'm positive that when Rantaro was killed, I've given them too much power with the, the voice text. <laughs> Lots of bits, though. I appreciate you. It's too convenient to be coincidence. It is too convenient. Hold on. This is also sudden. I don't think I understand. You're garbage. That's what it is. I've been saying it the whole game. Maybe they got there from the hidden door. You're garbage. I'm ready to kill you. Dead. I have my weapon ready and everything. No, I don't think so. Remember that I had placed dust in the card reader in the library. I was trying to determine if the hidden door was opened with a card reader. I appreciate that Shuichi just the tells us these things. Fall. Like, I feel like in past games, I would have had to explain that. Card reader. I'm not gonna, Adam. I know I don't swing it around wildly. So, to enter the hidden room, I just have they would need to use a different room. As a joke. The girl's bathroom. Yes, I believe that's the case. And unless Kibo went to the bathroom. From the girl's bathroom on the first floor. Which and with the help of Mother Kuma, watch the situation in the library. Unfold. Yeah, it's almost exactly the same one, ironically enough. It's fine. As soon as they saw the Kaede's plan fail, they waited for the camera interval. And leaped out of the hidden room, shot put ball in hand. She the leaped out of there. From the inside, so there was no need to use the card reader. In any case, the culprit attacked Rantaro with a shot put ball, left it in the library, picked up the shot that Kaede had used, and returned to the hidden room. You freaking wrecked. And they also took the survivor perk monopad that Rantaro had, right? Yes. Then they left the monopad and the shot in the hidden room, headed into the passageway, mm. and returned to the girl's bathroom. This is sweet victory for me, Priscilla. Oh, the worst character is going to be... The one who did oh! Mr. Congrats. Wow, into a slightly less useless Pokemon. It's a butterfly. <laughs> well, it's a butterfly, but. Up till now, everything pointed to the mastermind not being one of us. We can agree that Butterfree is not a good Pokemon, right? Can we agree on this? She's doing all this. That's fine. She can be free. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Yeah. This would be impossible for just some cosplayers. Yo, what's up, Ryan? Thank you. You have a good day as well. But you said that you went to that bathroom during Rantaro's oh, murder. Me, How can you possibly wow. repeat that fact? I know. It's been a day. It's, it's all just. I mean, bugs oh, do evolve. Kibo cool. and Ryoma didn't have alibis. What if they went to the girls' bathroom? Really helpful that you that. My sprinkler <laughs> goes like this. Yes, 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 yes. Then comes back like T T T T. Oh, it didn't read all the T's. Why didn't it read all the T's? Butterfree is good in the anime. Sure, I'll give you that. That's good. I'll give you that. I'll give you that, Ryan. Butterfree's cute in the anime. Did you see one of them in the girls' bathroom? What? If one of them had gone into that bathroom, you would have seen each other, right? But you never mentioned that. that. You request a refund, Twitch? I think you can actually do that, Ryan. <laughs> if it really bothers you What's that much. What's the meaning of this? Can this really be true? You know who's bad in the game and in the anime? Tell me, Ryan. Tell me, Adam. If you say Sayaka, I'm gonna ban you. I'm not gonna ban you. Oh my god, he said Sayaka. I can't ban him because then that takes his way as bond privileges and then it it messes with a whole lot of things, but No, it's not! I really only went to use the bathroom. I didn't know about the hidden passage. Look lively, monocubs! You're up! Priscilla is my girlfriend's name, yes. What? <laughs> what? No, I'm just laughing. Your squirrel's asking. That's very wrong! That's very wrong! You're very wrong. Father's never yelled at me like that before. If we don't do well here, we're all gonna worried. get blown up together. Okay. As long as you're okay. Bean said she's gonna figure it out. I'm still gonna okay. live longer! I want to see the next chapter! Okay. We're all gonna wait. So please, let us win! What? We're gonna freaking sword fight with the bears again. Oh boy. 
I'll be back. Mono, Mother Kuma's voice we princess. Don't wanna die. Like oh gosh. Time. I don't know what Four Eyes is talking about. Bad guys never wear glasses. <laughs> anyway, just cut it out. I, that's what I'm trying to do, but you guys we are moving it around die. too much quickly. Gosh darn it. Click, click the buttons, click the buttons, click them. Okay. Suck sense. Monokuma and the mastermind are the bad guys here. You don't want to die? Do you know how many of my friends were sacrificed? Oh, get him, Shuichi. Please, help us! Is Four Eyes over there really the mastermind? We don't know anything. Gosh darn, click! Just darn it. Hey. I'll cut through your words. Rip? What is rip? Oh, all people that died? Yeah, that's fair. Before being destroyed, Mother Kuma told us something. Yes. What did she say? The sprinkler goes S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S B S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S S <laughs> Thank you for the bits. <laughs> that individual is, of course, the, the one that says birth. When the mastermind commands Mother Kuma to give birth, it makes us spare. We all tried it out. Ah, but Kiba wasn't there, was he? Right, because I was fighting the Exosols. Did you hear that? Kibo didn't try giving yeah, because he was the fighting the bad guy. What do you? Uh. So the real mastermind is. Tamugi was the only one who didn't say give birth. Huh? Everyone else said give. Birth. I wondered if that was gonna come up. I didn't pay enough attention, but I wondered if that was gonna come up. Give birth to a monokuma. We said give birth to a new monokuma. Hurry up and give birth to a monokuma. Tsumugi specifically used a different phrase. What does she say? What does she say? Try and make a new Monokuma. Ha ha! Get wrecked, you you freaking bird. piece of garbage. You said make. Tsumugi is a piece of garbage who does not deserve anyone's attention and love. And my computer is frozen and I don't know why the mouse pad is not working. Which is concerning to me. There we go. No, someone gave me this great computer. What do we do? What do we just do? Come on, reload! Gosh darn it, internet. Why does my internet freaking suck? Did Bulbasaur evolve? No, if I catch 30 Pokemon, they'll give me a Bulbasaur. Ooh, that's pretty exciting. That is pretty great. That is pretty great. I'm trying to just freaking open my thing, and I can't see what anyone wants to say to me. Who did the thing? Someone did a thing. Oh, it didn't work. Interesting. It didn't read that one. I wonder if it has a built-in, like, it won't read it if it's a bad word or something. Oh my gosh, Google. Freaking stop being so dumb. I'm sorry, hold on. My computer's being dumb. I can't see the freaking chat because my freaking Wi Fi is a piece of garbage. Okay, chat is back. Thank you for the bits. I'm not going to read the message out loud. Adam, it's not going to happen. But you knew how to thank get you for Kuma it. To create a spare, didn't you? That's why you specifically said make. If you had said give birth, 
Mother Kuma TFW's Matt is a naughty boy for me in Ryan's bits. Thank you for the bits. I mean no W O M I. Right? <laughs> you guys are weird. <laughs> Something weird. Am I right, Sumugi? Get him. Hey, come on. What's wrong? Wait, why does it say that you sent me th wait. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, it's counting all your total bits. It says on my screen on my phone that you gave me 3,045 bits, which I don't think happened. Probably over the course of your entire time giving me bits you did. But, uh, that was just 100. I don't know why it says that many. <laughs> don't be like that, Shuichi. Do you really think I'm the mastermind? Yes, I've been saying it for like four chapters. You suck and I hate you. There's just no way. There is a way. Hey, everyone, say something. I'm not the mastermind. That's crazy, right? Then refute it. We're waiting. Get him, Maki. Huh? I don't want to believe it either. That I one do. Of our friends, the survivors, could Screw do Screw you. That's why I'm begging, Sumugi. I'm begging you to refute me. I might be wrong. I... I was wrong before. We are going to be here all night. It's going to take a long time. That's I'm sorry. everyone's help. I don't care if my detective work is wrong. I want to hear your argument. Reaching the truth together is what cooperation means to me. Gave you almost the same as the exact same thing they say in Attack Sumugi, on Titan. Interesting. Sumugi, please. What's the matter? You can't argue back after hearing that. Yeah, it's because you're stinky dumb and I hate you. My computer sucks. It's not my computer, my internet sucks. This computer is great. I don't know what's going on right now, but just hold on a sec! Is it Wednesday? No, it's Friday, right? It's Saturday. Today? Yeah. Yes. Sorry, I'm just trying to think if Josh is doing work stuff, because that could be oh, something on the internet. Mamasuke's infamous impatience rears its ugly head. There we go. And what an there ugly head it is! I, I don't think friends should blame each other like this, you know? There we go, we're back. Chat's Come back, on, sorry. Come on, smile, everyone. I know, we can watch a comedy special so we can all smile. And he explodes. Yep, 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 yep. With Monosuke. I'm gonna be streaming this on the end of the void. It could go past midnight. I don't think it will, but you think there's four you more hours of this you game? Oh yeah, you're right. I've been well, playing about an hour and a half. You think there's four more hours? So be quiet and watch like good little cups. <laughs> Father? <laughs> See? It's it is a long trial. I know it's long. I plan for to reveal the mastermind, trying to overcome despair. It's so heart pounding. We have the mastermind cornered. Why is Monokuma so calm? Should be feeling cornered as well. Forget it. We're on the offensive here. If we make the mastermind's identity clear, all this will be settled. Yeah, let's click. I, for once, I can actually vote for her, and it's not wrong. It Let's has to be you. Go! Ooh! I knew it. Guys, when I voted for her every trial, I was really just playing the end game. I knew what this was all about. It's you, Sumugi. There are no other possibilities. You don't have anything to say? Uh, anything to say? Even if you keep saying all that stuff, I <coughs> don't get it. Is it cool if I open the window? Just the blinds, I mean. It starts to get kind of dark, and then my face looks bad. Because we're all friends, right? No, I've never been friends with you. I hate you. So weren't we going to work together to end this killing? Yes, by killing you. This is a class trial. Uh. Although we were forced into these class trials by the mastermind, that's how we survived. It was the only way. It was the only way we could survive. So please, Tsumugi, refute the evidence. Say something. Your life depends on it. 
Not really, though, because she can kind of do whatever she wants if she is the mastermind. Sumugi, I don't want to suspect you. I Which want line? to believe right. in you. Which line has a good meaning? I want the mastermind to be oh, somewhere this is a class else, trial. like in the previous killing games. <laughs> if you're really not the mastermind, then don't give up. I'll cheer you on. Did any of you guys see this coming when you played? Even if you say that. Like, is it weird for me to assume that because she was such a boring character, she had more going on than she let on? <laughs> Samugi is taking her sweet time, but waiting around is so boring. Totally hey, Shimichi, boring. Okay. Why don't we look over the case again? What? I'm just wondering if I'm crazy for not seeing it come, or if I'm if I'm out of the box for seeing it coming. Come on, that's or like not. your thing. Present the truth and end this. Because there are people who don't know what the heck. Didn't is you have like everything slow for you though, Adam? Now then, let's start. Let's do the closing argument in the middle of the trial. Here we go. She was in the dining hall. She ran out of the classroom first. Shuichi did. Noticing the camera flash, where did the shot fall? Who jumped out from the hidden room? Oh, in plain sight, yeah. Like, I had reason to suspect her, uh, just from a couple things I'd see on the side. I never saw an outright spoiler that was like, she's the mastermind, right? I had reason to suspect her from various things that I'd seen on the subreddit. Like, kind of the same way that Chiaki always was shown with Art of Monomy. Like, I'd seen art of her and, um, and go together, but I was like, is she just a fangirl or whatever, blah blah blah, and then also that was mainly the big thing, was like yeah, she clearly didn't have any character development she wasn't a thing she just wasn't important at all um What this what? Did I not just click this thing for this? Did I not click this? I might have clicked the wrong one. This is the truth of the case. Okay, I'm just glad that I'm not the only one who kind of saw evidence. it coming. Let's look back at Rantaro's murder. Is this the part that people really don't like about this game's ending, or is it something later? The night of the incident, Kayo okay, was waiting this. for the mastermind time. to trigger the trap. We don't have time to go through this whole thing. Fair. Around that time, me? there were four people in the I'm just gonna mastermind who was probably skip. irritated after the motive was given, but the mastermind wanted some insurance. They would the mastermind excuse themselves from the dining hall and from there to the hit. Only the mastermind could enter, except they could enter it. And there they yeah, went. I'm just gonna skip this. With less than an hour before the time limit expired, Krakio eating spaghetti. Rantaro That's a meme. The <laughs> Everything Krakio does is a meme. Which set off the receiver. It all happened the way we determined. ran out of the room. It's interesting Kaede now that we see Kaide football into the air drawn pit. in this. And the movie's not drawn. It's cool. At the same time, it's like getting to Rantaro. see the actual killer drawn when they weren't the actual killer kind of thing. He unwittingly stepped I always did find this rather interesting. I was like, that's a really specific spot for it to fall and hit him. Fell right onto Rantaro's head, killing him instantly. It turns out that was in reality. 
New Act 5, interesting. The shot put ball the Coyote rolled didn't actually hit Rantara. Because it wouldn't have hit, it just, it was a very small spot on his head to have hit, you know? He must have been surprised seeing the shot put, but his fate was <laughs> That's sealed. Fair. His fate was sealed. <laughs> okay, Shuichi. Don't need to be so melodramatic. The mastermind saw the Coyote's play. The mastermind jumped out of the hidden and in their hand, the real murder weapon. Oof. Ooh, don't put a crack sound effect on that. Rantaro wasn't killed by Coyote's shot, but by the mastermind's. Great guy's always wearing something in this game. Gloves, glasses. The mastermind picked up Coyote's shot and left their shot put ball at the scene. Backpack. He's always wearing something. He was wearing a coat in the last one. The survivor perk Is the only chapter that the gray guy's not Those wearing something chapter hand, three? They retreated back into the hidden... Or does it wear Karekio's mask? I don't think it does. I remember seeing the bookcase closing. Jet the mastermind had probably just finished it. Okay, I thought she was the killer. So, the real truth and reached the truth, but that truth had been twisted. Did he wear Gonta's glasses? Oh no, he didn't. You're right. I forget chapter four exists. Sometimes. After the murder, the mastermind. Left it on the table, threw away the ball. And threw Coyote a little careless of them to not get rid of all the evidence. They probably believed no one would ever get... <clears throat> That's fair. That makes sense. And Samugi's useless enough that she wouldn't have crime been smart, so it's fine. The mastermind went back through the... The passageway led from the hit... The girl's bathroom on the first floor. Where the mastermind was pretending to use the girl's bathroom, they were actually using the hidden passageway. They didn't have any blood on them, though? Like, really? That's how they moved around without anyone could have used the hidden pass, but looking at the survivors, only you could possibly be the mastermind. Come on, give it to me. Give me this art. This art, I mean. Ooh, baby. If I'm wrong, please refute me. Please tell us you aren't the mastermind. Tsumugi Shirogane, the ultimate cosplayer. She knew the girls' bathrooms had some sort of mysterious secret. That's the truth of this case, of the killing game itself. Well, Tsumugi. Well, Tsumugi. Well, what? Time to die. Yes, what a scorching hot twist! My hand holding the detonator is tensing up. Don't get tense. C -c Calm down. <laughs> Daddy, They're gonna leave us with Monotaro last. I don't want that. That's how you used to be. I don't like Monotaro. So Why is he always surviving till the end how of it? I used to be was more suited to a different story than this one. Huh? Basically, your story doesn't matter. I Thank you, Monotaro. Exciting development. Well, Tsunugi, are there any flaws in Shuichi's logic? If so, then please tell us. F flaws. All over it. I see one big flaw right there on the middle of my screen. Then explain. Oh, I actually want to see Kaito. You can do it. Thing. You can do it, Smoogie. This is kind of normal, I guess. E even if you cheer me on. What does Kaito's look like? That's Gonta. That's Angie. It's not like that. Shut up. Fight back, Samugi! Come on! You can do it! You can do it! Daddy, you're tensing up again! I still want to live, so please don't push the button! Yeah, it's kind of weird. I mean, his is a little bit different, please, but... just say something. And Kaito's is a little don't bit different. You they look mostly the Oshima. same. What? Because it's always been her. In the Hope's Peak killing game, in the Jabberwock Island killing game. Did she just get a little hick? Junko and Oshima didn't participate. Sorry, that line she sounded a little... From outside. Sounded a little hick for a second there. Even if it's boring or repetitive, she's always the mastermind, isn't she? 
Then it's Red Red this time too. It's gotta be Junko again. Yeah, they look like they're mirrored. Kaito's and Kokichi's look like they're mirrored. Junko and Oshima is dead. She's not part of this killing game. I don't get why Ryoma's is so like weirdly just X. You're wrong. She hasn't been eliminated. She's. It's all Junko's doing. This killing game is her doing too. No, shush, shush, shush. Yeah, that's gotta be it. Cause Junko you get and Oshima. Tangan again. <laughs> I'm sure you do like Mugos. I'm sure you like Mugos a lot, Adam. Cause Junko and Oshima is... Junko and Oshima is... Daddy, please don't get so excited. You pressed the button by accident. Look at our cute faces. Can you really bear yes, to be please, without please. us? Please go away. Junko and Oshima is... Junko and Oshima is what? Okay, time for a commercial. <laughs> See, we're a good comedy group too. So please don't. Bless up. Bless up. Oh, oh, oh no. Junko and Oshima. Is is me? Is 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 what? Huh? Junko and Oshima is right the fuck here. That is not Junko's voice. No, 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 no. Sorry to keep you waiting. Even if nobody weird. was waiting. Even if it makes you go, what? Again? Yeah, same, honestly. The diva of despair takes the stage once more. Junko and Oshima, the 53rd. That is not the same voice actor. Is it the same voice actress? That does not sound... Best girl is back. B A B Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Y Woohoo! Junko E N I S H I M A every time. B O I I I I I I I I. E N I S H I M A every time. It is the same voice actress. She does not sound the same. New Ultimate Despair, the fifty third. Want to talk about it? Okay. Junko and Oshima. The 53rd? Sumugi, what's the matter? Aren't you Sumugi Shirogane? Any updates? Our friend who survived oh. with us? Just, just keep me posted. <laughs> Sorry about that. You can go ahead and forget about Sumugi Shirogane. Except you're doing her same pose. But yes, I agree, we can just forget about her. Because I'm just a character. You know, a lie. I, what the, mm hmm Sorry to all her fans out there. If any of you even exist, that is. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow, Shaden. A, a lie? Samuki Shiragane was nothing more than a cover for me. The mastermind. <laughs> Calling her your friend? Ugh, it's laughable, really. Really, I'm gonna laugh. <laughs> why does she have a, a V in her eyes? Do you see that? What, why are her eyes different? Uh, are you serious? You liked the movie. Mastermind Adam, this? how? She's so boring and annoying. That face and that voice. It's just like... Junko and Oshima. I know, right? Oh, does it make you fall into despair? Bro, her eyes literally say V3. Her eyes literally say V3. I'm upset. I'm, I'm upset that that's what her eyes say. Shut up, Ryan. <laughs> well, does it? I also like how her character art doesn't work. Like, it's it looks weird and, like, clippy and, like, it looks like they tried to cut her out with Photoshop and failed and they're still, like, stat- you see what I'm saying? No. That's not possible. Junko Inoshima is dead. You clearly said the 53rd, you're all dumb. But why did you Thank call you. yourself the 53rd? Nico, I take it back, you're not dumb. As history repeats itself, so does Junko Inoshima. Me? I mean, sh I, uh, that's a week. Uh, As you can see, I am a perfect reproduction of Junko Inoshima. So, 
You're just a freak pretending to be Junko and Ashima, huh? No, a perfect reproduction. Except you literally, your clip art is not, it doesn't work. It's it's messing with the background and it perfect bothers me. Perfect reproductions are exactly the same as the original. Her logic is impossible to follow. Much like the real Junko and Ashima's. Whatever it is, you're the actual mastermind of this killing game, right? So if we kill you, then that'll be the end, correct? Oh my gosh, Al. <laughs> I'm glad you're happy. I mean things like that. Besides, killing me never ends the game. I know a lot of people don't like that she comes back in every game. I don't mind. I, I don't mind. It makes sense. You know, if someone could really cause the entire world apocalypse to happen, it would make sense that she'd keep coming back as the villain. It never ends the game? I don't mind what do you this. Mean? It's just kind of like, oh, we're back to this. Okay, sure. She's bluffing. Let's just kill her and get it over with. So there's four survivors this game. That's ridiculous. If force is necessary, it should wait until after we see what she... No need, Kivo, because this class trial is over. What? It's already over? Oh, but I just showed up. I think 2 was great. I think they used her really well in 2, and in Ultra Despair Girls, I think they used her pretty well. Um, 3, the anime didn't even use her, really. Like, they did, but they didn't, and I respect that. But this one, you killed Kaede. And sure. Akuma covered sure. it up with a false narrative. The class trials are rigged, and this whole game is illegitimate. Oh, that. Right. Yeah, I definitely messed that up. Sorry about that. So? So? Is that all you have to say? The viewers won't accept that kind of apology. You gotta no, stop the killing game! <laughs> But I liked that they didn't put Junko in. I thought it was interesting. Um, it seems like you're on the wrong track, so let me explain. Okay, so first, I'll start with the event that inspired me to plan this killing game. The Tier 3 wasn't canon, oh gosh. That was about the time the meteorite impact started intensifying. Did she just start some big story on her she own? She did do a good, um, she did, she does do a good Samugi impression, though, I'll give her that. I knew of Hope's Peak Academy's gopher project, and my inner Junko told me... Crushing the gopher project, humanity's last hope, would be the perfect despair. That's when I took over the killing game I devised. I forced those selected as humanity's last hope to play my killing game. And then I took the name Sumugi Shirogane and sneaked in among them. Did Kokichi know about this? Wasn't he I a don't remnant think of he despair? Was. He was your comrade, right? Huh? Comrade? Junko Enoshima doesn't have comrades. You can see what I'm saying, though, right? Her art looks weird. It looks out of place. Like, the lighting on it is weird. Looks like she's in a white outline. It's like... You don't need a remote after you've thrown out the TV, right? Can, Samugi, can you just go away? The remnants of despair are just a bunch of despair fanboys and fangirls. That you literally brainwashed, but okay. But I am despair itself. I am a god of despair. Kokichi was just one of my believers. A god wouldn't be comrades with one of their believers, right? Eh, I don't know. Then Kokichi Joshua. didn't know your true identity either. <laughs> What a hopeless existence he led. To the end, he had no idea the object of his worship was right under his nose. I, I don't care about your story. Tell us about the people oh. watching. Who's this killing game being shown to? Where are the survivors of humanity? There's nobody watching. Huh? Everyone's dead. We were the last 16 people alive, you know. Who could be watching? Humanity is gone. No, you're lying. If this isn't being shown to anyone, why care so much about rules? You're the one who keeps talking about making the game interesting. For whom? Thank you for your good grammar, Shuichi. That was you're just a nerd. part of my perfect reproduction. You're what? I just perfectly reproduced my own killing game is all. Just like the old Junko. The original was meant to be shown, so that's how I made mine. So far, none of this is super shopping, so I'm waiting for the big surprises. That's it. I'm waiting for the big surprises yep, that's here. That's it. There are no survivors of humanity. Things are just as you recall. 
Like, I feel like we've gone through a lot of the truth holes already. Like, we've already talked about Rentor, we've already no, talked about that's wrong. We've already addressed that the end of the world happened. What? What is, what is, what, is, what else is there? Oh dear! I am so surprised! Maybe we all remember that there's no one left out there. But how do we know our memories are real? <laughs> what do you mean by that? Could you please stop switching? You think it's your driving memories are me wrong? crazy. There's something that's been bothering me about our memories. Here, look at this book. Oh. This book contains years of research about Hope's Peak Academy. Nothing would indicate this book is a prop. I believe the information here is accurate. Sam Junko, yeah, no, for real though. But there's a lot written in here that differs from our memories. What is different? To know that for certain, I'll need everyone's help. I want you all to tell me everything that you remember about Hope's Peak Academy. We applied, but we didn't we apply. About what we according to the book. Okay. Um, so it started with the biggest, most oh, awful, we're not doing most it. I we tragic event in the <laughs> That event originated at Hope's Peak Academy. Is this the one with the floating building, right? Or is that a different one? Around the world. I don't see it. Oh, no, I do see it. Wall. <laughs> There's a floating building right at the top. It would not be hyperbole to say that event. Uh, it's right by my face, right? Mankind. Right there. And it was all caused by a single high school girl. Yeah, it was me. Well, okay, but it was you before. Junko Enoshima enrolled in Hope Speak Academy as the ultimate fashionista. But my real identity was the ultimate despair. I give him props, though, for making the, the model to cover the, the world ultimate despair, villain. I put my plans... Interesting choice. Wait a minute. Something doesn't add up here. Huh? I detect no discrepancy in my memory banks. Yes. Everything we just said is just like we remember it. But it doesn't match what's written in the history of Hope's Peak Academy. Yes, I definitely so you definitely describe this. Spot the difference! <clears throat> Point out what everyone is mistaken about in their memories of Hope's Peak Academy. Alright! Time to play some Dongon Rumba Trivia! Okay. Time to play trivia, I guess. Okay. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. That event originated at Hope's Peak Academy. Inspiring war no, it did. It did start there. Around the world. Right. The cause of all that despair was just a single high school girl. Well, no, it was two of them. A student of Hope's Peak what? Academy. I missed. The ultimate despair. Junko Enoshima! Junko will never I die. I did everything in my power to spread despair over the entire world! The biggest, most awful... That's true. There's two people. Inspiring war and terrorism around the world. Single high school girl. That's wrong! No one cares about the stinky sister. No, I like Mukuro. She's better than Junko. One high school girl started the tragedy, the ultimate despair, Junko Enoshima. At least that's what I remember, but that's not what this book says. Wait, Samuki knew about the twin sister. She mentioned the twin sister. What the freak? She totally outed ultimate herself. Ultimate despair doesn't just refer Didn't to she? Junko Enoshima. It refers to a group and a movement oh. that came after. To put it simply, there's They're more not ultimate despair the than Junko Enoshima. This is the first time I've heard about this. Wasn't Junko the ultimate despair? That's what I recall as well. That label should only apply to her. Coincidences sure are scary. Everyone misremembered the same thing. Coincidence? You're wrong, Ryan. Remembered. Adam, Adam, you're wrong. Gosh darn it, Ryan's correct. Gosh darn it, I'm sorry. There's no coincidence. I know there's a difference in the memory. That's not all. 
There are other discrepancies I'd like to point out. Do it. Ugh, does it even matter? I'm bored already. Just shut up. So, let's continue where we left off. Junko resorted to different tactics to cover the world with despair. Right, you little child. The killing game between the 78th class of Hope's Peak Academy, for example. They were mm. locked up children. and forced into the killing game by the Look, in the front, despair. there's the four best right there in the front. Taka, Chihiro, Sayaka, Byakuya. And then everyone else is meh. Hina's nice. Sakura's good. Everyone else is meh. I don't Events know. That's not what. What? No. And the world He's talking about like a shower, Adam. You got it. The fight between the future foundation and the remnants of despair raged on. But the worst case scenario was avoided. Yay! A oh happy gosh. ending. More points that conflict with the history. Oh, we're, we're gonna still go. Okay. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history. Oh, that sounds bad. Because Junko had prepared countless ways of spreading despair. She did no such thing. Maybe At she the did. killing game of the 78th yeah. class of Hope Peak Academy. What was the 78th class? They were held class? prisoner by the ultimate despair. Oh, no, they weren't. They weren't held prisoner. Is there any back roots during this trial? I haven't noticed any yet. I don't think there it is. It wasn't but... the ultimate despair that trapped the 78th class in Hope's Peak Academy. It was the class themselves. They shut themselves in. Shut themselves in? Why would they shut themselves in? It has to do with the Hope's Peak Academy shelter project. Yeah, the DR2 group was 77th because they came before the 78th class. That's right. During the tragedy, the 78th class. So, in a theory, class... in theory, this would be. One of the first. No, it's assumed that there was Trapped a lot of classes inside after Hope's the new Hope's Peak for protection. So we don't know what class they all were. So our memory of the 78th class being trapped by the ultimate despair. Are you saying our memories are wrong? It just means those documents were written all half-assed. I don't remember. I didn't I no need to notice worry this. About it. Your memories. I didn't are notice that the correct. memories were wrong. What you've been saying isn't consistent. First, you said it was just. I can't believe I didn't notice all that. Huh. Is that so? Let's just move on. I want to talk about one more thing from our memories. It's about the rebuilt Hope's Peak Academy that we were yes, attending. Yes, exactly. What about Hope's Peak? There's no doubt that the 16 of us were students at Hope's Peak Academy. We heard it had been rebuilt and was accepting I was applications like for talented students again. And so, we gathered at the brand new Hope's Peak Academy. Since Hope's Peak Academy was large, we were all in separate classes, but there's no doubt we were students of the new school. It's like thought of something wrong there. Why well, I remember so damn right. Hope's Peak Academy was rebuilt. And it still is. And that... Don't get wrong, my trivia! The of talented students resume. It's wrong! It's wrong. Not true. We applied. We remember Hope's Peak Academy taking applications from talented students. But that's not what's written here. The Academy did not take applications. All of their students were scouted. Ugh. Scouted? I've never I'm sorry, Mew was never useful during a class trial, Adam. She made things that were useful, and she did things that benefited the plot, but she was not a smart cookie, and you cannot try to argue that with me. <laughs> I wasn't scouted. I applied to Hope's Peak Academy on my own. Me too. I chose to come to Hope's Peak. Well, Kizakura wasn't around anymore, Ryan, but... At least, that's, fine. that's what I remember. Are you saying we're remembering it wrong? But what if this book's just wrong? Researchers make mistakes too. Maybe so, but I'm not getting all this from just the book. 
There is other evidence as well. He was still a scout, you're not wrong. Other what? Yeah. I don't the killing game we're in okay. now is one that began with Hope's Peak Academy. Oh, uh, yeah, those are mine. The ones on the top are there. Adam spammed a whole lot of them. I helped with those. She did. She did help with those. I have two others, but... Did I tell you Mallory later told them. me they didn't work and she completely avoided all my work? Like, ignored everything that I did on them. Really? <laughs> I was so hurt. Oh, I did, you didn't tell me that, no. So this is the third game after Hope's Peak and Jabberwock Island. It's not the third game, it's the fourth game. The Future Foundation had a killing game too. Gosh darn it. But remember what Rantaro said? Oh yeah, he was already a winner. What? He is But Rantaro's name wasn't listed among the past participants of the game. He was not present at the two killing games that Junko orchestrated. Then, which killing game did Rantaro participate in? I'm not entirely sure, but it's clearly or he's Murakata. Isn't it? And the inconsistencies don't stop there. Kokichi's account is also suspect. I didn't know you could actually use that word like that. I thought it was just a, a joke that people did. I thought they Kokichi's just account is inconsistent too? Oh, an inconsistency? Do tell. Yeah, there's an inconsistency with how you're lighted. How you're lit. Do you remember it Kokichi you. as a remnant Am I the only one that bothers? But I don't think that's true. He wasn't a remnant of despair. Facts. Don't tell me I'm going like that. A remnant of despair? That's impossible. He was definitely a remnant of despair. The remnants of despair and Kokichi. Ah, sorry, was sorry, leader. Kibo. If he was the one leading the remnants of despair, then he must have been second only to the ultimate despair herself. Okay, but he lied because he's a garbage poo poo dum dum, and I hate him. Yes, he loved me more than anyone. Like an obsessed fan hiding in the bushes. So where's your proof? See, if Mew was here, that would have been a dirty joke, and it would have wasted time. But she's not, so we're good. Kokichi's motive video. This is it. Easy, easy money. The motive video we found in Kokichi's dorm room. Blob, wee, be blobby, blue, be blob, blob, blue. Even his talent was a lie. He's dumb and I hate him and I hate him. An he's organization dumb. centered around petty crimes, one that forbids murder. And in addition to that, the well, group was only that 10 it people. Murder, but... That's far too few to be the same group that tried to sabotage the Gopher project. Well, let, let, let's find out what happened to all his people. I want to know that. Meaning that whatever group Kokichi was a part of, is not the remnants of despair. His motive video clearly contradicts our memories. We don't have memories. The memory we have of Kokichi being a remnant. Oh, we did have that memory. Never mind. <laughs> you mean he wasn't a remnant of despair? That's not possible. Come to think of it, we never actually heard it directly from him. Exactly. But it's still not possible. Kokichi didn't tell us because he wasn't exposed to that flashback light. And neither was Kaito. Kaito didn't appear to know anything about the remnants of despair or Junko Inoshima. If they'd been exposed to it, maybe we'd know the so, truth. Uh, I still don't know how I feel about Kokichi. Maybe it's better that yeah, we I, I, uh, I still have mixed opinion. I need to. I need time to think about Kokichi before I, I can form my like official opinion on it. But wrong. Me? What do you mean? All of these weird inconsistencies are from memories we got from the flashback lights. So the flashback lights are the cause. You found the classroom that makes all the flashback lights, right, Shuichi? Yes. Yes. And I noticed something strange about it. The wall was missing. I actually did a little experimenting with a device hidden in the room. It allowed you to select the memory that a flashback See, light See, but when you say that and then put a cap out at the end of it, it's real. I don't believe you. I have, I have, I have, uh, we'll, we'll talk, we'll talk, we'll talk at the end. 
However, if any of you are still awake, the we'll talk at the end. Consistent with each other. One might say there are survivors, but another would say there are no survivors. Bizarre, right? The flashback lights allegedly help us recover our memories. We're supposed to remember the truth that we forgot, and there should only be one truth. But then, having the option to recover contradictory memories doesn't make sense. Then what are you saying? Whoa, okay, computer. Calm down. Calm down. What are you doing? It got very, very laggy all of a sudden. Is it because I'm on Wi-Fi? No, probably huh? not. If anything, it's because this is on the Wi-Fi and this is on the Wi-Fi. <laughs> The flashback light isn't for recovering lost memories? Is that what you're saying? When did I save last? Good point, Ryan. There we go. It's back. That's a fair assumption. That's that's a fair thing to ask. I'm glad you did, Ryan. It seems to be doing better. Sometimes it just gets weird. Then what was it for? What was it for, huh? Shut up. Go on, tell them. What are the flashback lights for? Like you select different memories with these memories contradict each other. Oh gosh, do I gotta do a freaking hangman's hair do a hangman's donut? Yep. Knew it. Plain! I can spell plain! <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what word I'm trying to spell here. If. Plant. Why do they word the hangman's gambit so weird in this game? Why do they do this? Just every one of them I felt yes, was very that's weird. It. The flashback light isn't supposed to help us remember anything. It's a tool for implanting false memories. Implanting memories? <laughs> you guys are 12. I know I am, but come on. Yes, the memories you could select for the flat they were memories Sorry, to be implanted to inside us. That's why the contents of those memories contradict each other. Once we're exposed to a flashback light, those memories become the truth to us. So the memories we recovered with the flashback lights were not real. They were all false memories. Oh my gosh. They or Himiko. <laughs> Himiko is the one that wanted him the whole game. Lies! Oh, what a horrible truth! If the memories from the flashback lights are lies, then everything was a lie! All oh, the suspense and foreshadowing was for nothing! Can you believe it? It's like everything that happened didn't matter at all. That sentence sums up my feelings about Kokichi. The end. Well, that is what it means. Huh? Lies are just like snowballs. The more you roll them, the bigger they get. I saw all the events. Yeah, I saw all the free time events except for the first one with the nail brush, and I've since seen that one. Uh, the bigger they are, the more fun and shocking it is when they're revealed. That's why That's everything up till now has been lies. Again, you. That's the truth. Would have so many comments about that line. The memories from the flashback lights were just lies. It's just as Shuichi said. Um, it's worth going back if if it's still memories. up, Adam. It might be worth going back because you can. I I well, I'll just tell you the joke. I won't make you go back and find it. But basically, when that scene came up, I I zoomed in the screen and then cropped Himiko out of that screen because I was uncomfortable. For implanting new ones. The light they emit is actually information that has been converted to light waves. 
that light is beamed directly into the brain, causing a deja vu sort of phenomenon. I've been here in this place the before. The brain gets confused and thinks the info it just received happened in the past. We were just confused? For example, your memories of being students of Hope's Peak Academy? Hey, <laughs> you guys don't have anything to do with Hope's Peak Academy. Really? None of us were ever students there. It was just a fake memory. We're not students from Hope's Peak? Really? Yep, that was all fake. Looking back, it was a mistake to have you remember Hope's Peak. I mean, I've given my thoughts on this whole, like, oh, the FBI, who oh, did the thing, you know, but... I didn't originally plan on giving you those also, memories, but I, I was streaming and I, I was in a rush and was... overlooked all those okay. inconsistencies, so you figured it all out. <laughs> it's hopelessly the worst. So that's why Kokichi had to die. Why did Kokichi have to die? <laughs> Good job, Mr. Detective. You got it. The only reason we thought Kokichi was a remnant was because of the flashback lights. Gosh, that. But he did say that he was the leader of a cult organization. That was a lie he invented himself. He wanted to be the mastermind. <clears throat> he wanted us to believe it. That's why he lied. Why? I don't understand what, he, what you mean by that. Why would he lie? I don't understand. He usurped the mastermind's role. But in doing so became a thorn in their because side. Because he was bored? Because he wanted so to, to get beat rid them? Of I don't know. The mastermind played along with the lie. The mastermind manipulated us into thinking Kokichi was a remnant of despair. At the same time, having everyone remember Hope's Peak Academy... I'm glad. I'm glad. Adam. Please, please, please do it as you, you feel a remnant necessary. Of despair. You were using the flashback lights to control I mean, us? Ryan used it to Photoshop a, a photo one time. Use the emote to censor one, so you know. And the reason I tried to kill Kokichi was. You were being controlled by false memories, like putty in the mastermind's hands. But Maki wasn't the only one being controlled. You all were! Remember when Kokichi revealed the truth of the outside world? You all got so depressed, you couldn't even focus on the killing game! Wait, then, to make us recover from that, you. Yep! We gave you memories of being Hope's Peak Academy students, the symbol of hope. Oh, interesting. Okay, interesting. So you all could face despair. You controlled us with that fake memory? Um, I, yeah, I don't know which ones are worth watching. It kind of depends what you like, but I... <laughs> Well, I've enjoyed the game. Like, don't get me wrong. I have enjoyed the game. I just feel like if I had to summarize it, it's been nothing but really exciting ideas that don't go through. We'll we'll talk about it at the end of the stream if you're still around. New but. mysteries and truths turn to motivation. Motivation drives a story. Everything. Oh, you just keep forgetting big moments. That's fair. Motivation to move you forward. Well, I will. I will eventually make a highlights of all the streams I've been downloading. Uh, and them, I guess it was fake motivation. The highlights won't come till like November, so don't don't be too excited. <laughs> you idiots kept getting jerked around by meaningless. Why do we always lies? use this phrase? I don't like that phrase. This class trial was like that too, wasn't it? Why was it you were so motivated to do it? Because you got a memory from one of the flashback lights, right? Was that also a memory you used to control us? Hey, what was it you guys remembered from it again? At first, you ran away from the Gopher Project. Humanity's last hope. No. I like it when Hina does, Adam. <laughs> Remember? It's highlighted on this, uh, on this channel if you ever watch that. To accept your fate. Oh, Mitch is fine. You took on all the wishes of your friends and family? Hello, Mitch. I'm alive. How you been? And now, you remember how you got here. That's right, that's what you're doing. Fun, fun. You remembered that you had all been entrusted with the world's hope, right? Remembering the weight of that hope should have made you feel stronger. I have to escape. I'll never give oh, up. No. I won't My chat is frozen again. Mastermind. 
Gosh darn it. I have to rely on the, the phone for the moment. Even though Kaito and Kokichi were gone, and Kibo started to go berserk. Oh no, the chat's not frozen, just the stream is. You okay, never mind. Up hope. You decided to face this killing game, right? You were controlling our emotions? Even our resolve to defeat the mastermind? This is a killing game. A death game where emotions run like blood. There we go. The participants are trying their best to live. It's just not very exciting. Someone say something. Let me just double check that it works. Oh, the memories were fake. Then what was everything till now? That memory. And that Thanks, memory. Ryan. Cool. It works. And that memory 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 and that. If they were all fake memories, then. Just My plans for mankind's last killing game kind of just fell apart. Huh? So figure out why on your own. This is a class trial after all. Then, who are you? Hmm? I don't know who you are. Oh, what's not to understand? I became me. What about that don't you get? If this killing game is... How do you keep quick changing? Academy, then I believe you. This is certainly the work of someone carrying on Junko Inoshima's will. But we have nothing to do with Hope's Peak. So you can't be Junko. So who the hell are you? I mean, no one else. Stop talking. What? What is this? Huh? You know him, don't you? He was in the Jabberwock Island killing game. I'm Hajime Hinata. No, you're not. You're a bad Hajime. That's not what we mean. What are you doing? I do appreciate the whole throwback. Give me Monami, or I give I me doing? death. I'm just cosplaying. Cosplaying? Give me Monami. Yeah, this is just cosplay. <gasps> My girl, what's good? But it's not just normal cosplay, because <laughs> I can perfectly replicate the character. Stop what you're saying. Stop what you're doing to me. Check it out! Even my voice sounds exactly the same! Well, not for, uh, not for Hajime, but... Is Junko and Oshima also? Give me Sayaka. Give me Chihiro. I don't care. Just give me one of them. Yes, it's my cosplay. Gosh darn it. I can perfectly reproduce a number of characters and actually become them! Peko, Ibuki... Monokuma, Makoto, Naegi. I don't know whose jacket that is. Is that Hina's jacket? That's Hina's jacket. Hajime's shirt, Mahiru's tie. Someone's something. Echo's hair. What is the tape thing? This is the talent of the ultimate cosplayer. No, I figured. Honestly, I figured, Adam. There was a part of me that was like, maybe she, uh, maybe, maybe those characters come back at some point. How can she cosplay as students of Hope's Peak But I also Academy? did just think it was for the, um, for the end. Like, for the end of the game, the post-game stuff. Nurse tape, yeah, that makes sense. Because Sumugi told us... How would that look like? By what? I don't know, by some form of bug. Um... No. I just thought you should know. Alright. I've been, I've been consumed by an insect. Oh, it ate me. It ate me. Ah, you remembered! Yes, uh, exactly Sayaka, right. your hair. My girl. That's Kazuichi's stuff, that's Leon's thing. Those are Kyoko's boots. Ifumi's tie. Oh, please be me. Adam, you will respect her and not make fun of the things that she says. Oh, so then, Do you need any what cream? does this mean? Makoto, go away. What? If what I said was the truth, then Hope's Peak Academy was... 
what was Hope Speak Academy was. So we can cosplay for something that must be like Hope Speak Academy is. It's fictional. It's no, 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 don't you be getting meta on me here. No, 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 Pikachu, come here. Come here, Pikachu, I need you. No, 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 no. Fictional? No, 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 no. The biggest, most awful, most tragic event in human history never happened. I know how you feel about me and waifus. Oh, gosh, oh, no. I'd like to present to you Daddy Biakuya. Which one? The, the one. The one. There's a lot of them. No, the one right here in the center of the one. screen. The one in the suit? Yeah. What that's about him? That, that's Daddy. That's all. I just thought you should know. Hope Speak, the, the Future Foundation, and the Remnants of Despair. Oh no, this is this is this is a thing. Oh, okay. This has become a long he's been in every game in the in the series so far. Okay. So it's been like a long run it's been a long term growth. But um He's officially earned his place as the husbando. So I just thought you should know. I'm glad. Because it's all fiction. Look! Ah, oh, he's fat! <laughs> Did you tell them all about how? All of those events took place within a fictional world known as Dongan Rampa. Oh, Kyoko, honey, that is not your voice. Um, yeah, we watched Hal's Moving Castle. He's pretty cool. I like him, but. Quote 19. There it is. That's the quote. Sorry, what? The quote 19 right there. The... I can't read Give it. Give me that big D, Byakuya. Because he graded my score every chapter. Oh, okay. And so he gave me a D because I did bad. And I told him to give me the D and spit on me. It's fine. Okay. Priscilla, do you regret dating me yet? <laughs> <laughs> That's what today was. Gung gun. Run. Also, I'd like to not uh, disc discredit what is happening in game. I am very upset by all of this. He's trying to handle it, like... They told me everything is a lie. I'm not skipping them. No, I'm I'm paying attention, and I'm very upset by it. I'd like to address that. Um, it's something. It's something. I'm sorry. Vyakia showed up. What do you want me to do? Just not address him? Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm a little... okay. Okay. That's right! Me, that nasty pig barf, and everyone else are all fictional! <laughs> Hold on. Yoko! <laughs> Hope's Peak Academy doesn't exist? No, because it's fiction! Doesn't exist in the real world! So do you exist? What universe are we in now? Do you exist in the real world? Are we all... What? Isn't that surprising? Yeah. Yeah. Up till now, you thought fiction was fact. Did someone say metafiction? Yeah, I, I don't know how I feel about it, Adam. But fiction is just fiction. Dungan Rampa's just fiction. But my love for them is real. This whole Dungan Rampa story was just stuffed into your memories. As people, as characters, not as not as women. Just as for the record. You're not paying attention. Not. Cool, good. What's up, Ondo? How you doing? For that reason, <gasps> we all believed that work of fiction was, in fact, reality. God bless Sonya. And that's how we put on a cosplay performance for everyone to see. I'll let you linger on this, Ryan. Here you go. Give me Sayaka. I will be upset if I do not get Sayaka or Chihiro. One of the two. A cosplay performance of the whole wide dog and rump of world! Because they brought back ones that didn't share a voice actor. Right? Like, like Mondo didn't share a voice actor with anyone in this game. So they brought back ones that didn't share a voice actor. Chihiro and Sayaka both share a voice actor with the girl who is this girl. Like... <laughs> of the whole wide world? So, this was all fake? Everything was made up? Well, yes, but do we need to... Do we need to do this to me? So Chiaki was not only fake, she was fake within a fake within a fake. Full time. We thought it was real? Like, I already knew she was fake within a fake video game, but now you're telling me that she's fake within the fake video game of the fake universe that I'm currently playing. I'm upset. Did you think the ultimate cosplayer's talent was only limited to characters? She's triple fake, Ryan. 
It'd be kind of lame if that was all the big bad mastermind. Could She's do. fake in DR2. She's fake in V3 DR2. And she's fake because this is a game. Like, you know what I'm saying? It hurts me. Same, Ryan. Same. I can do far more than that. I can cosplay the world itself. Okay, do it. Turn into the world. You won't. So if you want to make me your enemy, then your enemy is the world of Danganronpa itself. Oh, don't you pull this on me. No, 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 no. Samugi is garbage. Danganronpa itself? Why are they saying? I don't like this. But... Why? Why would you do this? Why make us think it's real? Well, duh. It's so you don't play the killing game. This is the world of Danganronpa, you know? No shit we're playing the killing game. But it's not just any killing game. <laughs> Hello, Nagito. Welcome back. <laughs> Shall I call it thinking time? It's a killing game that takes place in the real world, propped up by fiction. No, I'm going to linger on this. Adam, take it in. Enjoy it. You may not like him, and I agree, we can hate him, but I love hating him. He is probably top three characters of the whole series for me. In other words, it's ultimate real fiction. Ultimate real fiction? It's interesting to hear which ones don't, um remember how to do the voice perfectly and which ones do. But if it's fiction, if everything isn't real, then the world being in ruins is also fiction, right? Yeah, hello, Mr. Andy. The world outside is fine, right? Let me know before you leave. I'm on the computer. I'll watch it. I figured. I just want to... That's right. Of course. How did you like that That's scene? Fact. Our staff <laughs> very hard on it. Staff? Stop talking. There's no need to worry about the people backstage. You talk. Such a good boy. Anyway, back to our conversation. You guys can just relax. Look, it's you. Short redhead. Big pictures. Pretty lady, it's you. Oh, thank you. Hasn't yeah. been destroyed. So, yes, you're better than a fictional character. But... I mean, I assume that, but am I as cool as this character? Uh, she's actually medium. It's not destroyed. So you you're much cooler. Go nah, that ain't happening. Go away, hero! I hate him. <laughs> this is like the end game. Yeah. So okay. essentially, what's happening, and I don't, I'm, I'm gonna spoil this because I don't think she ever intended to play this series. Zero out of ten. Essentially, what's yeah. happening. Is the, the the three games that led up to this? Well, the two main important games that led up to this. Okay. Um, this girl is they're all ultimate talents. She's the ultimate cosplayer, and she's essentially okay. telling them all that those two games were in fact games and did not matter and were not real. And the universe of this game is the real world when those games were fake game world. So essentially, we're playing a game that's telling us the previous games were games. And so she's just turning into all the different characters from the past two games because she's the cosplayer and she can only cosplay fictional characters. And so oh. it's like a throwback. It's like a it's like a oh look, it's all of the characters coming back. Why? But if it's the actually world is still intact, then we have homes to return to That's all. I told you that ain't happening, you dumb sea urchin headed Wait, that's me. <laughs> Ryan says, describing Danganronpa to normies. Yeah, it is wrong? difficult. Do you really want to know? <laughs> I don't want to know until Samugi <laughs> turns into Monami, or Chihiro, or Sayaka. That's all I care about. The walls of this academy are your world now. The outside world is of no concern to you. The audience certainly agrees with me. Sure. Isn't that right, you guys? Hopefully I disagree. someone on your stream appreciates this, but at least you're not trying to explain Kingdom Hearts to me, because yeah, that's everyone has tried to explain That's fair. That I've me. never I played it. Go, what? I might eventually play it on stream, but I've never played it. Yes. I need to get a PlayStation before I play it on stream, but... That's typically how it works. Adam says, I agree. Okay, thank you. I think he might be agree with Monokuma. Oh, well... <laughs> or with you, I don't know. It's just agree with you. Um, hello, what, what, what? 
Is it time? Are we doing the more phenomenal trial grounds? This is what I was trying to fix with these videos that lag severely. Uh. He turned the key and I'm sorry. No, 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 no. I don't want real people in my Donnie Hall book game. Hey, it's you. Kyoko is my waifu. Lol, dude, you watching? Sakura is my muscle wife. <laughs> Watching this killing game transpire. What the frick? Of course, those you see here are only a fraction of our total viewers. Oh, Sakura, honey, you forgot how to do that voice. Oof. This is muscle waifu. Oh. I don't really think she's a waifu, but she's a good person. Watching us. It's just like Shuichi said. This was all arranged because people want to see it. God bless the broken road. This girl got the least amount of screen time out of the entire series. Oh, okay. And she is the waifu. Sayaka. I just- I'm, I'm gonna make them linger because they hate her. Because, sure, she tried to kill a man. It's complicated, but... Okay. She's the best, and I'm gonna linger on this. That's not true! That's the girl that Matt likes more than you. That's not true! That's not <laughs> true! That's not true! That's rude, and that's not true. Matt, what'd you name your Eevee? I've named it Emmy. Oh, okay. From Katawa Shoujo. She's not so in this not game. This. It's not this girl. Alright, it's time to have a friend. So this Bye. was all a show. This whole killing game. Yeah. Everyone in this whole peaceful world watches this show. Sweet shot. Peaceful world? Yeah, probably sister. <laughs> the outside world is peace itself. There's no despair or wars and... Oh gosh. All the people in this peaceful world are straight up crazy for this killing game! Adam out here just trying to relationships. <laughs> no, you're not. Yeah, I mean... My husband is Shuichi! <laughs> I like the one that's constantly like, Mal, do you watch me? I believe in Keebs. <laughs> what does it say? Viewers get to participate now. That cosplay is incredible. Wow. Yaki is number one waifu. It's on! Oh, man. Too bad. I'm a viewer. Jackie number... You could do it, Shuichi. Bring on the spoilers. No, don't bring on the spoilers. First. Wait, there's a hidden Monokuma. I saw it. Can I click the Monokuma guy? There's a Monokuma there. I see him. Wait. Why would a peaceful world need a game like this? It's because the world is so peaceful that this killing game is necessary! Oh, Kiyotaka, you forgot your voice, too. It is so very peaceful. And so... It is so very boring. That's Ryan's favorite. One of his favorites. No. With so I don't much like peace, her, people have become but... bored. They need stimulation. Give me Chihiro. Give me Chihiro. So could fulfill that need. Ultimate real fiction? What are we- what? Nah, she sucks. Okay, Every that's fair. Every person in the outside world watching this is a huge Danganronpa fan. And Priscilla. What? What, what about me? <laughs> she just said every person in the outside world watching this is a huge Danganronpa and, fan. And then there's me. And then I said, and Priscilla. Yeah. Everyone loves the killing games. Accurate. This killing game I don't love the killing game. games, I love the characters and watching them go throughout the killing games and solving the mystery. I don't want any of them to die except for maybe Kokichi. And oh, it's everyone's killing school semester. This, is this killing game is the latest entry in Don Don Rompa. Boo! Second worst character of the whole series. Boo! The long awaited sequel that everyone has been waiting for! That's not how he sounded, but okay. This is the truth of this killing game! Isn't it the ultimate real fiction? I'm no different than these people. You're probably right, but like, oh well. You love the commentary of it. It is cool. It is cool. They're basically being like, haha, you're all dweebs. <laughs> basically. We... We were forced to play some fictional killing game? Dungan Rampa! 
way too late. There's no Dongon Rampa without Monokuma. Is that why he said it was unrelated to the past games? Because the past games were like not real, so it's unrelated to I hate the creator. Since <laughs> I'm here, that means this is Dongon Rampa. Stop. this can't you tell it's the title of the current dangan rampa you guys are doing a testament to the unquenchable thirst this blood-soaked world has for dangan rampa this is the other husband though not quite to the degree of Byakuya, but he's he's called the ultimate breeder and he breeds animals and he has four little hamsters that he calls the four dark devas of destruction and they're very adorable <gasps> my boy! My baby child! I was waiting for him. I was waiting for him. I love Chihiro. He's so tender. He deserves all the love. Huh? How long has it gone on? I'm just disappointed. Did you forget what season of Duncan Rampa this is? You guys are dumber than ants. <laughs> Shuichi, what do you think? Don't ask me, Makoto! What number of killing game is this? What season do you think we're on? Well, we're on three, you should be able to tell from the logo. What number is that, Shuichi? Gosh darn it. <laughs> nope, nope, and if nope, that's nope, not nope, enough nope. of a hint, just feast your eyes below my belt. Nope, 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 the nope, The backstory. Nope, nope. Here's that Matt fell in love with Chihiro thinking he was a girl. So he has the gay now. For the record, I never said Chihiro is a waifu. For the record, I said Chihiro was a tender child that I love and adore. And that has all stayed true. His gender doesn't matter, okay? I'm glad the effort they go into to try to embarrass you. It's fine. Adam is the despair I'm mod. He's here to cause me. Adam's given me like $10 today, so Great. just to embarrass me, so I'll take it, you know? Are you really gonna make me click the logo? I hate you. I hate you. I hate you, game. What? 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 Okay, hold on. I we're gonna hold on. We can I can pause this. I swear I can pause this. Thirteen. Three. Where's the V? There's no V. Seven. There's no. Oh, zero. Zero. I'm done. What? It is season three. We agree on this, yes? There's no V! I understand that it's V3, there's no V! Oh, maybe? I'm sorry. 53rd you have gone shit. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 53? Could this be the 53rd one? But it's not! What? Okay, bye. Okay, hold on. I'll be right back, guys. Hold on. <laughs>
Okay, look, in my defense, in my defense, in my defense, in my defense, okay, in my defense, there was a lot going on. There was a lot of characters that popped in in between Junko the 53rd and um, my sweet children. So, also, I'm just dumb. We know I'm dumb. Um, but that's not how you write Roman numerals. It would be five. It would be V-I-I-I. I'm just saying. Yeah, V equals five, but it's not 50. V does not equal 50. It'd either be V space I-I-I, or it'd be like L or whatever. Ding, ding, correct. This is the 53rd season of Dongan Runner. Also, this is bothering me. How is it the 53rd season? I know, I corrected myself. Hush, children. In other words, Dongan Rumpa V3's official name is. Get wrecked, Lolo. <laughs> Get wrecked, Lolo. 53 equals trash. I love Shuichi. It's been on for so long. V is the Roman numeral for 5. Dongan Rumpa 25 was the best. It's really 54. I love Shuichi. Don't call it trash. 53. I hate this game. With the Hope's Peak Academy arc in Danganronpa 1, 2, then 3. Final Danganronpa, Final Fantasy, Dream Danganronpa, Shin Danganronpa, The Return of Danganronpa, Miracle Danganronpa, Anniversary Danganronpa. The seasons just kept coming, and with it came more killing games! I, I, I need to let it settle before I can Until officially give you my opinion. Anime to become this! The ultimate real fiction. I it, I need to I need to settle my opinion before I can really tell you how I feel about it. So far, I like it. I like what they're doing with it. And now we're in the fifty-third season of Dragon. It's an interesting meta. It's an interesting commentary. I, I like where they're going with it. I just need to see where they end. Fifty-third season. What? Did a letter in there throw you off? Well, I guess that happens. It was him the whole time. It's Leon. Um. So question then, question then, because I did kind of miss this. I misunderstood this. When they say ultimate real fiction, they're saying that these characters are fake but real. Is that what they're saying? That like, yes, these characters are fake, and yes, this is all fake, but to them it's real. Is that what they're saying? But isn't it just rad? I'll see. It looks okay. like a letter. But it's really a number? I hate this game. I hate this game so much. I hate this game so much. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I'm so mad they did that. Oh, whoa. It's a letter that looks like a number. Maybe it's a number that looks like a letter. Maybe it's 11037. Leon! <laughs> I'm so mad. I'm so mad at this game. Our title is the 53rd, as this is the 53rd game we have masterminded. It was supposed to be a hint, but whatever. I'm over it. Have we talked to every character at this point? I think we've talked to every character. Pekko? We haven't seen Pekko. We haven't seen... We haven't seen Pekko. We haven't seen... Um... Mukuro, technically. Um... Pekko, Mukuro... Um... We saw Hifumi, we saw Kiyotaka, we saw... We saw Sakura, Hina, Kyoko. Toko, Yakuya, Makoto, Hiro. Yeah, the only one we haven't seen is Pekko. Since this is the 53rd season, one would expect to see a multitude of characters. But you only have memories from the first two, so you wouldn't recognize any of them. you, game. <laughs> That's why I've limited myself to only <clears throat> cosplaying as Hope's Peak characters. I hate that voice. It's just Sakura, honey. Is it sinking in yet? This killing game is just the 53rd season of Danganronpa. The 53rd... The four Dark Devas were circling around him. Trapped in a fictional Danganronpa-inspired world and forced to play the killing game. That is what the world desired from you. Ah, oh, sweet daddy. So yes, 
I'm the mastermind. But the real mastermind. Don't say it's me. Don't say it's me. I don't like this. The people of the outside world. I don't like this. Don't say that I'm the mastermind. The people of the outside world are the Hi, ones who are I'm the mastermind. No, the mastermind. Go ahead, go ahead. I'm the mastermind, but I'm the anti-mastermind. <laughs> Put Maki back on, K okay, thanks. <laughs> S tier. Mm, Shuichi's nose. <laughs> Posting in an epic chat. This is the best thing I have ever seen. <laughs> oh, been a while since I saw you, 11037. <laughs> Mastermind? The freaking the game. The reason I made this world? The reason you guys did the killing game? It's all because the outside world wants it, you know? I can't lie. This is really it's good. It's me. It's everyone involved in this project. Project? What? You don't know what that is? Is your brain leaking oil or something? Every time Hiyoko comes back on screen, I remember how much I love her, and I don't know why. The anime really made me like her, and I don't know why. Because she was garbage in the game. But I really like her in the anime, and she makes me laugh now. The ones managing this killing game aren't psychos like the remnants of this Give me Pekko. She's the only one They're left. They're literal managers! Literally! So I want to hear your best guess. Spike what company off, off, is running off. this show? Shut the frick up. I hate this game. I love it, but I hate it. Oh, hi, Monokuma. Cool. That that was easy. Well, it's not the school, that's for sure. It's not Danganronpa. Is it Team Danganronpa? It could be Team Danganronpa. No, it's like shoots up. There we go. No, wait, that is Team Danganronpa. Hold on. Is it Team Don Rumpa? I think it is Team Don Rumpa, actually. Hold on, I think it is. I see it. That's really funny. That's really funny. This is really funny. Team Danganronpa? What it says at the start of this game. This game is a work of fiction. Shut up. Shut up. Yeah, the company that makes Danganronpa is called Team Danganronpa. She sounds different, but I love her. Mm. You guys are behind in your studies. The audience knew the answer right away. Give me, give me, give me the Warriors of Hope. I know you won't, but give them to me. It's in the title credits at the start, too. Yay, Pekko! Okay, everyone's here. Don't play the credit. Don't play this again for me, too. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, everyone. Oh, no. Oh no. We have to watch this again. Well, let's talk for a minute then, because we're going to be here a while. Um, <laughs> I have uh, a lot of opinions. I have a lot of opinions. I tried. For the record, I did try to fix it today. I did try to fix it, but for some reason the game wouldn't let me... Like, I have the files and I have everything I needed to do, but the game wouldn't let me unpack the video file from the actual game. It just wasn't working on my computer. I had the software and everything to unpack the video files and replace them, 
but it just wasn't letting it happen, so. It, um, I did try. I did try, though. For the record, I did try to fix this, because I was told that there would be videos. Um, I just like that they bring everyone back. Let's talk about whose uh, voices sucked. Um, um, cause we're only on Ultra Spare, so we still gotta get through the anime and V3, so, um, oh, it's a dang good twist, I like it, it's, it, it was, I was hesitant at first, but the way that they're dealing with it, I really like, where it's basically just a commentary on me and all the people that bought these games, I like that, um, I, I, I think most of the characters, I'm impressed that they remember the voices, like, some of them are really good, some of them are pretty bad. Hajime is pretty bad, Sakura is so bad. Um, Chihiro's not great. Next, Danganronpa, Despair Beyond Hope. Oh, stop what you're doing to me. I agree. No, it's really good. I understand why people compare this to Doki Doki now. Like, like, um... 2 had Doki Doki elements to it, and even 1 did with the killing game, with the mysteries and stuff like that. It's really cool. 2 got very meta, and, um, but now I understand. Now I understand why people compare this to Doki Doki. See, I think this is more similar to it. 2 is funny, and 2 is cool with it being a game and everything, but this is literally saying, no, this is a video game, you're in a video game. It, and like this meta stuff is really interesting to me. I, I I love it. It's great. It's really cool. It's really really cool. Where does Ultra Despair Girls fit in though? Is it like still season two? Is it season one? What season is it? I need to know. Well, and that's the thing is like. I knew a lot of things about this game, right? I've seen the it's a lie, it's all a lie thing. Um, and I had no idea. I had no idea. I, I totally, this has been almost blatantly spoiled for me, and I had no idea because I never would have guessed. It's so good. It's so brilliant. It's so brilliant. I love it. It's really cool. It's so good. I care about it. I like the story. I agree that the actual, like, game itself is pretty bad, but I like Ultra Despair Girls for the story. I think the story's strong. I think Kamara is really annoying in retrospect. Um, she's cute, but she's annoying. I'm also a part of Team Danganronpa. Oh, shut the frick up. I'm a voice actor. The finest killing entertainment. Everyone enjoys our work oh so much. And our newest project is Don't Gun Run for V3 Killing Harmony. I hate this. I hate this so much. Hate it, but I love it. Hate it, but I love it. That's fair. That's fair. A heart pounding killing game brought to life by Ultimate Real Fiction. Shut up. Shut up. You created an entire fictional world to make us do this fictional killing game? No matter oh, yeah, how many no, false did. memories we've been implanted with, we aren't fictional! You sure about that? What? Either way, I don't want to do this anymore. How are we going to conclude go this? That's impossible. Didn't I tell you that you have no homes to go back to? What? Why not? Because you're just like us. You only exist within the world of Duncan Rampa. Speaking of which, has anyone seen my hope? I seem to have misplaced it. I think we should get together and have some thinking time. I love doing his voice, Adam. He's my favorite voice of the entire series to do. Honestly, genuinely, he's my Just favorite like voice. You <laughs> still don't get it? You just need to ask yourselves one question. Why is it not Sayaka on my screen? <laughs> Who the hell are you guys? 
Who are we? Who are we? We're fictional characters! I share our voices! Leon! We're the same. We're all... just like you? Yes! That's right! You're all fictional, too! Oh, gosh. That voice line is really attractive. Huh? So we're just fictional characters created solely for this killing game. I agree with that, me uh, that assessment, Adam. That one time, I agree with that assessment. So I agree with that. about it, I'm afraid. Dangan Rampa is that kind of property. Oh, shit. Uh, what are you saying? We are not fictional! We're living, breathing people! Himiko, I hate to break this to you. I control where you are looking. Your immaterial existence is a fabrication independent of your actual flesh. He is the best character to deliver this line. Give me the hamsters. Oh, sorry, Jeff. Yep, you're all fictional. I kicked the desk real hard there. You guys out there beyond the fourth wall already knew that, right? That's not what Ibuki sounds like. It is, but it isn't. You all didn't look like this when you first came to the Ultimate Academy. Those were your true selves. Now you're all just fictional characters. That's the truth. Interesting. Our real identities are normal people. You're just normal, average, everyday people with no ultimate talent whatsoever. You disgust me. Where's your ultimate talents? You really call yourselves the symbols of hope? You guys aren't even ultimates. You just sit here, you're some lame, boring, reserve department character. You can't do anything. Hajime. What? When you guys came to this academy for the first time, you were just boring, everyday high school students. Interesting. You were Hot take. With no talent, just like me. Um, none of them look better than this art. Hot take. I like their ultimate designs better. I think for every one of them, except Karakio, he creeps me out. But Mew's ultimate design is a real big thing um, that I didn't know I'd be into. Tenko's I'm into. Maki's I'm into. Well, Schoolgirl Maki's kind of cute. Angie's better as an ultimate. Himiko's better as an ultimate. Smoogie's just garbage either way. Kaito looks pretty cool, actually. Kaito looks cool as is. Same with, uh, same with, um... Kibo looks a little too 1950s for me. A little too World War II for me. Uh, Rantaro looks good. Karekia looks better like this. Uh, Kokichi's a little... I don't know how I feel about him. Gota is cute, but... I like him better as an ultimate, and actually, I take it back. Kirumi looks good like this. She looks really good like that. But boring everyday characters have no right to be in Danganronpa. So you are all made more suitable for your new roles. I love Byakuya. He's always he's always relevant. You think Makoto is the connecting thread? To the first no, Byakuya is the connecting thread between this whole series. You think Monokuma is the thread? No, 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 no. Byakuya is the one. You are all given personalities, talents, and upbringings to create your characters. It was totally rad. I want her to say something like that. Much like that delightful documentary, Making a Murderer. Stop what you're saying to me. Stop what you are talking. Stop. Stop, 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 stop. That's a real thing on Netflix. Stop, stop, stop. Of course Sony would watch that. <laughs> well, if she was real. point that the prologue of this story began. Wow. Which means your ultimate talents are all just fiction. Our talents as well? That's probably a good thing for you, Maki. It means you didn't kill people. Yep. Your talents are a bunch of lies. I mean, they suited you to a certain extent, 
but mostly in a placebo effect sort of way. What, you're saying you don't like 40-year-old soccer mom Pecco, Ryan? Who wants to divorce her husband but doesn't want to split the family apart for the children? And really just needs a good three-long day vacation in um, Beverly Hills where she could just drink wine and just sit on the beach? You're telling me you don't like... My young master, I am sorry. Please forgive me. Instructor, I am here. I am present in class. I apologize. My young master. Kinda like a form of auto-suggestion. You know, like if you do it, it'll all work out. That's what she said in game two! Ah! My young master, I love you. I am sorry to have killed a person on your behalf. Please forgive me, my young master. But it's not just your talents. It's your personalities, families, memories. It's all fiction created by the flashback light. I'm, it's interesting to me that Mahiru is getting a ton of lines. Why'd they pick Mahiru? She, uh... Like, I love it, but she doesn't share a voice. Is it just the people who didn't share voice actors in this game are getting more lines? Can you really say you're not fictional now? This is interesting to me. Even if your body is real, your identities, personalities, talents, and past are all fiction. Can you really say none of this is fictional now? Wait a minute. What are you babbling about? Identities, personalities, so people hated this though. People hated this. I know people really did not like the ending to this game. It's not stupid. Isn't this what you all wanted? I like this. I think this is super interesting. But people hated this then. We wanted this? Yeah, you wouldn't remember. But you guys were all from the outside world. Shut up. It's not strange at all that you'd want to be part of the show you love. You sound too much like Samuki, but mwah. No way! Are you saying we wanted to participate in this killing game? That's not possible! How could we ever- Please, everyone, take a look at this! Okay, I'll do anything you ask, Amichi Hero. Number 154. My name is- I hate that, Ryan. I hate that. I've always been such a huge fan of Danganronpa and always wanted to be in one. If I were a contestant, I would want to be... We already had one! Detective. That's why it doesn't matter, because we probably had so many repeats at this point. I know there's been a few in the past, and I've always loved those characters. Shuichi's a Kyoko slut, confirmed. <laughs> so I would want to be one of them. Uh, but I don't have to be a detective. I'll be anything to be part of the show. And I mean that. Anything. I do anything to be part of Danganronpa. I promise, if I get selected, I will work as hard as I can. I will come up with the best, most gruesome murders, I promise. Everyone will love it. And an ultimate detective hasn't been the blackened yet, so I'm sure I could do that. I'm also thinking about the perfect punishment for an ultimate detective. Oh gosh, I... We all do this. We all have done this, though. That's the thing, is I hate this, but we've all done this. I thought Maki would have the coolest execution. And I love Maki. What was that? Wasn't that you, Shuichi? No, it can't be. I'd never say something like... You wouldn't say that now, but this is you before you became who you are now. So, let me guess. Everyone dies. Everyone becomes... We get to see the execution. Give it to me. What? When we saw your audition tape, we had a flash of inspiration. The wig. Oh, That's why we made your character and had you join the gang. Gosh darn it, what did she say? The weakest ultimate detective ever. Wouldn't it be great to see him grow? And that's exactly why he's my favorite protagonist. Gosh darn it, game, why do you read my mind? I'm angry, Pikachu. Thor, help me. I've named him Thor, by the way. Alright, I have to answer my phone really quick and then I will be. The rest of you are no different. 
You auditioned and were selected as well. Team DR knows my every move. I hate them. Auditioned? <laughs> yeah, you were all so excited when you were selected. Show me more. Show me more auditions. I want to see them. I believe it was right after you all received your ultimate wardrobe. Huh? What am I wearing? How nice! Now you look more like ultimates. Huh? So... Memories is all been waiting for. You guys are ready? We in a demand killing game. Killing game? Could it be? We were selected. Stop. All right. We got picked, really? All right. <laughs> Whoa, really? I'm selected for it too. We really said that? Oh my gosh, I hate this. I hate this, but I love it. That's a lie. I have no memory of that. You just forgot is all. Because of the flashback light we used on So you. Kibo's not really a robot. No! All his robo things don't matter. you used to be are gone. You're fictional characters now. Do you finally understand? You are all flesh and blood fictional characters. Wait, what? Flesh and blood fictional characters. So they're real, but they're fictional. I'm so confused. <laughs> so you got nowhere to return. All that stuff's fiction too. But then, my friends and family, my whole life before coming here. All fiction. That's what a backstory is. You can't go back home because there is no such place. Just like how there's no Togami Corporation in the real world. Wow. Wow. Kaede's fiction, why can't Kasumugi cosplay as her? That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. This won't keep happening, you promise. They're just humans, but everything they know and who they are is basically fabricated. Okay, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. The only place we fictional characters can live is in this fictional world. Only in this world. Only in Danganronpa. Only in this world? And in my heart! <laughs> yes! The place you're actually trapped inside is the Danganronpa world! That's why you guys can't leave this place. That's why your only option is to continue the killing game here. Are you watching that original prologue? Okay. I'm gonna watch a crap ton of playthroughs when I'm done with this game, so yeah, I'll, I'll rewatch it. You're all fictional characters created to kill each other. It's what the world wants. Only Monica, shut up. <laughs> Just Monica. <laughs> That's why there's nowhere to run. Enough. I don't want to know anything else. I've had enough. Ah, uh, that reaction. Could it be you fell into despair? It's times like these you need to look to your friends for support. Thank you, Makoto. <laughs> However, all your friends are fictional too. Hifumi, why do you get stupider every time you appear on my screen? Why do you become a worse character? Really, they plan to include three and zero? Interesting, but not Ultra Despair Girls because they hate them. For example, even Kaito's illness was given to him as part of his character. Thank
Thank you, nurse. What? I was the one who came up with that plotline and gave him that virus. I was also the one who came up with the plotline for you, Phil, for Kaito. Oof. No more stuff, Adam. Are you close. saying? <laughs> then what about Tango? Was she always defending me? But, but on the plus side, on the plus side, sure, she was always defending Himiko. But on the plus side, it means that not only was her character growth part of her fiction, but also. But also, her hating men was part of her fiction, so in the real world, she's a good character. And I appreciate her. The end. Because that was her character. It's the same for me, too. Ah, uh, you didn't really do that, but okay. A character created to bring excitement to the killing game, much like myself. Oh, she just means, never mind. So the killing game swelled with excitement. Stop, 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 Even my stop. Pants started to swell too. Stop. You're telling us this is all a lie? Even my feelings? No, real Tenko isn't fictional. No, I liked her because I thought she was pretty. That was not fictional, so... Are you saying even those were lies? Well, if you're going to call fiction a lie, then yes. Everything in this world has a writing <laughs> credit. All our words and actions are just a bunch of lies. <coughs> no, Adam, I'm in the universe of the game, okay? Every time I play a game, I'm in the universe of the game. Afterwards, I'll discuss it. But in the universe of this game, the one and two characters are fictional, and the three characters are fictional, and Ultra Spirit Girls is fictional. All of that is fictional. But the characters exist. They exist as normal school people. And so, they wrote their own character plots. They became their own people, whatever. But... In the context of the game, in the canon of V3 as a game, or 53 if you want to call it that, in the canon of that as a game, Tenko exists. She just doesn't exist in my world, but in this world she exists, just not as Tenko Chabashiri, the ultimate Aikido master. You know what I'm saying? For example, an unbreakable vow of brotherhood is just a simple plot line. Stop talking, Adam. I do not have one of those. I have a You camera. said it, bro. However, that was a splendid plot line. I love this. Even that thing Kaede said that moved Shuichi's heart. Gosh darn it. What? I hate this game. I hate this game. I hate it. I love it, but I hate it. I love hating it. That's how I feel about Nagito towards this right now. That What's was happening? a lie. Because the real Kaede said. I'm perfect for a killing game. I don't have any faith in humanity. So clearly the level-headed guys we can do it character and picturing the girl that wanted to be her coming up and just being like I hate everything <laughs> and just the dead man of delivery of, I don't have any faith in humanity I hate everyone <laughs> All I gotta do is make it so. That was a lie! Cause the real Kaito Oh said... god, I don't know why that got me so bad. I don't know why that was so funny to me. I wanna kill everyone! I'm not just gonna be a dunk on Ronpa. I'm gonna <laughs> kill everybody and win! That's exactly what I said he was gonna say. Once I've got fame and fortune, I don't gotta worry about what's impossible. Let me see what he says. Every single thing that has happened. 
happened in this let me see what let me see what Correcchio said who did he say I want to be a weird incestual creep I doubt he said that is a lie it's all a lie so that my stupid voice doesn't matter the reason we're all here right now is because of them because of them, I was able to change. That's all I get. I'm sure that is. No, I figured. They, they were the most important characters to Shuichi. It makes sense that that's where they would stop it, but that's why I was trying to live for them, too. I was trying so hard to stay positive. But even if, if even that's a lie... That's the lie p tone. Color tone. survive this long. This is fiction. There's no greater meaning. No greater meaning to death. No greater meaning to life. Hi, Izuru. How are you? It's all fiction. There's no meaning to be found in any of it. It's so gross I could just bark. Well, I guess it makes sense you wouldn't believe all this stuff. Yeah, you well, some way You in despair yet? I love that Junko's almost irrelevant. It's just everyone. Everyone is the bad guy, and also the good guy, and also everything. It will be troublesome for us if you don't despair under Yeah, our no, it would, it would, it hurts my head. I can't imagine what the characters, should they be real, like, would be feeling. Duncan Rumpa's all about despair! Having to write for those characters, when also having to balance and deal with all this meta stuff, would be so hard. The reason this killing game's so popular, why it's gone on for 53 seasons. That reason is despair. Viewers flock to see your despair. I have no idea what you're saying to me, Vander. Good evening, according to the latest researchers. What's your opinion on the current meta phenomenon related to the discoveries regarding the upcoming social and economic cooperation to decrease the needs of market towards resources exploration associated political usage of common language for infamous religious based institutions? You just word vomited to me. Um, I don't know what that means. But hi, welcome. That's why all those people out there look so happy. See? We've seen every single other character and form of a character. I would be surprised if we don't see Mukuro Junko. I I mean, I can see them not doing that, but that would suck. Despair. Is this despair? Is this what the outside world wants? No. Is this what they want from us? I mean, I want a happy ending, but also this is fascinating, so I can't lie. I'm kind of intrigued. Oh, don't have the energy to What's yell? Kibo doing? He hasn't said anything in a long time. Well, yelling for help is useless for fictional characters anyway. It makes the viewers even more depraved and obsessed when they feel sorry for you. Gosh darn it. That's why I love Chihiro so much. They watch, knowing that they shouldn't, just to revel in the depravity of it all. That depravity is the appeal of death games. It's the appeal of this very killing game. It's the appeal of Danganronpa itself! Same. So what are you supposed to do? Huh? What was that? Yeah, I don't know. I'm, I'm still getting there. I'm still getting there, Vander. I have no idea. I'm trying to figure it out myself. Because that's a fictional version of Kaede or something. And then, like... What's gonna happen to us? Oh, don't you play this song game. Hmm? What are you guys talking about? Weren't you going to ruin the class trial and end the killing games? Go ahead and stop it if you can. Try and stop a world obsessed with it. It's a beautiful song, but now I have, like, PTSD from it. It's a really hard song. It's a really hard one. You have to be really good at piano. It's like in a really hard key. 
there's no way to stop it. I don't know. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Impossible. I'm gonna get through it and then share my final thoughts oh. towards the end. Are you giving up already? Celestia doesn't sound the same too. I don't like it. It's all a lie, isn't it? Me, everyone here, everyone who died. Everything's a lie, right? I can't fight for a lie, can I? Hashibuki. No matter how much you grow, Shuichi, you're still weak after all. Oh, shut up! Smoogie, you're still not free from the knife. Just because you are a bunch of waifus also does not mean you're free from the wife. It's all a lie. You're a lie. Free from the knife. That's what I mean. Now that you know it's all lies, you've gone back to the oh weak gosh. ultimate detective. <laughs> <laughs> this pleases us. It is a despair fit for Tungan Rompa. Tungan Rompa. Well, Kibo, do something. That's surprisingly disappointing. But I guess it's okay. We're still on script. Kibo, do something. Kibo, you're the only one that's not reacting. Do something. Everything's a lie. Everything's meaningless. Everything we've done, everything we've faced together, all of our feelings. <gasps> this protagonist light's going out! No! Pitch black lies. Doesn't matter how many mysteries you solve, the mysteries were all fiction in the first place, all scripted. It's all over. It's all just a lie anyway. It doesn't matter what you do. <laughs> Priscilla just texted me and said, what if this is how Endgame ended? <laughs> oof. Oof. That would be something else. That would be something else. Everything was a lie. It's all meta. Robert Downey Jr. comes out and he's like, guys, it was a prank. Oh, gosh. No, 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 no. That's not the end. Is this the end? Please tell me. I'm asking you. Whenever I was in trouble, my it oh we are we are robot boy time. Whenever I was in trouble, my inner voice would always guide me. That guidance is what brought me here. I don't believe that's a mistake. So I will trust it. A yeah, dream that the new God of War ended. It was like a movie set, and Kratos just got mad and like jumped out of the scene and just walked away. Remember when I was ranting to you guys about Bandersnatch, the like Black Mirror choose your own adventure Netflix thing? Um, that's literally one of the endings. Is the character jumps out of a window. One of the endings you can get is a character jumps out of a window, and he's just like, "What is going on?" And it's like the set. And they're like, okay, cut, come here, come here. And he's like, who are you? What are you doing? What's happening? And it's the creepiest thing. It's so, oh gosh. It's so cool though. Please tell me your decision. Am I the inner voice? No, that's wrong. Yes. Save this situation. Oh, my mono coins. Those aren't for nothing. Come on. That's it. I'm sure that's it. Yeah, I'm sure that's the ending. Uh-huh. 
Is this the end? Please tell me, I'm asking you. That was cool. Good job, game. That was good. That was good. I like that a lot. I hear your voices crystal clear. My inner voice is telling me I need to remedy this situation. We are the robot boy. That is I assume it's just a loop. Give up. I assume it just loops, Ryan. I will not give up hope until the very end. Go, Kibo! What? We can't give up. No matter what, hope is always within reach. We must keep our heads high and search for hope, especially in deepest despair. Hope? It's time for the hype. Here we go. Huh? We've had our mandatory chapter six trial depression. Now it's time to get going. You said so yourself. This killing game is the ultimate real <clears> fiction. <throat> if this is both real and fiction, look at the thing. It can't all be fictional. It's a true echo. Even if this world is fiction, even if we're fiction, there must be something we can do. So there must be a way to break through this. I won't give up hope. Not ever! I'm also gonna save again, because I don't know if that actually saved my game, but ooh boy. Ooh boy, would it be something else. I can't look at the report card, because I'm Kibo! <laughs> I love it. I love it. Three protagonists. This game is something else. This game is something else. Jeez, oh, how annoying. The outside world doesn't just want despair, it wants hope, too. If our voices have reached the outside world, then what my inner voice is telling me is... Oh, your inner voice? That's the voice of the outside world. Interesting. What? I know, because I wrote your plotline, too. Um, hello, why'd you just send me a YouTube thing? Oh, gosh, okay, I'm gonna open Discord. I'm not gonna look at it yet, but I'm gonna open it. It's because it takes 12 years to open. Why did we open Discord? Why did this happen? For later, okay. There's Next. no way I wouldn't know who that is you're hearing. That's the voice of the outside world. The voice of the outside world? From the start of this killing game, you've had a unique role. You're the audience surrogate! I'd come the frick again? What? I'm just opening up Discord so it'll be there. It's gonna lag for a sec, but just deal with it. Audience Sorry, surrogate? just deal with it. <laughs> that sounded ruder than I meant it to, but... Your inner voice allows communication between yourself and the audience. That function exists to keep the audience entertained. That function exists. Just shut up. I hate you, Fumi. Now tell me, what is your inner voice? Speak clearly and enunciate. Hold it. <laughs> I miss you, Taka. I miss you. What is my inner voice? If I'm a surrogate for the audience and we've been communicating this whole time, then my inner voice is actually. Survey, shut the frick up. This is it. Oh, got it. Okay, it is lagging like a mofo. Hold on. Audience survey. <laughs> Well done! Yes, indeed, that is the truth! It stops lagging for a second. Oh, it became green in this period. Interesting. Sorry, it's just lagging for a second. That's it. That's it. 
It's two-way communication that lets you participate in the program from home. My baby boy, my baby boy, I love him. That is your inner voice's true nature. The results of an audience survey. I sound like a f like a like a over stereotyped strong girl now instead of what I used to sound like, which was much more rough and Sakura Ogami. The voice I relied on for guidance was just the audience answering survey questions. Every move you made was dictated by the audience's answers to that survey. For this season of Danganronpa, the main gimmick is audience participation. Oh, they didn't get her back. Interesting. Interesting. I didn't actually know that. I thought they had all of them come back. That antenna on your head lets you receive their answers. Most of them seem the this right one, antenna? though. When your antenna broke and you went crazy? That was a big problem for us. We got flooded with complaints from the audience. But that's not your only role. You're also the audience's camera. Because that sounds right. That sounds like Kina. C camera? Stop. Your eyes... ...are the eyes of the audience itself! Mondo Mikan, Mahir is the same. He was the player the character for the whole audience's world. audience's eyes? The outside world has been watching from your eyes the whole time! It Don't put a computer. Feel like really a part Don't put a TV on my computer screen. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. I don't like and that. And it's all thanks to you! That's why I'm so glad you survived all the way through. What would happen if he didn't? Because now I can use you to plunge the outside world into despair! D despair If the audience surrogate falls into despair... Then the audience does too. That sounds a lot like Shirokuma. I know that Shirokuma was voiced by Junko, but that's like exactly what her Shirokuma voice was. By making you fall into despair, I can make the entire world fall into despair. My despair will turn from fiction to fact and destroy oh reality itself. Right? No, it totally sounds like that. Isn't that just the most delightful despair? Why would you go to all this trouble? Isn't Junko and Ushima just a No, process? she's an ideology. Oh, Kibo, mon petit doudou. My cosplay is a perfect reproduction. Okay, okay, okay. Two points to Terror Terror. He's the worst character in this series. Two points to Terror Terror for mon petit doudou. <laughs> Actually doing stuff yeah, the that characters cool. would is totally part of that. Is that why? But they didn't address. The world they didn't address despair? Ultra Despair Girls, except for in the opening, so I understand why they didn't do it. That's messed up! <laughs> but that's the whole point of Danganronpa. The outside world wants I'm just thinking to of one streamer. And I'm just thinking of one streamer that I really like watching. He's uploading his VODs slowly to YouTube, and I'm just thinking of his reactions to all of this. It's gonna be so funny. He freaking loves Himiko. He freaking adores not Himiko, Hioko. He adores Hioko. And he hates Hifumi. And I'm just thinking of this whole thing with him. It's gonna be really funny. What could be more horrible than a fictional despair eroding the real world? No one could have imagined an end. But he also hates Juko always being the villain, so. Which she's not really even the villain almost. No. Say it. I won't give in to despair. Say the line. Huh? Say no, that's wrong. If I'm a surrogate for the audience, then I will use my inner voice to broadcast hope to the outside world. I already fucking told you. The outside world only wants despair. You only want despair. I want Kibo to win. Shut up. There's no way to spread hope to an audience that watches Killing Day. No, I watch for the good character, the characters in the plot. I don't care about the death. I mean, the death is a big part of it. No, my inner voice already told me what to do. Yeah, I did. I need to remedy this. If that's the voice of the outside world, then the outside world actually wants hope. I want them to stop holding on to this idea that hope and despair are, are black and white and all or nothing. That's what I really want. But for the sake of this game, that, sure, that's what I want. So I will trust the outside world. Did I say that? I will I trust in that. hope. I might have said that. It's fine. It's fine. 
It's fine. Ultimate Hope Robot! <laughs> That's so stupid! I'm sorry. That's stupid. I love it, but that's stupid. It's so Japanese. It's like a repeat of DR1! This is the power of hope. Let's freaking go. I will not lose to your despair. Not when I'm carrying the hope of the outside world. Ugh, how annoying. Hope? That's not popular. Well, if I can get someone like you to fall into despair, that'd be a great ending. He's a robot! I don't understand. I won't let you do that. Hope will never give in to despair. Hope moves forward! Shuichi's just like, what is going on? You took oh, over my job. You're going to go that far? Then, let's settle this. The final battle between hope and despair. And Makoto's despair. Yahoo! Now that's what Danganronpa is all about! Settle this how? Yes, that is a problem. The class trial is in disarray because Monokuma broke a rule. Well, no, you did. But... You're the one who broke the rule. Thank you, Despair Egg. How about we start over and have a special vote? How about we just bring you back and let everyone else go? And just, you, you're just great. You're great. That's all. A special vote? Priscilla? But you're the one who broke the rules in the I first place. I hope you're not place. watching, but you know that I like you. And you know that I, I value your you over fictional characters. I just want to reiterate that. Whatever, man. We've made it this far together. Let's just do it's one like last vote. I love her. Cause that's what Dongan Rapa's all about. Shut up, Adam. Your final rude. special vote will determine. She only tried to kill one person. She didn't know that she was trying to kill everyone. And I, which of us should get punished? Oh, this is sweet victory. What? This will be a vote to determine how this story ends. <laughs> I'm ready to freak. I say this with absolutely no innuendo or connotation whatsoever. I am so ready to punish Samugi. I am. Oh, oh, sweet victory! You guys have to decide whether this story ends in hope or despair. I'm so ready for it. No, you're not, Priscilla. I'm just stating this fact, okay? You're not supposed to respond to it. Do you end in despair? Oh, well, thanks for watching. I feel weird that you're watching, but also kind of flattered. I don't know. Or at least listening. Oh man, this is great! The outside world is starting to get jazzed up! You know me. You know me. Shuichi versus Samugi, Leon versus Sayaka. Interesting. I like that. I like that. Hope will definitely win. No one here wants despair to win. No, she's not using Twitch Cat, because y'all are weird. Thanks, yeah, Dirt Squirrel. Appreciate right. it. Appreciate it a lot. Can't really with the great. Mastermind. She already saw that one. Even if that choice ends in your suffering. What? Suffering? Hello? Hmm? Alright, let me explain what's gonna happen after the vote. Please do, Mr. Mastermind Leon. If Kibo, representing Hope, is punished, and I, representing Despair... No, 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 Dirt Squirrel, you stop. You stop what you're doing, Dirt Squirrel. <laughs> These are all out of context, honey, I promise. Then, per the rules, the killing school semester... I don't know if you're actually looking at chat, but you maybe shouldn't. I don't know. Main. Play games. Oh, shoot. You're going to continue the game? No need to worry, because there aren't going to be any more murders. Oh, he's always right. He's at least 30% right. My predictions are always correct 30% of the time. Even if we make new flashback light motives for you, you know they're lies. So no matter how many motives we provide, it's more likely that nothing will happen. Nothing will happen? What's the beat? What's... You can ignore the quotes. Okay. <laughs> she says, focus on the game, ignore the quotes. <laughs> it's fine. No! That's no way to live! Imprisoned in the school? Living lives of despair? Even if you went outside, there'd be no point. Is 25 the banana Viagra one? I was proud of that. As I said, 
all your memories are nothing but fiction. Your hometowns, your families, your friends, they never existed in the first place. Because they're all fiction! You're fiction, shut Dongan up! Dongan Rampa characters can only live in the Dongan Rampa setting. I hate the way Akane says Dongan Rampa. There's no reason to pull out of school. Only losers pull out. Then at least put us back how we were! Just gonna ignore him? Silence! We've not overspilled milk! Sonya. Huh? I told you guys already. You can't get rid of memories with flashback lights. Oh yeah, that was right after the ceiling fell on Monica. In uh, Ultra Despair Girls. That was a good one. I was flashback proud of that one. lights can only overwrite old memories with new ones. But if you're absolutely serious, then use a flashback light to become a different fictional character instead. So we can't go back to the way we were? Uh, yeah! How about that despair? Thank you, Junko. But if I, representing despair, am punished, and Kibo, representing hope, wins, then this killing game will end, of course. The hoodie! Oh, the hoodie! I want one! However, you must follow the rules. The game will continue until the final two. What? So only two of you can graduate. Uh huh? What? Out of the four of us. Well, Maki, you know what me and you could do if we just stayed here forever. Yes, that is so. I will let you decide the two who will survive. We got this far, and you're telling us to sacrifice more of our oh, friends? Freak. Slay the thoughts? No! And then the rest of you losers can leave I like them all. I don't want any of them to go. However, even if you do escape to the outside world, you will find it most unwelcoming. Tell me, guys. No! As long as we never give up, there will always be hope. <clears throat> Well, if you're gonna be a pussy about it, do whatever you want. Can you choose which two will survive? Can you choose which two will be sacrificed? Oh gosh. I sacrifice myself! What? What? Kibo. Kibo! Whoa, 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 whoa. You just became a pro I bring hope to everyone and the outside Kibo, world, Kibo. No, no, no. I will gladly sacrifice myself. I mean, sure. It, it makes it easier. I mean, sure. If you're willing to and you want to, fine. But, Kibo, it's okay. Even if it destroys my body, I will defeat despair. It's Kibo! Even if you sacrifice yourself, you still need one more. In order for hope to win, there needs to be one more sacrifice. Shuichi, Maki, and Himiko. One of them has to sacrifice themselves. Or hope can't win. Do you got the guts to make such a heartless choice? That's... Do you understand now? Even if you choose hope, you will still suffer. You don't need to choose the hard way. No one expects you guys to do that. Now, yeah, there will be no more killing. So let's all just stay here together. There's no reason to go outside. Let's stay here together. I mean, mood, but... In the movie social. Don't, you stay here together? Don't you do this to me, game. Let's all stay together. Gosh darn it, game. I wanna stay here with Why do they do this? Here? They take all the cute ones and make you them be all like, you should stay here. I think everyone will feel a lot better after they vote for Kibo. Come on. Let's stay together, please. They know their target audience, though, which is really funny. This is a really funny commentary, as it is, that they make all the girls be the ones that are like, stay here, stay here. Together? Okay. Because they know who their target audience is. Don't let her fool you. And Jihiro. Despair won't hard. end this killing game. Only hope will. Hope? Oh, gosh. Gosh darn it, Kibo. Gosh darn it, we have to do this. All right. Oh shoot, I wanna see that. That looks really good. It's on Netflix. Watch that. This 
killing game will end in despair! Everyone wants to feel despair! Buff Kuma! Buff Monokuma, I love it. This time, Help moves forward. Oh, baby Kibo, let's go. Let's go. Never give up. Hope will never lose to despair. Huh? How's not giving up gonna help you, huh? Huh? Even if you won't give up, as long as you don't sacrifice someone at I'll sacrifice myself. Maki! I kind of figured it would be her. What? If Kibo and I sacrifice ourselves, then Shuichi and Himiko live, her. right? And they can survive this absurd killing game. Shuichi and Himiko. Not the two. OMG Kibo bless. <laughs> I didn't see the comments were still scrolling. And I just looked up at the stream and it said OMG Kibo bless. And that's almost exactly verbatim what I said. Maki? After listening to Kibo, I've decided. Oh man. I don't want this killing game to end with despair. That would just piss me off. So oh, gosh. Even if you only feel that way because I wrote you like that, just like with Kaito. Go join your boy Pikachu. Kaito. I'll choose that ending if it means I can kill you. Mm, Pikachu, I am sad. Hug me, Pikachu. Even if I have to sacrifice my life, I will kill you. The angel Angie portrait? Okay, but Angie was garbage, okay? We'll get sacrifice. to it, Adam, but Angie was garbage. Wait, Maki! Maki! I'm sorry. I've already made up I my mind. I just love saying that. I'm sorry. But what's gonna happen to us? Can we really go back to the outside world? What indeed? Robot I assassin. Told you over and over, Hope must go on. Maki, darling. Cry, cry. I'm gonna cry. Hope versus despair. One vote for Kibo. Assassin. The face when you're in despair. All of these tears. <laughs> Shuichi looks yummy. <laughs> Sees this ending, I'm sure they'll help us. I've never laughed so hard. I don't even think it was game. Oh my god. I've never laughed harder at anything in this game. I'm crying. That's my favorite thing I've ever seen. Oh we'll my god, Shuichi looks <laughs> yummy! What do you mean, Hope? What? I'm sorry, Shuichi, you're too yummy, I'm distracted. <laughs> I reject that hope. No, I have a sword fight with the yummy boy! How dare he? <laughs> I... I refuse. He's a yummy boy. <laughs> I won't accept that hope. I know this is supposed to be emotional, but I just ruined it by reading that comment. What's the matter? It's because of hope that this whole thing is happening. Oh, that's the hardest I've ever laughed at this game. Oh my gosh. That's the hardest I've laughed at anything in a long time. Oh, I hope you enjoy this. This is raw Matt Joy. I just, I just, oh man. Okay, back to the game. Back to the game. Oh. I reject that hope. 
We're back, we're back. It's sad, it's sad. We're gonna be sad. Kibo, Kibo is sacrificing himself. Maki's sacrificing himself. It's sad. We gotta sword fight a sad boy. <sighs> but he's so yummy. <laughs> hope itself is the villain here. No, it's not. We suffer because of hope. Tamugi isn't trying to make us despair. She wants us to trust in hope. That's not what she wants. That's so I say no. Saying. I reject that hope. I don't like that it's playing the thing, though. It's playing the sad music. The reason this madness Ugh. has gone on 53 times, it's because of hope. Okay, I'm done crying. It's because the audience wants hope. They want to see hope defeat despair in the end. It's Hope's Peak Academy all over again. So if we fight for hope... We just be giving them what they want. H-N-N-N-G Kaide. I'm trying to end this killing game. And the game. killings will never end. But I'm dumb E-T-H-I-C-C. -C, and see? the clap Despair of my butt cheeks keep choice. inspiring the audience. I will cut down your words! Adam? Adam? I hate Despair you sometimes. Despair takes everything from people. Even their strength to press onward. She said Kaide, right? Interesting. Um... <laughs> okay. That's why it's not possible for Despair to be better. The people watching probably feel the same way. They want hope too. <clears throat> what? Even if it's fiction. Wait, someone called me out. Wants to feel hope. No, there you have anyone. Courage. Things are getting interesting. No, that's wrong. Hold on. Can't say anything now, scrub. I can say whatever I want. Thank you very much. Rip the emotional moment. I'm sorry. I killed the moment as soon as I saw. As soon as I saw Shuichi looks yummy. With the heart, I I lost my mind. And this we're back, we're back, we're back, I'm back. Because Emotions are back, we're good. The hope they want. <clears throat> well, they ignore all the tragedies that we had to suffer to get there. I'm back, we're back in the emotion. We're good, we're good. Shuichi, that's... Then let's start the voting time! No, 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 no. The final vote! It's all gonna end here. You and... Oh, sorry, Wait, sorry, Juko. We're not finished talking. Please, let me just ask one more thing. I have to know something before we vote. What is it? If Hope wins this final vote, Kibo and Maki will sacrifice we don't, themselves. I don't think. And you, Sumugi, the loser, will also be punished, correct? What kind of punishment will they receive? Please tell me what it is. Tell you, I never said anything about a punishment, did I? That's right. The punishment isn't the problem right now. The problem is. No, that is the problem. Because if the punishment is what I think it is, then everything would make sense. We're still giving everyone what they want, kind of a thing. Including why Rantaro <coughs> participated in another killing game. Rantaro? What does he have to do with? Interesting. I forgot about that. You know the answer, Kibo. Me? If you really are connected to the outside world, then I want you to find oh, the answer. Oh, this is a cool point. This is a cool point he's making. Final punishment. If it's the reason Rantaro participated in the killing game again after surviving, the punishment must be... This is it! What? What? Oh it. The punishment is you have to participate. Wait, in wait, 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 what? What? Yeah, I think so. The punishment after the final vote is to participate in another killing game. Which is why he got the special perk. Oh my That's gosh. That's what Rantaro was <clears throat> talking about. If you wanted this killing game, so you have to win no matter what. No matter what. Something similar must have happened in the last killing game, and he was given a choice. He sacrificed himself and was forced to participate again. And then he died. All this means is, if we choose hope here, 
The killing game won't end. Tsumugi will still be the mastermind. Kibo will still represent the viewers. Interesting. And Maki will be the new ultimate survivor. The killing game will begin again. Interesting. Don't you see? If Hope wins, the killing won't stop. It's because Hope wins that the killing never stops. It's what the people want. They want Hope to win. They want the happy ending. That's how the killing game has gone on 53 times. The killing game persists because Hope always wins. I thought they were done blowing my mind. Nope, they're That's not. That's why I'm going to reject that hope. That's despair. You're going to choose despair to end the killing game. How boring. But this is fine. Our audience loves despair, so this will please them too. After all, even if despair wins, the killing game still won't end. Yeah, it'll just be a new game with different people. Then... Hope has to win this game, too. If we continue to win for Hope, then this killing game will surely end someday. No, you don't get it. It's not going to end. But it's either keep way, it's going to keep over happening. And over. I don't understand what your argument here is, Shuichi. Either way, it's going to keep happening. Then what are we supposed to do? It's just a matter of whether or not we also participate in it again. When Maki said she was going to sacrifice herself just now, I thought, <coughs> why? So many of our friends have sacrificed their lives. Why Maki? Why now? Why do we have to go through it again? The sorrow of losing Kaede and Kaito. Why do we have to feel that sadness over and over and over again? Why do we have to bear that burden? Well, I don't care how much the audience wants it. I'm not going to feel that way anymore. I don't want anyone to feel that way anymore. Even if this is fiction, even if we're all fictional. Right? Like, it's for real though. Oof. The pain in my heart is real. Oof. 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 Wow. Okay. Way to, uh, way to hurt me. Way to hurt me. The sadness I feel when I lose the people I love is real. Oof. Oh, gosh. I won't forgive this game that treats us like toys. And if this is what the world wants, then I reject that world. I'll fight the world that inflicts suffering for entertainment. Fight the outside world? So what are we going to do then? It doesn't matter what you do. No matter what a fictional character does or says, it's just fiction to the outside so we world. So despair ending. It's okay to feel despair sometimes. Why have we been doing this? Then I'll fight the outside world from within this back. fiction. Big reveal at last. From within this fiction? But how? I refuse to vote. Refuse to vote? But then you get punished. Monokuma said that if we don't vote, we'll be killed for breaking the rules. Yes, I know. That's why I'm doing it. Mmm, Shuichi's eyes. Ooh. <laughs> if this ends without a single vote being cast for hope or despair, the audience would hate it. They'd never accept an ending like that. So I abstain. I refuse to give the outside world the ending at once. The one comment said, no, that's wrong. There's been a few of those, no, that's wrong. I've seen a lot of those. I won't vote for Kibo or Tsumugi. Come on, Kibo, attack! Force hope through. Something's different, right? Come on, Kibo. I reject both hope and No, despair. that's wrong! Mm. Shuichi's eyes. <laughs> Hope won't end the killing game? If that's true, then this feeling that I must win for hope is... What am I supposed to do? Gosh, I don't know! What do they want from me? I don't know. It's like almost 11. I need to go to bed. I'll put a stop to this killing game. You can't stop it! If Dongan Rampa ends... 
<laughs> Thank you, Monokuma, for reminding us why you are one of the best characters in, in this entire series. It was rough for me too. It's a death thing. What the fuck you gonna do? Oof. Ain't it better to just let it end with despair? No. I reject both hope and despair. I reject a world that would make us do this. Which is why I abstain from voting. So this won't end in hope or despair. You can't throw away your futures. Oh, shut up, Haji, man. Hope is contagious. No! Oh, I get it. Hold on. Hold on. I have two ideas. I have two ideas. Two ideas. Okay. I'll put a two ideas. We're just gonna let it roll. We're just gonna let it roll through. I think that might be the first idea. Second idea is I lied. I think I'm gonna try that first. Hope is uh, it end with hope, but still. Oh, this is cool. I like it. To be fair, I did poop for like 20 minutes of the stream, so it's taking longer than we wanted it to. Kibo, what are you doing? How long have we been live? 428, that's actually not that bad, honestly, for a trial. Did your so far. I, I, really I know we still have to more to go, that? but... Did it tell you to reject hope? Yes, it did. I told you to. Oh, my inner voice is still oh, telling never me mind. not to give up on hope. But if right? that hope no, demands it's, it's crazy. tragedy from us... They're basically like, nothing matters. Then I cannot trust it. I got ten bucks riding on hope. I may be a robot, but the thought of my friends dying still fills me with sadness. I want to break Shuichi's fingers, heart. <laughs> <laughs> this game is amazing. I don't want anyone else to feel this way, so I will abandon hope. <clears throat> oh no, he's not the pro tag anymore either. We have no pro tag. You know what will happen if you do that? To defy the audience! I don't give a damn. This killing game is over anyway. New characters are created just to show the outside world a fictional hope. They get written into these killing games, forced to betray one another. And at the end of the slaughter, the tragedy, the despair, hope always wins. Well, I've had enough of it. Oh We're gonna end this right now! We won't let it end the way they want. We won't make a good ending or a bad one. To end this killing game and end it forever. I'm back to being protag. We will reject Dongan Ranpa. Shuichi. The way they say it is so weird. Dongan Ranpa. Tsumugi, you were right. But this is also very interesting. I'm weak. I'm weaker than everyone else. If I didn't have my friends, I'd be useless. That's true even now. If Kibo and Maki didn't stand up, I would have ended it all right then. But it's because I'm weak and because I lost my way that I finally realized. I finally realized how cruel this hope really is. Hold on, everyone. If we keep thinking, we can find a better ending and... Kimiko, Maki... Will you abstain from voting with me? I also would like to point out that, um, I said this earlier in the trial, I was like, I like the idea that hope is more of an abstract concept, that hope and despair aren't always necessarily good and bad, it's not black and white, I pointed that out, and that's been kind of building up this whole series, and I love that they're finally, like, addressing it, and being like, you know, it's, both are bad if you voting? do them for the wrong reasons, you know? You can't do that. All three of you will be killed if you do. You guys really want to commit suicide? It's still a sin to throw your life away, even if your life is fictional. You've been fighting so hard to survive, but now you're gonna give up? Such foolishness. To cast your life away is the height of stupidity. I... I... 
Kimiko, we can put an end to this insane killing game. We're gonna use our lives to end this madness. It's not gonna end. They're just gonna start 54 with new people. I don't understand how you're gonna end this. Use our lives? But Himiko, you have to choose, okay? You can't look away. You can't back down. You have to choose. Pikachu, what do we do? Only those who have found the truth can choose their do, destiny. Sora? I'm Himiko now. We can put an end to this killing game. We can put an end to these killing games that everyone out there wants so bad. If so, then I... Our new lives have been recorded in a while, but use our lives to record in a while, back. Himiko! Himiko! If we refuse to vote... Himiko! We all die. To choose death is to blaspheme against life itself. Hope and despair. Neither the victor. No one would want an ending like that. You would throw your life away for that? That would be a meaningless death. No, it wouldn't. Our lives are our strongest weapons. And with these weapons, we revolt against the outside world. If we refuse to... <clears throat> Dang it, I wanted to cause chaos. Gosh darn it, I wanted to cause chaos. They won't let me lie in this game. If we refuse Gosh darn it, fine, we'll do it for real. Fine, fine, fine. Or will we? That would be hmm. Huh? Dang it. <laughs> I did. I did die. Whatever. Okay with this ending? Retry! I decided to live life facing forward. I wanted to sow chaos. I like to sow chaos. What are you gonna do about it? What are you gonna do about it? If we refuse to vote, we all die. The truth said it's a blessing against life itself. I agree with you, but also maybe not. No one would want an ending like that. You would throw your life away from that? That would be a meaningless death. Four protagonists! I have played as four protagonists in this game, everyone. I'm gonna put an end to it. I'm gonna put an end to it. <laughs> We're gonna save the game one more time. Even if I'm a fictional character. Save it one more time because I don't trust my computer quite yet. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Remember when I played as Kibo? Remember when I played as Kibo and they couldn't let me get to this? I can get to this now. Oh, it's still Kibo's. Okay. Fine. Fine. Or, it's still That's like two killing sheets. games are Fine. fun, right? It's fun to see two lives clash, right? But I won't let you <coughs> use my life for some show. I'm gonna use my life to I, end this, this is, killing game. This is a weak argument, in my opinion. I just I don't see. Angie, and all the I don't see how it ends the killing game. It just they'll just start again with a new. Use the only weapon I've got. I don't know. I'll use my life to put an end to this killing game. What? Suicide is suicide, no matter what your reason is. Perhaps that thought is just another work of fiction. Get a grip, some of you. It could be a part of my script, just like Maki falling for Kaito, you know? <sighs> Suicide something. Is that gonna roll ball? Gonna end? That wouldn't be good. So what if we like... Because if none of you vote, and I do, 
then I'll be the only one who Oh, that's the worst done. ending. That's the worst ending. Doesn't that sound exactly like something the big bad mastermind would come up that's with? That's the worst possible ending. Are they gonna make me do the worst ending? It's okay, Maki. Believe in me. And believe in yourself. Just like you believed in Kaito. Believe this is the worst timeline. Myself? That's why you have to fight. Even if you're scared. Because you have that strength. Mmm, Shuichi. Yummy Shuichi. Come on! It'd be a lousy story if the hero gave up so easily. And now I'm Maki. Five. Five protagonists, everyone. Five. Five playable protagonists. My desire to end this killing game may be fictional. I love the red. Oh my gosh, I love the red. And the mastermind as a sole survivor would be a convenient ending for her. Oh, that just might be implanted as well, just like my feelings for Kaito. Everything is fiction, a story written by someone. But even then, I... It is, it's hard to interpret. I need, I'm gonna need like a good minute to think before I talk about my opinions. Like, I might just have to sit through the credits and just absorb fiction. everything. It's all following my outline to a T! This whole shebang is fiction! That's Don Gone Rampa for ya! Even if it is fiction, it's because of everyone's sacrifices that we've come this far. Okay, fair enough, Ryan. Fair enough. Their deaths have to be more than just fiction. There must be something we can do. You mean to live your lives for them as well. We're going to use this fiction to change reality. We're going to end doggone... Fine. I will believe in myself. Oh. It's such a good twist. No, it is really good. I like it. It's a cool ending. Even if everything It's not is quite as hype as the other endings I where I was like on the edge of my like DR2 has one of the hypest endings of any game I've played. Granted, I don't play a lot of games, but it has a really cool ending. And I was into it. And this one I'm less into, but I'm fascinated by. If I can't believe in my feelings. Like I'm less I like, yeah, get them everyone, need. but I'm more like, what the freak? If we can change reality. And we won't be just fiction. Our lives will have significance. And hopefully, my feelings will have significance too. Are you saying that it's okay for everyone to die together? Man, why do you guys want to die so badly? <laughs> That's a hero delivering that line. It was probably the perfect it's one. It's not that I want to die. We fought <clears throat> so hard to survive. Of course we don't want to die. But it's not just about us. Everyone who died in the killing games felt the same way. They were all desperate to live. They wanted to survive. You're welcome for where my face cam is, Adam. I'm blocking you. You're for welcome. themselves and for someone else. That desire isn't fictional to us. That pain isn't fictional to us. Poor Ryoma. To us. The killing game is real tragedy. Do you want to know who the biggest tragedy is, knowing what we know now? I think Ryoma. I think Ryoma is the worst tragedy because he actually did probably have real loved ones. And they wrote his character to have none, so he died thinking he had no loved ones. And, um... Not the case. Why do you want me to move over a bit? This? This? What do you want from me? What do you want from me, guys? That's why we have to stop it. We won't let this happen ever again. Like I told you, it's not going to stop. Because that's what the world wants. As long as the world wants killing games, Danganronpa will not end. I'll line myself up with you. Oh my gosh, shut up. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm not doing that. <laughs> we have to change it. There's no way you can change it. Fiction could never change the real- You don't believe in the power of fiction? You're a cosplayer, for crying out loud. It may not be a physical power, but our wish will surely be received by someone. If fiction has the power to touch people's hearts, then that power can change the world. That is what I believe. I will also abandon my vote, just as Shuichi suggested. 
Then it's decided. We all abstain from voting. We reject hope and despair. We refuse to bow to the demands of the outside world. Are you serious? Are you getting flustered? Your costume changes are less frequent now. Are you crazy? If you do that, only I, the mastermind, will survive, you know? But what about hope? What about despair? Thank you, Nagito. I love that he's not- it's not Makoto, it's Nagito. He's the hope. They knew, they knew. Do whatever you want with hope and despair. We've already decided to quit this killing game! Interesting. I don't care about this fictional world. That's right! This class trial is over! Now, start voting time! Voting time? No, not yet! This game is gonna continue! The killing game will continue! This class trial will go on forever! No, I need to sleep! I have church tomorrow! <laughs> Akuma, let me sleep. This game is gonna keep going. Oh, wait, oh, and this class trial ain't over yet either. You really want the killing game to end? You really want Dongon Rampa to end? Yeah. Come on, even if we keep going back and forth. I mean, I don't Let's want the Dongon Rampa to end. Let's keep this game but... going. I won't let it be voting time. Why am I supposed to do this? Oh. I just hey, it doesn't matter. Why aren't you doing anything? Oh, it doesn't matter. I don't have to do anything. Gotcha. I'm abandoning this game. I won't play your game anymore, Monokuma. Now start the vote. Interesting. I won't let you abandon this game. Puncher, puncher in the face. I definitely won't let you. Yeah, I still need you guys to keep playing the game. Poop. Poop. Is it no? Oh, he wants me to spell hope. Gosh darn it, I was supposed to do nothing. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. Why must you never give up? Well, screw you, I'm gonna spell poop. Poop. P. Oh. Oh. He. Hey, what are you doing? I'm spelling poop. <laughs> Let's have more fun with the game. Let's have lots and lots of fun with Dongon Rampa. What must yo? What must yo? Do the class trial right, or the audience is gonna get bored. He's not wrong. I'm getting a little bored, but I also kind of like doing nothing. Fine, be bored. We're not here for your entertainment. Get wrecked. We're trying to survive. You're the ones who want us to be entertained. I'm gonna start saying that. People are like, your stream's weird. I'll be like, fine, be bored. 
I'm not here for your entertainment. <laughs> OMG management, do your job. This is a bad batch of survivors. Is this really okay? Management sucks. This is why I wanted... Don't be a party pooper. You become a spectacle, lol. Shuichi is mine. <laughs> if you're gonna complain, perhaps you should just stop watching. Oof. At every YouTube comment section ever. Even if we have to make the entire audience hate us, we're not going to stop. At Game of Thrones. <laughs> we're going to end our tragedy here. I don't watch Game of Thrones, but I know people are mad about this season. Give up already and start voting time. No, we have to. All four of us will abstain from the voting. So you'll part. be the only one who survives. We have to do the the thing. Are you okay with that, Kibo? Is your inner voice telling you that's okay? The face when they wanted to stop making Danganronpa games, so they made Does this the ending. Does the outside world really want that? Do they want Danganronpa to end? <clears throat> hey, what are they saying? What's your inner voice saying? My inner voice is saying, I don't have the time to keep playing these games. I got summer camps to do. I gotta wrap it up. I'm happy to play a new game if it comes out in the future, and I'm sure it might, but... Just reboot. Just restart. For real. My inner voice doesn't matter. Give me anymore. some years. Give me. I'm give me a year or two. I need. I need some time. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Kibo. Kibo, what's wrong? <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> See? They don't want this kind of ending. They want the killing games to continue. 100% out of 100%. Control alt Kibo. Off on suicide for now. <laughs> Shuichi is in a character heart. <laughs> hey guys, here's a tip. If your friends are depressed, maybe don't say hold off on suicide for now. Just, that's just me. Just maybe don't say that. That is the outside world's decision! What? Isn't that right, Kibo? Yes. My inner voice will not accept an ending without hope or despair. Oh no, he's actually a robot. Oh no. Kibo! 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 That's Sorry, possible. I didn't mean to cut you off. The Kibo you see there isn't the one you know. Like I said, you can't defy the audience when you're their surrogate. It's because he did such a silly thing that he's feeling the audience's anger now. What do you mean? What's happening to Kibo? Since Kibo kept defying the audience, <coughs> they took a vote and decided the troublesome personality of his should be erased. His personality was erased? How cruel can you guys be? How long are you going to play with our lives? But that's the decision of the outside world. Oh my gosh. Don't just end, Dungan Rampa. We supported you. You owe us. Oof. That's what they say. What a meta commentary. So it doesn't matter how much you fight, you can't change the outside world. Cause the outside world still wants Dangan Rampa. That won't change. What did you say? So do you still want to throw your lives away? Even if it changes nothing? <gasps> Come, Kibo! 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 I can barely control it. Looks like. Knock off his thing! Knock off his thing! Cut it! To get rid of it! Break it! Don't say that! Break it! Just... I'm sorry. I could not fight with you until the end. But your choice is not wrong. The real. Outside world who is enjoying this killing game. 
Yes, I'm the enemy. Break the thing. That's fine. Don't... Adam, shush. Shush, shush, shush. Kibo just die essentially. Kibo. Kibo, stay with us. Oh. He's completely erased. That makes me sad too, you know. He was a character I created. Oh. It's okay, Pikachu. But this is the end. The outside world rejects your decision. So no matter how you use your lives, if I reject my rejection anything. of the decision. Then I'll change it. Kibo gave us this one chance. If Kibo is doing what the outside world is telling him, we just have to convince him. I know we can change the world. We owe it to Kibo to try. I said it's impossible. For fiction to change the real world, the impossible is possible. All you gotta do is make oh. it so. That's what that's what what that's what Kaito said. Yeah. You can even change the world. That's what Kaito said. He remembers his bro. Pikachu. Is no, so we will change the world for ourselves and everyone who died. You're going to throw your lives away for those who have died. You fought to survive this killing game. If you die now, it's all over. Even if we die. It's not the end. Our friends who died gave us their love, and we changed because of that. If we can inspire change in others, then that love will live on. That love will tear down the wall between fiction and reality, and it will live on forever. That's why I'm going to change the world. As long as I even if oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That was an accident. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I will use that lie to change the world. Look, the hype was moment. I don't mean to cut people right. off. We're not gonna just be fiction. Shuichi, you can change this world because you're Kaito's sidekick. There's no way you can persuade them like that. They all love the killing games. They can't get enough Dungeon Rampa. I'm giving the world what it wants. I won't let hypocrites interfere. Kibo. Let me hear the voices of the outside world, and let them hear me. Is it time? Is it argument armament? Is it time? Are we gonna... Oh, no. This isn't right, Dongan I'm a long-time fan. Do you realize how much I've given to the show? I'm gonna be pissed if there isn't a happy ending. Man, this debate is getting wrecked. I don't like twists like this. This is getting way too mad. Ah, gosh. This isn't my Don Don Ron I'm a longtime fan. Do you realize how much I've given to the show? I'm gonna be pissed if there isn't a happy ending. This is, um. Man, this debate is getting wrecked. I can't see these. I don't like twists like this. This is getting way too meta. I can't see these, and the this lag is not helping things. I'm a long-time fan. Do you realize how much I've given to the show? I'm gonna be pissed if there isn't a happy ending. Man, this debate is getting wet. I don't like twists like this. Okay, at least I'm not the only one that suffers. This is getting way too meta. This isn't my Dungan Run I'm a long-time fan. Do you realize how much I've given to the show? I'm gonna be pissed if there isn't a happy ending. Man, this debate is getting whack. I don't like twists like this. This is getting way too meta. No way fiction can change the world, lol. Fiction has the power to change reality. I'm not here for a damn lecture. Hey, what about Little Miss Assassin's Punishment? Preachy characters are so annoying. Man, I was rooting for the detective. This guy should have died instead of Kaede. Death makes the characters better. Death is the point of Danganronpa. I'm not here for a damn lecture. Hey, what about Little Miss Assassin's Punishment? 
My computer is just not good enough to handle this. I was rooting for the detective. This guy should have died instead of Kaede. Death makes the characters better. Death is the point of Dungan Rumpo. I'm not here for a damn lecture. Hey, what about little Miss Assassin's punishment? Preachy characters are so Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Killing games are the best form of entertainment. I won't let you use our lives for entertainment. Hope versus despair. Pick one. Despair. Hope. Despair. Hope. Despair. Hope. Despair. Hope. Shut up. Despair. Despair. Hope. Despair. Wow. Despair. Despair. Hope. 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 Despair. Despair. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Despair. Hope. Despair. Hope. Despair. This ending sucks. I ah. I forget which keys are which, it confuses me. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, I'm forgetting everything. I need a moment. I need a moment. Hold on. Can I pause this at all? I need a moment. I, I'm literally getting anxious. I'm actually having anxiety from this. This is making me anxious. I do not like it. This is actually kind of triggering my anxiety a little bit. There's so much no- I'm just gonna mute it. I'm just gonna mute it. Might be a bad idea, but I- loud noise and just collective chaotic noise really triggers my anxiety, and it's been a minute since I- my medication, so I'm just gonna do this. It's a bad idea. Honestly, I don't care at this point. Hopefully you guys can still hear it. Or hopefully you can't, I don't know. A pointless death because no one voted is the worst ending ever! It's not pointless. We're gonna use our lives to change the world. Is Dongan Rampa really gonna end? You can't just end it out of the Check. world. Okay, I'm like back. I have noise they again. Die. They're not real. Just kill each other already. Hope. Despair. Hope. No, don't do the hope despair again. I hate that. Hope. Despair. We want more of the killing game. I need that sweet closure. Well, hopefully there's another season. There's no way they'd let it end like this. I'm right? a longtime fan. Do you really Oh my gosh, 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 Ah, my fingers are cramping up, giving myself carpal tunnel. Freaking big game. Final like blow, let's freaking go. Dangan Rampa will never end, will it? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I need to kind of breathe for a minute here. Sorry.
I'm gonna just pause for a second. I'm just gonna pause on this screen for a second. Ah, I didn't know that was a trigger for me. I'm okay, I'm okay, for the record. Um, but like, oh boy, I, I don't I don't have anxiety attacks very often, but when I do, it's all because there's a lot of noise and my brain can't focus on any of it. Um, and I have medication right here, I, I take it at night, so it's, it makes sense, I'm on the end of my medication. But like, holy crap, that hope, despair, despair, hope, despair, hope, despair, it was like driving me crazy. I needed to, like, mute it and just be like, okay. <sighs> um, that is, yeah, no, it is It is really funny, though, looking at it from the perspective of a fan who has said a lot of these things. It is It is hilarious. Um, okay, we're good, we're good. What just happened? Kibo? I destroyed Kibo. And he destroyed my hand. My gosh. Like I said... It's pointless. Like I said, I'm psychic. <laughs> you know how I feel when not to talk and that. The outside world won't let Danganronpa end. Everyone loves Danganronpa. That's reality. Killing Game Entertainment will continue forever. Now then, let's proceed with voting time. <laughs> I think hopeful Kibo should vote for Despairing Samugi, without a doubt! That's what the outside world wants to see! Let's give it everything we've got! Presenting one last voting time! There you go. Y'all, go ahead and pop that if you want to. Pop that uh, in the quotes if you want, if you guys deem that worthy enough. Oh, good grief, I need to breathe. <laughs> it's dope, I like it. It is a cool ending. It is really cool, don't get me wrong. That just took me out of it for a minute, so I'm trying to, trying to come back into it. Pikachu, how do you feel, Pikachu? Pikachu! Vote movie if I'm not a pussy? Well, if you're gonna challenge me, then fine, it's for you. Screw you, Adam. I voted. That's really how it ends. Screw you, Adam. I had to give her one last vote. I had to give her one last vote. I voted for her every trial. If you missed it, Adam, I voted for her every trial except I think trial number one. I voted for Samuki. And five, they wouldn't let me vote for her, but. Everyone else? Um, yeah. Do you guys want me to wait to talk about my feelings? Because I know you guys are- it's really late for you guys. It's like 2 a.m. It's 1 a.m. Do you want me to wait until Monday or Tuesday to talk about my full opinions of the game? Or do you want me to just talk about it and then you can watch the vlog later? Let me know either way. I'm down either way, but... Alright! Looks like voting is over! Let's hurry and announce the results! I didn't vote. That was the right thing to do, right? Okay. You can send in the Discord if you want. The three of us might be penalized for abstaining to vote. <laughs> penalized. <laughs> but what's going to happen to Kibo and Sumugi? If Kibo is controlled by the outside world, he must have voted for Sumugi. Then what about Sumugi? If she had cast one vote for Kibo, then it would be a tie, but... <laughs> Are they actually gonna do it? Are they actually gonna do it? Are they actually gonna do it? If she vote one vote for Kibo and he votes one vote for Samugi, that means both of them are technically the black and both of them die. And all three of us didn't vote, so all three of us die, so everyone dies. Are they about to do this to me? Oh, there's no need to worry about that. Ah, I screw you. Either. Screw you. What? Just as I thought. You wanted Hope to win. Gosh darn it, Samugi. That's not it. We're friends, aren't Garbage we? to the end, There's no Samugi. way I'd abandon you guys. <laughs> friends? You've got no right saying that now! <laughs> I I'll, I'll, I'll share my thoughts during the I'm credits of the each chapter, the overall story, and the plot. I will save my character judgments for my tier list stream that I'm going to do a week or two weeks from today. 
I'll save that for that stream. So, since the four of us abstain But from voting, I will share my my full uh, No matter who he voted for, the I will share my full thoughts at the end. So in the other game. words, the winner is hope. But Kibo said earlier that he'd sacrifice himself that's fine. I'll repeat to take it if punishment, you want. right? Or if you want to go to bed before the credits, that's fine too. I'm not offended either way. So we're going to punish him. He'll be participating in the next killing game. Hold it. Why are you punishing Kibo? If Kibo survives, then there's no need for him to be sacrificed. It doesn't work like that. He needs to follow through on his words. What? That's not fair. Are you twisting the rules again? Yeah, she doesn't even follow rules. She's the worst. It's fine, because this is all fiction. I hate you. Maybe it's a bit forced, but that's fiction for you, right? Well, since I didn't vote, I'll be killed with you guys. Nice, Adam. Nice. But I'll accept my death. If you guys are all willing right. to die to stop the killing game, I'll die to Come continue here. it. It's time for your death. Even if it's just fiction, I gave my I've been ready for three today. chapters with this knife. I'm ready. I've given my life to Danganronpa. And how about this for the next plotline? Hope has won, but the lone survivor, Kibo, remains trapped. Now he'll challenge the killing game anew. Will he be able to grasp true hope? I don't know more about uh, I don't know more about Rantaro's killing game. I'm fascinated by that idea. What? This is the worst possible ending. But this is bad. At this rate, our deaths will be meaningless. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep on vote. Whatever, whatever. Get to that. Get to that point, please. Well, we already know the outcome, yep. but we should follow protocol. Kanakuma, please tell us the results. Okay, then let's begin! Who will be chosen as the Blackened? Who will win? Hope or despair? I just had a crazy thought that I don't think is gonna happen, because I think the plot is that Kibo will in fact not vote, and everyone will die, and it'll be fine, whatever. Um, what if Shuichi voted for some? What if Shuichi voted for Kibo, knowing that Kibo would vote for Samugi, sacrifices himself and Kibo, and everyone else dies? That'd be crazy. That'd be freaking crazy. That'd be freaking crazy. There we go. Yeah, that's what I figured. There's so much they could do with this game that they just didn't. Ugh. It's fine. It's fine. It is a good game. Don't get me wrong. I'm not. I'm not trying to knock the game. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, there was no backward. Okay, cool. Hundred and four. I just doubled my coin count. Do I need those for post game at all, or can I just blow them in the casino? You know? Ah, the music. Pause it and jump to the game. Yeah, you got it. Why? All five people abstained from voting. What did you say? What's going on? Didn't Kibo vote? <laughs> I'm relieved. <laughs> Why? Why is this? Okay. The world has changed. What? Huh? That's true. If Kibo refused to vote, that means the world has changed. It means the audience chose not to vote as well. That's it. Mostly need casino coins. Okay, cool. They rejected this killing game. I'm just saying I got like 600 mono coins that I just need to do something with. What is that? <laughs> what? <laughs> Serves you right. That's what you get for breaking the rules like that. Why? Hold on. Is that really okay? Danganronpa is going to end? This game full of tense standoffs and backstabbings among friends. Stop! It's just going to end up roughly with season 53. Is that really okay? Speaking of backstabbings, come here! Samugi! Um, hello? Game, hello? Game. Oh, people are leaving! What? In the background. Huh? Should I mute the video?
Should I mute? Should I mute the game right now? Should I mute the, the audio? No. Your words can't reach them anymore. You never appreciated us, and it looks like you didn't appreciate the power of fiction. Sorry, my 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 computer's buffering, so I just want to make sure that I'm not about to miss the video. Q. Let me um. Let me try to refresh this. It's getting late. My Wi-Fi kind of goes bad late at night, so it gets kind of crappy late at night. I'm gonna do this on data. No one wants to hear you anymore. No one wants to hear your sick, twisted stories anymore. Should I mute the audio? I can't tell. It's over. It's over. Sorry. This is it. I don't like that. Don't zoom in. Don't zoom in. Don't zoom in. I'm just gonna mute the audio just to be safe. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. This is lame. I'm sorry. Sorry, this is so lame. I'm sorry. We'll keep it playing in the background a little bit. Audio is cool. It's finished. <laughs> it really is the end, isn't it? <laughs> so what are we going to do now? Now that that's over, there's no need for any punishments. No, no. Ah, half ending. This is no way to end Dong and Rumpa. Yeah. No, it needs to end with a punishment, at the very least. Mm -hmm. I see. Hey. Now, if we continue to live after this, the choice we made won't really matter. People will just want another killing game, so. That's true. So the only way we can stop this killing game is to kill ourselves. Yeah. Got it. So let's just get it over with. Aww. It's just going to end with everyone being annihilated. I never expected an ending like that, so I don't have a punishment ready. Yeah. So let's just leave it to Kibo. Yes. All right, I'll do it. I'll be the one who ends this killing game. I'm just gonna mute it. I don't trust. I don't trust myself, and I don't trust that my chat is actually showing me what people are saying. Um. Sorry, guys. My internet just craps out late at night, so. I just want to make sure that I'm not going to miss it. We'll bring this fiction to an end. The video or this one? It's the will of the outside world. I have a good bit more time. Okay. Let me know when it's coming up. Sorry. I just can't see chat for a minute there. Let me know when it's, when it's about to happen. Okay. Yeah, sorry. I'm just overly cautious. Destroy this entire fictional world and end the killing game. That is what the outside world wants. Put your butt on. Sorry, Kibo. I don't know why I said that to you. <laughs> I worked hard to keep this going for 53 seasons, and now it's all over. Well, that's fine. If this is a world without killing games, now. He says, this, let's end this. This is the will of the outside world. God, yeah. cool. I don't want to be a part of it. I have no interest in a world without Don and Rumpa. Mm -hmm. I guess this is it for us. No survivors. That's kind of a bummer. It's okay. But now it's all over. We're the last ones to suffer from the killing games. Okay. Come on, everyone. We should be proud. We were able to change the world in the end. Because? If this is all just fiction, then everything we've achieved up till now might be a lie. Those lies, they changed the world. Even if we are just fictional characters someone made up. That's it! We were able to change the world. Alright! You're right, I feel the same way. Shut up, Samugi. My plot plan was such a flawless copy, it even failed right at the end. So I should be able to hold my head up high! As a cosplay cat criminal, right? I hate you. Huh? A cosplay cat criminal. It's like a copycat Everyone. criminal, whatever. Very well, let's begin. 
Or rather, let's end this. This is the will of the outside world. All right, video time. Video time. Video time. Oh, Adam, I, Ryan already sent it to me in Discord. Thank you, though. Should I mute voice, too? I'm gonna mute voice just to be safe. Just to, just to be safe. We're gonna mute voice. I appreciate it, though. Thank you for being ready. Just in case. I don't know. We're just gonna, we're just gonna mute it there, just in case. Okay. Now we go out of here. Come to editor. We're gonna close the V3. We're gonna open up the desktop. Open up the desktop. Bada bing, bada boom, baby. Bye bye. Oh no, baby. What's uh in this coloring game, baby? Let's go. And then pause as soon as the video's over. Okay, I will do this. I'm ready. And you're right, I don't have to worry about about the things anymore. Samuga, Shuichi, Kimiko, and Maki will receive punishment. Time to destroy the Ultimate Academy! Garbage. Oh, bless the lord. Been waiting all game for that to happen. I don't want to watch everyone else die, though. We don't watch that. Is that the end of the video? Are we good? I just want to double check before I X out of the screen. That's the end of the video. Ban? Is that the end of the video? <laughs> I don't know what ban means. I jump straight to the credits. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Then let's put V3 back on and watch that happen again, shall we? I see. I see. I see the problem. Um, uh, um, uh, interesting. Okay, um, well, we're gonna go back to the Discord, and, uh, we're just gonna watch that now. Is that good? We're just gonna do the credits through that. Is that good? Okay, well, to the you guys should have said that before I did the thing. You didn't tell me that. If you had told me that, I would have been prepared. <laughs> That's fine. We all learn and grow together. It's fine. Oh, hold on. I accidentally paused Kibo. Hold on. Streamer isn't prepared. Oh, hush. We'll just give it a chance. We'll give it a chance. Maybe it will go. Maybe it'll give me a, th a, 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 a moment, a brief repose with which to do it. But if not, I apologize. Can I play the YouTube audio with the game? You're asking a lot of me here, Ryan. You're asking a lot of me here. I don't know if I actually can. I would have to...
cast. Oh my gosh, it's not even the names of the voice actors, it's just their names. Are the credits laggy too? I don't think so. Because they should just be audio, like, uh, like a... Oh, they are. Oh, that's weird. The credits are laggy too. That's weird. Okay, can you see the desktop? They are laggy, yeah. That's weird. Okay, we're just gonna do the video. Sorry, everyone. So, okay, so let's talk real quick. Um, I don't wanna, I don't wanna miss the ending, and I don't wanna make you guys all stick around to the end. Oh, 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 all their names are here. Look, they're all here. The whole gang. Sayaka, bless the Lord. Um, so, good ending. I'm, I'm intrigued by it. That was a very interesting way to end the series, at least for the time being, for the foreseeable future. Um, Kaito's grandma, Kaito's grandma, shut up. Interesting. I liked it. I liked it. I did. I, I liked it. Um, Kodaka, you crazy, crazy man. Um, overall, I like it. I'm not mad about it. I'm not mad about the ending. I think it's a very interesting ending. Um, the, the biggest thing that I can say about this game overall is that it is my probably my second favorite, and that ending made up for a lot of the flaws that I had early in the game, but um, my major problem I had with the, with the game overall, and I've expressed this a few times, but Adam, you might not have been here for it all. Um, I hate, it, it feels like a game of missed opportunities, which is a little bit symbolic given that, oh gosh, don't mute it, no, no, no. Gosh, what have I done? Oh gosh, it freeze, it froze, freaked out, it freaked out, it freaked out, hold on. There we go, I think I turned it on, I think I turned it down a little bit. Okay, I turned it down a number of ways, so that should be good. That should be fine. Um, well, th the problem that I have with the plot is not that the plot itself is bad. It's that they gave so many... I've expressed this to Adam or to Ryan a lot. They have so many really, really creative, clever ideas that are not explored and are just left hanging. And it bugs me so much because, first, you have the idea of... A female protagonist is cool in and of itself. And yes, she was a little too strong, and yes, I did like the twist that she was the killer, but um, it just felt kind of weird to just get rid of her immediately. Then you have the idea of the first blood perk is brought up. That's a really cool idea. That is a really, really cool idea that I wish was... And, and, and to be fair, that was the Mastermind's way of getting around, okay, we'll ignore that image, um, that's the Mastermind's way of getting around breaking the rules. That was a really clever idea, but it didn't come to fruition. The first Blood Perk would have been so cool to have a character just go, just be gone, and just disappear. That would have been so crazy cool. Um, then you get Chapter 2, um, nothing really crazy I feel like happened in Chapter 2 that upset me that much. It was a little weird, but it's fine. Um, then you get this idea of two killers at the same time. They bring it up, they're like, what happens if there is two killers at the same time? And Monokuma essentially says, well, the second one doesn't matter. They don't count. That is a fascinating idea. And I wish so badly that they had brought that into play, that Karekio had in fact killed Tenko and did not get punished for it, and that Angie's killer was a different person. That would have been fascinating to have someone who didn't just attempt to kill someone or didn't just kill someone in the past, but who literally killed someone in front of everyone's face and died, and didn't die, I mean, for it, and is just now in their midst. Do you know how cool that would have been? Um, chapter 4. Um, I'm gonna pay attention, hold on. Oh, stop. Oh, stop. What are you doing to me, game? Jump to the game after? After this? Oh, 
in the resurrection motive. Dude, if that had been a thing, I would have been so down with that. I would have been so down with that. So freaking down with that. Dino Rebel 53. Okay. Can I, can I go back anyways now? Should I go back now, Ryan? Team Dangaropa employee badge. Shut the freak up. Variety cushion. The freak to each their own roulette? What the freak is happening? Okay, we'll go back to the game now. It'll be laggy. It'll be slow. But, uh, whatever. Yeah, that's super slow. Okay. Well, it's fine. It gives us more time to chat. Um... Here's the thing, though. The Resurrection Ritual, sure, it doesn't, it, it's very clearly not real, but nothing in this game has ever been super realistic, you know? Like, the idea that a high school fashionista could take over the entire world and cause the apocalypse is so ridiculous in and of itself. And, frankly, I just came out of playing Ultra Despair Girls when I started this game, so the idea of the supernatural and ghosts and things like that happened. It happened. It's fine. It happens. It is what it is. Um, I'm okay with it, because it happened before. Kamara was possessed. Why can't they bring back someone from the dead? Um, yes and no. I mean, yes, I understand where you're coming from, but I, I just think it was a cool idea that wasn't explored more, you know? If they're going to bring in a ridiculous thing like that, don't make it the motive, you know? And then they bring up the idea of the dog, the, 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 the cage dog ritual, and that doesn't come to fruition, right? They bring up the idea of two killers, that doesn't come to fruition. Kokichi comes in and says, what happens if we tie a vote? Then what happens? That doesn't come to fruition. Nothing happens with that, right? Kokichi's all like, it's just, it's just, there's a lot of things. Is that a DR0 thing, Dirt Squirrel? That might be a DR0 thing. Because she's also another, she's also like the ultimate analyst or something. I, I don't remember. Um, but it's just, there's so many really, really, really cool ideas that I've wanted to see the entire series that didn't come to fruition, right? I've wanted to see two killers at the same time. I've wanted to see what would happen if a killer got away with things. I've wanted to see if everyone, uh, like I've wanted to see like the idea of, someone not voting at a class trial and i'm glad they finally did that i will say the whole series i've been saying i'm waiting for someone not to vote at a class trial i am glad about that i'm glad that they finally did that i've been talking since chapter two of the first game that i want to see that happen it happened i'm glad i just feel like overall v3 is a really solid game and has a good story and the plot twist at the end was fascinating i did not see that coming i loved it it was great um there was just too many missed opportunities on the way for me to call it my favorite game. Um, and the character cast, I feel, was a little bit weaker than DR2, in my opinion. You can like who you want to like. Um, but there were too many characters that just felt kind of uninteresting and bland to me, or that I just straight up disliked. Like, Kokichi, I hate him. I don't understand him. I'll go on my rant when I do my character tier list. Um, Ryoma, Kirumi, um, uh, Tanko, um, Angie, Karekio, all of them are all kind of eh, you know? They're not bad characters, but they're not good characters either. They're just kind of there, which is how I feel about most of the DR1 cast as well. Uh, the only characters I truly dislike in this game were Kokichi and um, Samugi, which points for her being the ultimate cosplayer points for that like she does have some points i think i'm still gonna rank her really low on my tier list but points for doing that um i respect the plot twist yeah no i totally respect it i respect it so much it's a really ballsy choice i think it was a really good idea and i think they handled it pretty darn well i think i, I like that they didn't just say oh there's these two games and the anime and this is the one that follows it up but they said no 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 there's been 52 of these. This is the 53rd one. We're dealing with it. Um, d do what you will with that. That was interesting. That was really cool. V3, that was a really cool idea. I like that a lot. I, I have some gripes with it, 
because that's not how Roman numerals work, but I, I'll give him credit. It's it's creative. It's very creative. I like it. Um, but yeah, overall, good game. Really good game. I think I'm most excited to watch other people do this game now, you know? I'm most excited to be able to not be afraid on the subreddit. That's really what I'm most excited for. But, um... I don't know. It's good. It's good. It's my second favorite, definitely. It definitely is 2v3 Ultra Spare Girls 1. Um, just because I think Ultra Spare Girls has slightly better writing and more interesting characters. Oh yeah, and it's so stupid, too. It's such a stupid twist, but I love it. It's so funny. <laughs> like, um, it's great. Shout out to Priscilla for solving that one for me. Thank you. I would have gotten there, but it would have taken me embarrassingly long, so thank you. Um, it's, it's weird. It's bittersweet. It's bittersweet to be done, you know? It's bittersweet. Talking about employee badge, variety cushion. To each their own roulette. Easter egg. Oh, shut up. You must save the game before you can use the clear data bonus. We strongly recommend that you save the game. Why would I not save the game? Why would I not save the game? We've done it. We've done it. Let's uh, fix our settings really quick. Hello? Aim, hello? Hello? Aim, hello? Oh gosh, darn it. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I can't go into options. Are you freaking kidding? Oh no, I can't. Hold on. I actually can't go into options. I am going to throw... I'm going to throw my computer out a window. I cannot go into options from this. This is stupid. Okay. Are you okay? Yeah, somehow. I'm sort of stuck here. Someone help me out. Gosh, freaking darn it. Gosh, freaking darn it! Oh, it's okay. That's what we'll do. Let me go. Careful. I'm saved. We made it. How are we saved? Why are we still alive? Why are we alive? Wonder. Killing game is over. Class trials are over. This fictional world is over. So then, where are we? Should I just do that? Should I just do that, guys? Okay, hold on. I can't... Here's the problem. I can't access that. It will take forever. Like, you thought it took forever to load up Discord? It will take forever to load up Twitch on my thing and get that can you send that to me in discord ryan or adam can you send that to me in discord because it will it will not work to do it on on twitch my option was i'm just going to click through it and read it and then i'll go back and watch it in the bonus area because i'll have a ton of mono coins i'll just go back and click that scene is that fine Or do we care enough that I should just go watch it in Discord? Alright, hold on. Let me open up Discord. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Go to Adam. Click the thing. Ten minutes? What the freak? Do you like the voices? Okay, we'll do it. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. I'm dumb. Hold on, I'm sorry. Hold on, I'm dumb. Hold on, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Okay, we're good, we're good. Sorry, I almost forgot, but we're good. Are you okay? Yeah, somehow. I'm sort of stuck here. Someone help me out. Himiko, careful. Yeah, I'm saved. We made it. 
three. Hey, how were we saved? Why are Maybe we still four. alive? Uh, yeah, why are we alive? I wonder. No, Kiba's dead. He exploded. Never mind. Killing game is over. The class trials are over. And the fictional world is over. So then, where are we? Another fictional world after the fiction has ended? What's left for us here? Everyone's killing game, closing ceremony. We were silent for a long while, staring into the other side, where we continue to hope, and they continue to torture us. The outside world. 53 times hope moved forward. 53 times the suffering continued. The world on the other side of the fiction, the real world. So, what do we do now? We didn't think of a plan for what to do after. I thought that was the end of us back there. But we survived. And that's the truth. Okay. It seems as though we really don't have a choice. We can't stay here anymore. Hey. But I don't get it. Seriously, how are we still alive? When this world destroyed itself, I thought we'd go down with it. You're right. Kiba probably saved us. Hmm. He made sure we didn't die. Why? But why would he do that? There's no point in us escaping to the outside world. We're just fictional characters. Did Kiba save us because he was acting on what the outside world wanted? No. Then maybe this is what the outside world wanted. Yeah. For us to live? Okay. That's right. In addition to ending all this, the outside world wanted us to live. I suppose the outside world wanted this lie to become the truth. <laughs> so come on, everyone. Let's head outside with confidence. One more thing. That was another missed opportunity. They said they were going to go down to two. Now, I'm glad they didn't go down to two. But, um... Again, something they brought up and didn't ever address. Didn't ever finish with. They they addressed it, and they were like, oh yeah, you gotta do this, but then they did. I like what they did instead, don't get me wrong. Remember, The outside world is waiting. I just think it's interesting that they never do what they say they're gonna do in this game. Mm. To the outside world, huh? I wonder what kind of world it is. <sighs> Peaceful world with no fighting and no despair. That's what Samugi said, right? Mm. Although I guess that is kind of the point of this game. She wasn't lying because everything is a lie. It might be a lie. Because. Remember the last thing Samuki said? <laughs> you would fail right at the end. Cosplay cat criminal, right? <laughs> Not to the degree that V3 did it, though. I don't remember, like. That was me. She must have been copying someone, right? What does that mean? We can talk about it in a second. What indeed? What did you, you don't know? But Well, I have some theories. A game theory! Perhaps Hope Speak Academy and the Remnants of Despair really exist. Maybe Samugi was just basing her performance on them. Hey. So Samugi lied about this whole world being just fiction? What did you say? A surprise ending? No. No, I don't really know for sure. She might have been lying when she said copy. Hmm. If she were telling the truth, then it would make sense that that was a lie. What? What do you mean, that? That's... What Samuki showed us, the way we were when we first arrived. Huh? What am I wearing? Oh my gosh, Adam. Okay, so... Oh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You guys are ready? I get what you're saying. Don't get me wrong. I get what you're saying. I guess that's just our own perspectives. Like, I'm okay with that. You're not. 
you're okay with this game and what it does, and I'm not. It's All fine. Right. <laughs> I mean, that's a fair point. You make a fair point. But... I still don't believe it. I just can't believe that any of us would volunteer for this. But I did I did complain about Kyoko. Mm. Kind of the same thing. I forgot everything about her old styles after that first flashback light, didn't I remember correctly. Oh, to the end of B3, not the whole thing. Okay. So what you said, it's not even bugging me about that. Even if we were obsessed with this killing game, I still can't believe we would participate in it. I just, I don't believe it. <laughs> but I don't really have any logic behind that. What? One of Kaito's hunches, huh? What's the point? Anyway, there's no way for us to check when we apply to the Academy, right? Uh, okay. Yeah. Oh, we can't check? So in the end, we still don't know what was true or not. Stop. You gotta- stop, you gotta give me something. The fictional world ends here and the real world lies out there. Perhaps just beyond here is the truth. But maybe it isn't. Don't tell me. Maybe it's all still fiction in that world, or... Maybe Danganronpa still continues in that world, or... <laughs> Maybe the outside world is the same as this world. Might be a world filled with lies. Hmm. Well, if we can get out from here, we'll know for sure. But... Yeah, but I feel like there's not too much meaning in truth and lies. What do you mean? Hmm. I mean, even if something is a lie, even if it's fiction. Remember... It if it has the power to change the world, then it must contain some kind of truth. I just assumed that was a flashback light scene. Aren't we proof of that? Aww. In this fictional world, we overcame all these fictional struggles. But those things changed us. It's right at the very beginning of the game. Change the world. So it doesn't really matter where the truth ends and where the lies begin. If lies can change the world just as here's what here's what I see it as, Ryan. Here's what I see it as. They go, they were accepted, they were excited. Then the mono kids and the mono the mono cubs and the monokuma and the, the producers and everything said, Okay, we're gonna wipe your memory, we're gonna start you with a clean slate, you're not gonna remember anything. Then Then they all lost their memories. And then it started with the kidnapping and the this and the that and everything. Um I don't know. Yeah, it's just different ways of interpreting it, but I see that as being the explanation. If it was true that they wanted to do it, which I don't have enough, what was the truth, I can't, I can't make an a decision on that yet. Just another way of telling the truth. Some lies can lead the world to hope. Some truths can lead the world to despair. Like this right with friends. So I don't think anyone can really say which is more right in the end. My baby. That was Kamaru. That was Ka was that not Kamaru? Yes, it's not important whether it's the truth or a lie, just what it leads to. Okay. Yeah, that's what I believe. I'm gonna pop. That was Kamaru. I swear that was Kamaru. We stand with one foot in fiction and one foot in reality. Then we need to see for ourselves whether this fictional world has changed the outside world, and what we can do from this point on. You're right. We can't stay in this fictional world forever. It's already over. We gotta take all the experience we earned in this world and go on to the next. Yeah. Let's go. We'll see what this world gained and what it lost and all the rest. Let's find out together. I want them to do something new. To the other side of this world. To the other side of fiction. Let's find out, together. It's what we could accomplish. <laughs> the story lives on. I'm sure, even now. Even on the other side, it lives on there as well. And thus, the story lives on. Was this lie able to change something? Why would you buffer right there? Was this lie able to change someone? Was this lie able to change the world? If it was able to change even the smallest thing.
then the story isn't over. Hold on, hold on, let me explain myself, let me explain myself, hold on. The end. Wow. Wow, okay. So here's what I mean by that. What I mean by that is I don't want them to do something different in, like, the sense of let's totally change the game, let's do more with Danganronpa. I mean, I want them to do something, yeah, something like another killing game, but it's not necessarily Danganronpa, right? Like, I, I just want something similar to Danganronpa, even if it's not necessarily the actual Danganronpa itself. You know what I'm saying? It's interesting that they won't let me go to the menu. That sucks. Zero's gave the death game. Yeah. Dungeon World was great. No, it is really good. I think I'm good with it for now. I think it's not a series that's meant to be binged, honestly. And I'm glad I took a break between 2 and Ultra Spare Girls. Um... I had about a month's worth of a break, and that was nice. About two months' worth, almost. That was nice. I needed that, because I would have burnt out completely by the end of this game had I not done that. Um, it, it's one that is to be appreciated, I, f I feel like, in more of a game at a time kind of a thing. One and two lead very well into each other, and that's great. Um... I think I feel like, yeah, that's fair. That's fair. Waiting a long time would suck, but I do eventually, I've talked about this. I want to do a, I have a YouTube channel. I've been putting stuff out on that. Um, once my brother gets up here near me, which I assume he's going to, his plan currently is to come to school up here. Once he comes up to school up here, uh, we are going to, I'm going to play these with him. We're going to do them for YouTube. I'll play the whole series with him. I'll do the whole thing. The anime, everything, etc., etc. And but we're gonna record them. I'm probably gonna give us a break in between recording each game. Not like a long break, but like a couple weeks, you know, to, to let the game settle, let the characters work, let you figure out how you feel about it. Because I still don't really know how I feel about this game. It is it is way 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 too soon for me to have a strong opinion about it. Overall, I think I'm. As a whole, the game underwhelmed me. But as an individual thing, like as a whole, meaning like you have the whole series in consideration, it was underwhelming for me. But in the context of just this game alone, it is brilliant. I think it is a brilliant ending. It is a really good writing. Um, I wish they didn't have quite so many missed opportunities throughout the game, in my opinion, but... Overall, great game, great characters, great, great story, very interesting. Shuichi is my favorite protagonist of the whole series. I've said that. Um, I love Shuichi. I think he's very interesting. Overall, let me just run through the game really quick. Just each chapter. If you guys care to listen, feel free to. If you don't, you can leave. Um, I'll talk more about the characters later. But basically, chapter one, good start, interesting plot twist. Kaede being the killer and killing Rantaro was fascinating. Very, very cool. Um, and it's cool that it all kind of came full circle at the end. Chapter 2, Rantaro's death, Kirumi's motive, kind of weak. Rantaro and Kirumi, not Rantaro, Ryoma. Ryoma and Kirumi just kind of felt weird. It was just weird. It just, it, it's fine. It's very Danganronpa to be like, oh, look at this complicated plan and blah, 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 blah. Um, but it just feels, you know. It just feels weird. It's a weird motive. It's a weird... It's Everything about it's weird. Um, chapter 3, my probably my least favorite chapter. Angie was super annoying. Um, Correctio was super weird. It was so obviously not Himiko as the killer. This was the second trial in a row that they ranked her as the killer, and it just felt very, very overused. It's just like, guys, just please stop. Um, lots of missed opportunities. Probably the weakest chapter, in my opinion. 
Chapter 4, I liked the virtual world, but I thought it dragged a little bit because we had to re-explore everything and it felt very boring and lame. Uh, Kokishi, that was when I started hating him, we'll get into that. Um, but very emotional ending to the trial, going to... had a nice send-off, I think. Uh, chapter 5 annoyed the crap out of me, but it was a good character. Like, objectively, it was a good chapter, but subjectively, it annoyed the crap out of me because it's centered around Kokichi and I hate him, and he just drove me nuts. Um, and then the ending, I, I have mixed opinions about I'll need more time to think about it. Ultimately, I think I feel about this game the same way that I feel about Kokichi, where they paint so many things as truth and so many things as lies that there's really no way for me to know what I'm supposed to know and what I'm supposed to think and what I'm supposed to feel. And in my opinion, that's not super great storytelling. I think Kokichi is a weak character because once you set him up as a, as a compulsive liar who never tells the truth, then you can't believe anything that comes out of his mouth, and then any kind of character development that he has could very well be a lie, and there's no way to know whether it is or not unless you talk directly to the person who wrote him. And I don't like that. And I feel like the ending of the story kind of turned into that almost, where it's like, what was true? What was the lie? Are you real? Are you fake? Are you people who wanted to do this? Did you not want to do this? What are you? What is anything? And that part doesn't sit well with me. But the idea of it all being fictional and the idea of them kind of being a meta commentary on the game was super cool. I really, really like that. Um, overall, amazing series. We're not done with it. Monday, Tuesday morning, I'm probably going to stream the last of the three time events. The rest of the week I will be gone. I will not be streaming. I'm going to be busy. Um, and then the next week I'll stream probably every day in the morning. Um, which, sorry, Adam, I know that doesn't work for you, but I will stream probably every day in the morning and I will f do as much of the talent plan as I can get through as well as explore some other things and, and just have some fun with it and then Saturday I will do my final Danganronpa stream wrap up my thoughts of the whole game wrap up my thoughts of all the characters do my character tier list, my waifu tier list and my like favorite chapters and stuff and we'll talk about it so thank you guys for being here I know you're all tired, go to bed I don't even know if you guys stuck around for this little rant um I would not blame you if you didn't. Just go to sleep. You're all tired, boys. And, uh, I will see you guys on Monday, hopefully. Talent plan, you actually have to play a different RPG like mode to actually unlock characters. Watch your video. Can you send it to me in Discord? What video is it? Oh, you did? Okay. What the frick is this? Okay, is this the RPG mode? I will, um... Is the RPG mode fun to watch? I'll do that on my own, if it's not fun to watch. Salmon team is FTEs. Okay, cool. And then talent plan, I have to do the RPG mode to get to the characters. Okay. I don't want to drop all my money on this right now. I kind of want to drop all my money on this. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll do one or two streams of it. I won't necessarily play through the whole thing on stream. If it's something that I'd be better doing on my own, I'd probably just do that. But um, while while uh, while this while this loads, hold on. I want to I want to I want to really quick. I want to look at all these. I really like these. I think they're fascinating. Aito. Look at his design. Ryoma. Okay, I'll look at the video first so you guys can go to bed and then I'll look at everything else. That's what we'll do. Um, I don't want to waste your guys' time. Um, I'll just close V3. Hold on. I'll just close V3 really quick. Um, this will take forever if I don't. Look at this man-child. I'll close this really quick. I'll look at all this on my own time. I didn't say 
Um, whoops, let's save. Let's do that. Nope, can't do that. Okay, well, oh well. Whoops. Game over. GG. Go do this in my own time. Let's, um... Let's look at his video when all your waifus are dead. Great. At the very least, I'm gonna be with Kaido once again after Minoki Mikoto. Should I watch the whole thing? Or just from here? Well, no, nope, that's not gonna happen, but we can't have two protagonists dying on us, so I'll just kill someone else instead. Not the middle? Okay, we'll watch from the beginning. Here we go. Okay, here we go. I can't believe Ka'e Day is now Ka'e Day. She was supposed to be my one true waifu for this game. Oh well. Guess I should go look for a new waifu now. <laughs> Maybe I should try Kirima. Kirima. <laughs> girl left in this group. 11,037 free time events later. Alright then, Kirima. Now that you are my Mado for life, would you also like to be my new waifu? I'm sorry, Saki. Saki? Is this what you call him, Saki? Japan. The entire great nation of Japan. <laughs> For you see, Saki, I am the prime minister of the Kawaii Little Wiz country. Also, I kinda killed Riona so I could escape, so I gotta go now. Bye. Oh no, you <laughs> fucking don't. <laughs> Of time, but what the fuck am I supposed to do now? Don't you worry, Saki. Aqua says that I shall be your new waifu. Uh, I guess I have no choice. At the very least, you have a dark skin, so you will probably survive. Who <laughs> was execution my least favorite? I think it's I think it's the gruesomest one in my opinion. It's the only one that made me physically cringe. Fuck? Just when I was beginning to like her. Hey, I are you degenerate sock? I'll be your waifu. What? Didn't you yes. say you hated men or some shit? Well, it looks like someone here didn't do all of my free time events or probably just doesn't know how to read between the lines. Yes. So now let me be your yes. waifu. Yes. Thank you. Okay, sure, I accept. You better not die on me. Oh, what the shit, you folk were cunt. Why the fuck did you kill her? She was just about to become my waifu. Coo, 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 coo. I killed her because she was nothing more than a filthy thought. Just. Okay, that's my roommates. Like Angie. What? How dare you call them fucks? Listen to yourself, Sucky. This search for waifus is slowly but surely turning you into a cock. You must never let these filthy thoughts take control of your heart, for they will definitely betray you in the end. If your heart truly yearns for love and affection, then it will only be able to find them within your own blood. Huh? What the fuck are you talking about? In other words, incest is wincest. <laughs> Oh, what the shit, I think this is worse than incest. Can you be my waifu instead? What no go fuck yourself hands off my sister you filthy little thought loving. <laughs> you fucking virgin. Okay, enough of this shit. Just die already you cuck lord. Uh, this feels really nice. Uh, now I'm dead lol. What the fuck do you want you filthy fuck? Don't try and ask me to let you be my waifu. Don't be such a cocksucky. I only came here for your sweet antenna. What? Beautiful. No. Don't you fucking dare touch my antenna. Well, too fucking bad. I'm gonna give your antenna a good suck now. Oh my god. <laughs> fuck, I came and hit too hard. <laughs> At the very least, I'm gonna be with Kaido once again after Minokuma kills me. Well, no, nope, that's not gonna happen, but we can't. Not going to happen, buddy. So I'll just kill someone else instead. Hey Ganta. I have a hot little surprise for you. Oh, rude. Now Ganta dead. Lol.
<laughs> Yo there sucky my bro, why do you look so depressed? Ugh, Kaito bro. I've been trying to look for a new waifu, but I just can't find one without somebody that- I know where this is going. I see. Well why don't you try asking Cunty Roll to be your waifu? What? It's why did you change the name? So I'm sure nobody else will die. Nah bro, she'll just circumcise my antenna hair. <laughs> and besides, maybe I should stop looking for waifus. Maybe I should. Look for husbandos. Do you get what I'm saying, bro? <laughs> oh, um, I get it, bro. I just never thought you would be interested in that kind of relationship. Don't you fucking dare say I'm my husbando. If you try anything, then I swear on my dead parents, I'll circumcise your fucking shitty antenna hair and shove it down your fucking throat, you fucking piece of shit cunt. Oh boy. Oh boy. You die have the weirdest boner right now. <laughs> Let's go like the new rocket ship Monokuma made for me. Oh, this is a pretty nice ship. Oh no. <laughs> Stop, rude. I see that now, Mito. Ouch. Now Keitomi Mota, Luminary of the Stars, is dead. Lol. Alright guys, it is finally the 6th chapter of this game. Let's go and kill the mastermind who is probably gonna end up being Junko again cause it's always her somehow. With Kokichi. What the fuck is a Kokichi? It sounds like a shitty sex toy. Let's just focus on the mastermind for now. <laughs> Wait. Sinmugi. There is something that I have to tell no, you. No, 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 no. Ever since Kaeda died. I've been trying to find someone else to replace her as my waifu. And now that you, the magical Lolly, and that killer cunt are the only girls left, I have no other option but to make a decision. And my decision is to ask you to become my waifu. Oh, Saki. That is very sweet of you. But unfortunately, I am the mastermind. What? No way. <laughs> This is a joke, right? Nope, she's telling the truth. She is the mastermind, and also the killer of Rantaro. Rantaro! That means I killed Kayada for no reason. No way. Kayada had no reason to die? You filthy cunt. How could you do that? Like I said before, I am the mastermind. I can do whatever the fuck I want. I got a fish. Now I'm gonna kill everyone except you, Saki. Wait, what, why? Well, I kinda want to do a different killing game now, and I'm already sick of your characters. <laughs> of course, that excludes you, Saki. I'm keeping you alive because you are the perfect boy toy material. Wait, really? If that's the case, why didn't you say so earlier? Honestly, I really don't fucking care what happens to the rest of these fuckers. And also, I've always considered you to be the second best girl after Kai. No, 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 so no, 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 you really are a cock. And here I thought you would try to get revenge for all the shit I've put you and your friends through. But fine, whatever. This result also satisfies me. You fucking traitors. How could you say such things? That's it. I'm gonna blow this entire <laughs> Wait, no, Kimbo, that is a joke. I own our bitches. <laughs> <laughs> Kaido at the very end. Beautiful. Now I'm dead. Wow. Ha ha. The best boy Kokichi is still alive, baby. False. That is a fucking lie. False. He's the worst boy. Um, Cuttlefish, I would just like to say um, that one, one thing before I end the stream. Um, Shuichi is a yummy boy. And that is canon. And if you want to understand, you gotta watch the stream. But uh, that was it. Thanks for uh, thanks for joining me. Ryan, go sleep. Adam, go sleep. Cuttlefish, I don't know what time zone you're in. I think it's after me. Go sleep. Um, thank you all for being here. Monday, we're gonna do some free time events. Tuesday, we're gonna finish them up, and then it'll be good. Um, was he eaten? No, 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 no. Um, it, it's very complicated. It's a very complicated thing to explain, but basically, um, 
just chewy cheese yummy. That That's important to know. I'm going to probably highlight it on my stream because it was the hardest I've ever laughed at anything in my life. Um, thanks for coming in. Thanks for popping in. Everyone, goodbye. Have a good night. I love you all. Oh, you have a clip? Awesome. Yes. Great. Bye.